going on? Thank you for joining me this evening on Rockfall Island. I'm so glad to know I'm not the only one that has been encaptured, along with our only Claire Redfield as well. I mean, I won't wish anything on you guys, but I mean, you know, if we're going to be captured, we might as well kind of all be here together to uh, to figure this shit out, right? Well, thank you for joining me this Saturday evening. It's always awesome to have you guys uh, here hanging out with me. As always, thank you very much. Uh, how are we all doing, by the way? How's our weekend going? Do let me know. Don't want to get in the way of little Steve's little bicep just there. But yeah, guys, we are chilling for the first time with Resident Evil Co. Veronica on the channel. So I've always kind of backed away from actually streaming this game, at least for kind of the near future. I was a bit like, oh, I've been real hesitant about streaming this one because um, Leo Mendoka, thank you for subscribing uh, over on the tubes. Thanks for subscribing there. Uh, to the channel man welcome on in the merchant welcomes you uh, but yeah um i've been like real uh, hesitant about streaming this one because i always think i i think i'm sure like some of you guys can agree i think it's definitely a tricky uh, resident evil in the series i really uh, think it's a tricky title and i've actually not completed this in years i i completed this years ago with one of my best mates charlotte she is more um fluent at this than i'm she's she gets through this uh, a lot smoother but um yeah, so, like I say, uh, I will need you guys. You'll have to have my back with this one. So I will warn you, I'm not the best on Code Veronica, but I will absolutely do my best with, um, you know, preserving that ammo and hopefully not backtracking across areas too many times. I'm hoping I can keep it a pretty uh, smoothly-ish flowing stream. Hopefully we can uh, make some decent progress tonight. We will be in for quite a lengthy stream because um, no early get up tomorrow, I'm afraid, uh, with the um, current storm here in the UK. Um, it's left um, a lot of places like pretty waterlogged, including the field that my car boot uh, is held on usually. So, um, yeah, there's no car boot in the morning, so we can stay up late tonight. Uh, but yeah, thank you to you guys um, for, for stopping on in. Uh, who we got? We got over on the tubes, we got Mr. Tibbs, the first one in. Welcome on in, man. He said, now this I'm excited for. Yeah, you know what? As, you know, as tricky as I find this title, I am mega excited to stream it with you guys. It really is a classic Resident Evil. Um, man, myself and I'm sure lots of you guys and many other um, RE fans, we are screaming for a remake of this. It, it is urgently needed, I think, uh, you know, to be the next remake. But I, I do believe Resident Evil 5 will be the next one. Let me know your guys' thoughts, but I, I believe so. Uh, we've got Lou's Weird World. What's going on, man? I hope you're all good, Lou. Thanks for stopping on in. We've got Kingzilla spamming the holster emojis. Thank you, man. Uh, we will have more uh, incoming because I've currently got my mate Sil on the uh, on the case. So he's currently um, doing some um, custom emojis for us and animations, things like that. Uh, but yeah, they, they will be uh, incoming to, uh, you know, as perks for your guys' um, subscriptions. Uh, Jane, welcome on in. And James Davis, great to see you, man. I hope you're well. I hope uh, everyone's doing all good tonight. Uh, yeah, weekend's going good, thank you, Lou. Um, literally, I, I chilled a little bit earlier. Um, I watched Saw 3, because I'm kind of in the middle of going through like the Saw movies and the Friday the 13th movies, because uh, I saw, I watched Saw 10 at, at the cinema the other week. I absolutely loved it. Uh, just before that, I uh, I watched the very first Saw movie, and like, like I've mentioned on previous streams, I forgot how iconic it was. I was like, oh man, once I started watching that, and then obviously I've seen Saw 10, I'm just like, you know what, I want to watch through like the rest of the series. Like they're, they're very um, addictive. Uh, so yeah, I, I um, completed, um, finished watching uh, Saw 3 earlier. So I, like after stream, I'll most likely start watching Saw 4. Um, and then I, I, I was half an hour into um, Friday the 13th Part 5. And I was like, I've, I've got to finish that before I start watching anything else, you know. So I, I watched the rest of that. Absolute classic uh, slash. I absolutely love um, both those series. And next it will be i, I need to start re-watching re the nightmare on elm street as well i actually got the, the box set of that from the car boot um it was only like a couple of quid as well um i'm sure it was um i picked up a few of them because i used to trade them in cx but the value has gone down by the way i'm sure it's only like a five a credit or something in cx but they, they used to be banging for credit the uh, nightmare on elm street uh full box set stevie t welcome on in man i know there's no car boot for us tomorrow is the stevie is a uh, fellow streamer local to me and uh, goes to the same cab as well it's always nice to see stevie uh, so plan to go to clean instead uh, on monday for a nice walk i hope that goes well for you man i hope the weather uh, stays good uh, for you uh, amanda welcome on in said i'm so excited for this me too we've had a lot of requests to stream uh our eco veronica so we will get cracking on uh, very soon and get into the game um ian welcome on in said uh this game's brilliant do you think capcom will do a next gen remake um, yeah, I was just saying that. I, I think they'll push this back. Um, I think RE5 will be the next remake. Um, but I do think Code Veronica is uh, definitely the most deserving 
it should be next in line but i i think they're just going to do what they typically do just just delay it you know keep us uh, keep us hanging for it i think mr tips thank you man he said best advice to cut off you is use the knife and swipe downward hits multiple times uh, i have seen the knife used on this quite a bit actually um i will um definitely do that um thank you i'll make use of it uh, i'm not usually i can't really utilize a knife very well uh, in the resident evil i can do more the more the remakes i think it's the uh, the ogs i just can't um seem to yeah utilize them too good <laughs> not like the other uh, resi goats out there gamer welcome on in man said hope you're well good to see you play code veronica i'm sure i'm sure gamer you have been one of the many people who have uh, been asking um you know to to stream code veronica so we are finally here with it thank you guys for joining me on rockfort island so we obviously play as uh, our um the protagonist is uh, Claire Redfield. Um, she has been uh, in a search for her brother, Chris Redfield. She has been captured and is currently being held on Rockfort Island. I believe it's like around... Is it like around Paris or in Paris? It's like in some base around there. Um, so, yeah, that, that's where that's uh, kind of located. Um, so, yeah, I'm mega excited, guys. So, yeah, I'll get us into our uh, console gameplay. There we go. Let's load this up. Hell yeah, I'll get us live across all the platforms. It's a nostalgic, um... Proper nostalgic, uh, 360 style there. Yeah, this is Code Veronica X. Um, so this is the, the 360 port, basically. We are playing it on the Xbox Series X, but it's still, it's not been upgraded HD any further. It's just, this is the, uh, this is like the 360 port of it. There we go. You know what? I'm actually pretty warm. I'm actually pretty warm right now. I'll keep the hoodie on, though. So last thing I want is to uh, get all freezing, you know? I actually shared a, um... I shared a meme. Um, I think it's uh, I think it's Dexter from Dexter's Lab. He uh, he's, there's a picture of Martin Lewis. And he's like, I have failed you. And then uh, yeah, I, I shared that on a few of my sh socials. I uh, shared that saying, I'm sorry, Martin Lewis. I can't freeze my tits off any longer. The heating's gone on. But yeah, I had a little red bomb. Just finishing it off. Um, I had that with the, an Indian I've just had. That's right, guys. I have ordered. My cheeky vanilla ice chicken korma. I have been missed vanilla ice tonight. I was like, you know what? I need the perfect fuel before stream tonight because this is going to take it out of me, uh, this game. <laughs> so sick. Miss Khan, welcome on in. Teetzel, Magda. Good evening to you guys. I'm doing all good. Thank you very much. Mega excited, guys. Jump into Code Veronica. Uh, so we'll just check that. Um, yeah, audio's all good. Proper nostalgic menu sounds as well. It's so sick. Nice. So we'll go new game. The American Midwestern the American Town. Midwestern oh, okay, you're reading it. Okay, bro. You you do that. Claire Redfield, who arrived in Raccoon City to search for her lost brother Chris and a rookie police officer, Leon S. Kennedy, managed to escape from the city. But their ordeal was only a prelude of things to come. Three months later. Three months, man, since Ari 2. Here we are, guys, for Rock Four Island. Your identification number is WKD4496. <sighs> Welcome to your new home. <laughs> Her name is Claire Redfield. We caught her trespassing in our Paris lab facility 10 days ago. 
She apparently infiltrated the complex looking for her lost brother, Chris Redfield, one of the surviving members of RPD's famous STARS teams. Tell girls of Redfield that was instinctive. I love that moment. Bro flexing, bro got fucked up. If I were quick with the lighter, I could see outside. Alright, let's let's light up his uh, beautiful face. Guys, let me catch up with some of you. Thank you for stopping. We've got loads of people. We've got No Richard and Paul. Thank you for dropping the roses and the diamonds. Thank you very much. Let me show appreciation to you guys. Let's freaking go. First one's in of the night. Damo, thank you for the follow. I know this is uh, a lot of your guys, um, one of your favourite Resident Evils. And uh, people saying it's uh, also underrated as well. Um... But yeah, Miss Clown uh, says stay frosty. We will do. We absolutely will. Because I've, I've turned the heating off right now. Uh, Cyberguy69, thank you. Uh, first time chat on Twitch. Welcome on in. Uh, we've got um, Big Door plays video games. Thanks for being in, man. Uh, Mr. Tibbs, I will not be able to uh, get the A rank right now. I've got to really uh, get good at this game. That's the whole point of uh, uh, definitely me uh, streaming it. Uh, but yeah, um, Ken, thank you for being here. We've got Gillian, uh, Paul Brown, Spider Buzz, Jamie Beckwith, uh, Stephen Green, Gillian, Matthew, Seventh Guardian, Zante. Thank you guys for all stopping. I'm doing great. Thank you uh, guys for asking. Thank you so much for stopping in on your Saturday evening. Let's read this bollocks and just get rid of it. There we go. We, we know how to play to some sorts. All right, let's get that, uh, let's get that light up. Love the eerie music as well. Get out of here. This place is finished. 
I don't know, it might have been a special forces team. But in any case, this prison's been taken over. Troops have been wiped out. What are you saying? You're free to leave the complex. But you may as well know, you have no chance of getting off this island. And what about you? What are you going to do? Don't worry about me. What, what was that, um... <clears throat> yeah, that container he threw, is that his rides? I think bros did, ran out of rides. <laughs> Alright, I've got to remember, okay, so it's X to run. It's square to be to be looking at tanks. Got it. It's a list of prisoners. My name is at the end. WKD4496. Claire Redfield. She probably has WKD because that's what she loves having on a night out. Don't you reckon? I bet she's a proper blue wicked kind of girl. Don't you reckon? She'd definitely be on the Alco Pops. Either that or uh, even a Smirnoff Ice should be partial to. Don't you guys think? The escort's name is at the end of the document. Umbrella Medical Paris. Third Security Unit Leader. Rodrigo Juan Ravel. Don't think there's anything in this cell, it was just a... Uh... Oh, there is as well! Bruh, I thought this... I was... actually thought this cell was empty. We got uh, got some goodies in there. Nice, we'll take that. Yeah, some of you guys have advised using the knife. I'll, I'll try and use it where possible. I'm trying to get us too damaged, though. I'm sure, you know, you know these, um, like, especially the earlier zombies, don't they, um, like, respawn? They seem to kind of like respawn in some areas. Like that's what I think, like, based on my kind of re most recent little playthrough of it. But yeah, I played for like the first few hours or so. Um, but uh, yeah, I've not actually completed it in years. I heavily rely on one of my mates because she she knows it like the back of her hand. She's got a life now though, and I haven't. That's why I still play it and she doesn't. <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> I think so, Dan. I, th I do think Code Veronica is underrated, and I'm very guilty of that. I never kind of fully appreciated it until years later. Like, years later, man. So, truck used for transport. Oil is leaking from the crashed wreck. A dead body and a briefcase can be seen inside. I think we have to, uh, like, blow it up. So, uh, put the fire out, don't we, before we can uh, go investigate that. I absolutely love the vibes, by the way. Oh, there we go. Can we go grab that? Can we reach that yet? Or we gotta put the fire out? Uh oh. Yo, have we even got a hand on? <laughs> We've not even got, got one, you know. I don't remember even seeing one in the inventory. It's an absolute vibe, man. This cemetery is so good. Retro zombie noises. <laughs> Too good. <laughs> Let me just take the bites. Just bear with me. So in the um. Yes, come on, come on, go. Oh bollocks. I thought we could go get it, I don't think we can. Okay. Okay, bear with me. See how I am with this. Oh shit. See, that this is what happens, guys, when I use the knife. I told you, I'm gonna have to dodge you as best I can. Oh, bollocks. It's not an easy one, this one. I've got nothing to fight them with, you know? Get off, mate, get off, get off, get off. I always find there's no other way there, you know? No. Is that Steve-O on the turret? I'm sure it's him in it. Steve-O! Steve-O! Oh, it's minging down. It's absolutely minging. It, they did us dirty in that uh, graveyard, man. Over. 
Yeah, same thing happened with me on mine back. I was running around on uh, danger. Sorry about that little misunderstanding, but I thought you were another one of those monsters. Shut up! Make one wrong move and I'll shoot. I hate this guy. Relax, beautiful. I said I was sorry. My name's Steve. And he said I was sorry. <laughs> and I'm guessing you're not from Umbrella either. No, I'm Claire. Claire Redfield. Claire. Hmm. Nice. I'll remember that. Hey, I heard there's an airport around here. But once I find it, I can finally escape from this crazy island. Well, I'll see ya. Hey, wait up! I don't want you following me, lady. You'll only slow me down. Bro, he's such a douche. He just wants to be out here, doesn't he, on Jet 2. Do, 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 standing in a crowded room and I can see your face. We might as well use this, I think. It came free to us. It was in the cell. So Mr. Tips brings up a good point. I actually never knew this man. So Mr. Tips said, nice little attention to detail. The handgun will have three bullets missing after the cutscene. So I'm sure indeed it has, because if we had combined, get up to 15. That's crazy, man. I actually never noticed that in the past. Uh, Fluffs, welcome on in. Said so first time seeing this game. Excited to watch it all. Well, I will get through as much as I can tonight. Guys, it, this will not be uh, the smoothest uh, playthrough because I, I need to get good at this game. So we'll probably need a good few streams of this before I even get good. Hawks pitches carved into the hollow. So I'm sorry, guys. As Steve said, I said I was sorry. <laughs> But yeah, it's definitely, so we came in that door, didn't we? It's definitely a tricky, um, yeah, entry into the Ari series. It really is. Uh, yeah, same with me, Alistair. So I had a gameplay, um, I had a playthrough going like a few years ago. Um, but I got myself stuck at the, um, the tyrant uh, boss fight on the plane. Um, honestly, if you look at my inventory, you, you'd be like, how... Could, could you not make it past the boss and yes i was like activating the crates as well i, I kept inflicting ammo um you know uh, activating the crates to to push at the uh the tyrant still he would not have it he was absolute clinging he was he was literally doing a jessica man he was he was jet to his biggest fan standing in a crowded room and i can see your face oh bruh oh oh bollocks I'm gonna have to take some of these out i think Xanth said, love the vibe of this game. Me too, honestly. It's, it's a wicked game. It really is. Yeah, we're going to have to take a, a few of these out, I think. I'll try and utilise the knife. Like, you know, if we knock some zombies onto the ground, then I'll uh, see if we can get some cheeky stabby stubs in there. I've, I've, I've totally caught us in the kitchen. Can't do anything. get any stabby stabs and I'll try oh nice oh come on I think I've got the other guy as well look at me with the little stabby stabs come on even uh, Gordon Ramsay would be like uh, this zombie was fucking raw come on oh nice Oh my god, who is this gal? I don't recognise myself right now. Oh. Oh my god, come on. Thank you guys for encouraging me to use the knife. You've just instilled this whole new level of bravery in me. Come on. Katie, thank you for the follow. Appreciate you. Julie, welcome on in. This toilet has some rather disgusting stains. A horrible smell lingers. Yeah, that, that's literally what happened uh, with me, Mr. Tibbs. Like, I, I literally did real well with it, um, if I may say so myself. My gameplay was going so well up until... Um, I'll go up here first. Up until that tyrant uh, plane uh, boss fight. He said, uh, yeah, Mr. Tibbs said, the, the problem is, is the difficulty spike. You play absolutely brilliant, but end up in, you know, two or three moments with a dead game. You have to restart your entire playthrough. 100% agree with you on that. It's never like a, a steady ride, this game at all. Really isn't. So I, I do make a lot of regular saves. I did pass up on an ink ribbon earlier. I should have took that with us, really. I was being a bit cautious on the uh, 
the space. You know what? Yeah, I forgot how powerful the knife was, Mark. Max, the knife is so overpowered in this game. We'll, we'll be utilising it as much as we can. Gonna have to, man. I think in this one, I'm sure in this room we just make a run for it. Prisoner's Diary. May 13th. This room stinks of death. Based upon the information I've found, I believe that I'm far south of the equator. Lucky for me that Bob in the bunk below me is one of those interesting types of guys. May 16th. Today, Bob told some crazy story of why he was put this place with me. Bob said that he used to be an attendant of the head of this place. This boss named Alfred supposedly placed him in here because of a tiny little mistake. What does that mean? What's going to happen to me? May 20th. Without warning, a group of military men took Bob to the building behind the guillotine stand. At midnight, I'll sneak out of here to see him. <laughs> Hi, Bob. I've been hearing that anyone taken to that building never comes back. On top of that, there are these really large plastic bags constantly being removed from that place. I'd better pray for Bob. May 21st, I was wrong. I shouldn't have gone there. What is going on in there? All I could hear was some insanely creepy laughter and the sound of Bob screaming. I don't know what to do. I can't stop thinking about it. Is that going to happen to me? I can't let it. I just can't. May 27th, since my last entry, all of my fellow inmates have been taken to that building. I know that I'm next. It's obvious that we're all here to be used as Alfred's guinea pigs. There's no way out. What am I going to do? Well, we'll never know, bro, because you were that rude. You, you didn't even continue the diary. <laughs> but yes, I've, uh, I, I did see a previous comment uh, saying the Fallout bundle. The Fallout bundle, though. If we've got any Fallout fans in here, guys, I, I just really want to quickly show you. Um, yeah, my best mate, Alex, he sent me some um, belated uh, birthday gifts over. And, uh, oh, man, they're so sick. He got me, like, um, the Art of Fallout 4. Um, and then a couple of figures as well. The Feral Ghoul and Nate, the sole survivor. Uh, also a little crash, um, like, it's one of those little things that you get, like, a, a model in it or something, like a, a little crash crate. And then uh, Xbox and PlayStation water bottles. So I, I did promise him, I said, uh, when I, you know, next make a water on stream, I'll definitely uh, use those bottles. I've got the G Fuel right now, and obviously I use my uh, shakes for G Fuel. But, yeah, when we uh, when we have the water, those, uh, those bottles will come in handy. So, yeah, it's an absolute legend. Um... Whoa. Oh man, is there anything around there? Bollocks. Hang on. Oh shit! I th I'm sure there's something around here. I think there's some bullets actually. Get them quick! Get them, get them, get them! Come on, let's go, let's go. See if we can quickly uh, stabby stab the guy. Come on. Knock him to the ground. Yes, yes, yes! Come on. Ooh. Trying to get out. Whoa, 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 whoa. It's fine. It's fine. We good, we good. We have to make it round there for the ammo. I don't know if the best thing to do is to go round that corner first. Um, I wasn't sure if uh, I should have done that first. But, um, yeah. Right, have we picked anything up? This is rough, man. It is rough. We'll take, use one of them. Um... We've got that, got that. Um, can we just go back outside, I think? I think so. Jillian, thank you for sharing the live. Guys, all of the likes on the uh, stream are very much appreciated across the platform. So if you are hyped for Code Veronica, if you could drop us some cheeky likes, it would be massively appreciated. Thank you, guys. Oh, it's being dragged away by something. There is a big hole in the wire netting. There's a blood stain under the eaves. But yeah, guys, let me know how your weekend's going. You you guys all having a decent weekend so far? I know, right, Sam? I feel like I'm... Um, I just need a, a chopping board. I feel like I'm cutting these zombies, like... Preparing a gusto meal or something. A zombie burger or something, you know? Zombie con carne, zombie bolognese, whatever. I'm not going to say a zombie korma, because the only korma is my vanilla ice chicken korma. It is the best. I feel like I'm balling right now. Look at all the ammo we've got. Let me just knock this guy down, and then we'll, uh, we'll knife him. Oh. Man, he gets up fast. They can get up pretty fast. Nice. Oh, perfect. Man, that, that's helping massively, because I'm usually um, 
a bit further on in. Like, I do run a little low on ammo. It appears to be locked. I must release the lock first. Got it. What's going on, Twin Keepy? So my mum got me spent on two for decorating a living room. That is a fair trade-off, I'd say. What was you doing? Was you, like, wallpapering and stuff? to say <laughs> and then they said bro i would lick all the dirt and everything anything off the carpet for a, a copy of spider-man 2 so it's 60 quid isn't it i'm kidding <laughs> you know what guys i actually never planned on um never planned on buying uh spider-man 2 on lodge but what have i done i've given in and i have uh, got it on um i've got it on uh amazon um Prime, and it is going to be before 1 pm tomorrow, so I'm going to have a chill day on Spider Man tomorrow. So we take everything, um, we take the herb, can't we? It's not anything else. Please deposit any materials you have in the security box. Fish. I hate this where I have to get rid of all my shit. I hate it. Can we take it back now or not? Nah? Oh no, they're different, aren't they? I hate this, bruh. <laughs> Zan said I would sell my soul for a set of power armor from Fallout. Imagine, you could go around saying whatever you want to anyone. You could call them a prick if you want. They could not do anything to you, you know? <laughs> They'd twat you in it and just be like, dong, dong. <laughs> just deflect off it. You fucking can't. Dong. Come on then, Sam. Be awesome. Okay, so yeah, it's just about placing, obviously, you need like a material to place the machine. Do some three D printing, baby. Two right, Zanth. I totally create a faction that the holsterhood of steel. No, the holsterhood of bollocks, probably. <laughs> I know Miss Con. I I think um, I'd, I'd say Claire. She probably has like some. She's probably rocking the Doc Martens tonight. I reckon. <laughs> Scott Harrison, welcome on in. Hello, man. Um. So the difficulty spikes, Mr. Tib said, uh, yeah, the tyrant fight, then the Steve fight. Yeah, I, I definitely think the tyrant fight. I can't really remember anything um, from there onwards because that's the part I got stuck at and I've not completed the game for literal years. Uh, but yeah, that's definitely a difficulty spike part for me, that is. Um, Mr. Tib said, if you're going after the A rank, you're only allowed one save. The game gives you no first aid healing under four hours. It's insane. That is rough, man. That is absolutely rough. Th this is a long game, you know? This is a hella long game. Obviously, if you don't know kind of what exactly you're doing and you you don't just charge through it, it's, it's cray cray. Facts on the facility access application. Be sure to verify the content of the following facility access application form. Nearby apply for access permission for prison area D. Got it. Oh, yeah. Uh, TJ one time when we start to designate a briefcase. Yes, that's for the uh, 3D printing. I've always wanted to do some 3D printing. Hey, TJ was Zoe. <laughs> Steve. What are you doing here? My name's Steve. I hate this guy. Chris Redfield. Is he a relative of yours or something? You mean my brother? Ah. He's bro. Your siblings. Well, it seems your brother is under surveillance by Umbrella. What? I've got to contact Leon and tell him to let my brother know he's being monitored. It's a good thing I have access to an outside connection from here. Well, that file shows the latitude and longitude of this place. <laughs> Why don't you send your brother the coordinates and ask him to come help? Thanks. I'll do that. Hey. I was just kidding. There's no way he could get here, even if he is your brother. Yes, he can. I'm sure of it. Chrissy Redfield no can do way. anything. He won't come. You'll just end up disappointed if you rely on others. Believe me, I know. Steve, Chrissy Redfield is what, what you call a real man. Yeah, literally, what is Steve even all about? Fucking Steve. Steve O, Steve O. <laughs> yes! That's a little hawk emblem we need. Got it. Alright. 
Simon Sturr, thank you for the follow, man. I apologise, I, I, um, I missed your previous message, actually. Sorry, the chat's popping across the, the platforms tonight. Uh, it said, you are boss lady. Bro, I try. I try and be boss. <laughs> thank you, man. The door has been held by something that can't be opened from this side. It, obviously, Steve's biceps. Steve-o! <laughs> Fuck you, Steve-o. <laughs> Teetle, thank you for sharing the live. Massively appreciated. Please deposit any metallic items you have in the security box. Fucking hate that noise. Hate that, the sound of her voice, man. Okay, so um, obviously, I, I think we probably need to put them in. Um, I don't think we could even take the first aid, can we? Because of the can. Oh, bollocks. No need to be so dramatic. Well, what the hell? Because I have my own anyway. I've got our own little first aid here. Okay. Fucking drama queen. Alright then. Need to reset the thing. Can't do one playthrough where this bollocks don't go off, man. <laughs> What's going on, Chris Zombie? Zombie, zombie, zombie. <laughs> I'm doing great, thank you, mate. Thank you for stopping on in tonight. Alrighty. Martin, thank you for the follow. We'll take that, take that. Take that. Take everything back. Hell yeah. <laughs> you thought I was remixing uh, your name, Zam? In, in the zombie song. Imagine that. Zombie, zombie. I think that would, would go in it, you know? Rolando, thank you for sharing the live. Alright, I think we'll be able to uh, get in there now. Oh, guys, hope you're having an awesome... Does that blow up? Shit, hang on. Oh, shit! Fuck. Get it freaking... Oh! Beautiful. Get a little close, cause I'll. Uh... Oh man, these are strong. These are strong. Whoa, these are persistent, bruh. Oh man. I, just, I really don't want to take damage. I thought so. I had a feeling, man. We're on zero. There we go. So you get some knifey knives and. Come on, stabby stab. Oh, come on. Bro, you got to play the game. Come on. Don't hate the stream. I hate the game, baby. Come on. you got to do your thing. I don't know if you could blow that up or not. I can't remember. We need that, don't we? Yeah. Sounds good. Chris said, I'm also watching a YouTuber, uh, Ari2 at Longplay, where they take no damage. Hell yeah. My friend, Snooky Shogun. He is incredible. He's over on uh, Twitch and he's also got um, a YouTube channel as well. Please check him out, guys, if you love no damage runs. He is insane. He's done um, the original Ari trilogy, one, two, and three, all, all the way through no damage, like all in a row. Done a full-on run of it. He is something else, man. Hey, what's going on, man, Cave? Woo! Holy shit, who let the dog down? Oh, bollocks. Keep running. Just keep running. Don't slow down. Keep that booty running. That's it. We'll come back in and then we'll take him out. Oh, man. <laughs> Me too, uh, Gareth. I really hope this gets the next remake. I really do. I want to head back here. Oh, shit. <laughs> Bro on the cuddle. Um, I want to go put that fire out. Um, but yeah, I think... Um, I, I do think the next remake will be... Oh, shit. I wanted to get behind knife in. I do think the next remake will be uh, RE5, unfortunately, but I, I think they're probably going to keep us waiting for this. But I, I definitely believe that uh, Code Veronica deserves the next uh, remake treatment, for sure. Right, we're just on normal caution. Uh, I'm doing re very well, thank you, as well, Gareth. Hope yourself and your family are um, all doing well. How's little one? Is she uh, all good? Um, said... Uh, been playing spider-man 2 as well it's epic well i'm really glad you've said that mate uh because i've actually um i was actually gonna hold out till a little price drop but I'm, i was like you know what we'll, we'll just uh 
I'll just order it. Um, I've, I've ordered it with Prime. Uh, so it'll come tomorrow before, uh, like, well, by 1pm. So I'm going to have a nice little chill Sunday with Spider-Man 2 tomorrow. It's so needed. Um, so yeah, I can't wait for some chill time. Lee Gamer, welcome on in, my mate. Said, love this on the Dreamcast. Me too. Um, I think all the Resident Evils look good on Dreamcast. Well, obviously the ones that were released for it. RE2, 3 and uh, Code Veronica. They're just a, a bit more kind of sharper than the PS1 versions, right? Nice. All right. Oh, watch your Doc Martens, Claire. Set them alight. God damn it. <laughs> well, yeah, it was great, man. I, I love owning this the Dreamcast uh, as well. So good. But yeah, this is Code Veronica X, guys. This is the Xbox 360 port of the game. So it's kind of got a little bit of HD on it. It is a HD remaster. Um, I'm currently playing this on my uh, Xbox Series X, but it is like the 360 port of it. Um, but yeah, I'll probably... Uh, I think you can download this on PS5 as well, right? So I'll, um, I'll aim to download that. And uh, we'll, we'll do like a PS5 gameplay. We'll do that obviously after we've completed this one. Um, and then I'll be a bit better like at the game because I've proper got, still got to get good at it. Uh, Hayley Queen, welcome on in. Happy Saturday to you too as well, my friend. And Nat, welcome on in. Um, I'm glad you had a, a decent stream. How did it go? Um, how far did you get on Ari 6? Right, we're good. Um, so we've done that. Let's just check that a sec. There's a button. Push it. Push it real good. Da, 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 da. Yeah, we know, we know. Take that. Oh shit, I forgot about them. Let's just take these out. I'm not messing around. Um But yeah, great to see you in Lee. Hope you're having a great weekend so far, man. Uh, and yeah, I'm glad you're finding time to stream Gareth. I know it must be, you know mega busy with uh with little one and you know spend time with your other half as well um completed Ari village in third person finally and loved it you know what? i can't wait to play that in third person and check out these doggers can you see them little them, them little uh doberman ears yeah i've definitely got that on the list of games to stream um i would love to do another play for a uh, village we last played through that about oh shit not all the, these are getting hit, so I'm fine. Yeah, I think we last streamed it between 12 to 18 months ago. I'm missing it. I, I love our village. Nice. Right, well, I think we'll use that now because I don't want to get us on dirty caution, okay? <laughs> awesome. Right, so we need to, I think we need to go back through. Um, should we go use that hawk emblem next? I don't know if we have to use that next or not. That's locked and I think we need to get a little key from that, yeah. The padlock the other side. <laughs> you, you know what, I, I love... Uh, that's what I love about streaming. I love like that it brings people together. You know, we're all like a community. We're all, all chilling, you know? So good. Oh, man, I actually have got to pick that up. Got it. I'll go use that just to get rid of it out of uh, in inventory, guys. Uh, yeah, Zamp said, I'm so happy other people enjoy chilling and watching games on a Saturday other than me. You know what? Even I do, like, you know, on the nights that I'm not streaming. Um, I've said this previously before on stream. I love that, like, I see it from both ways. Like, I love being a streamer. I also love being a viewer as well. Got lots of uh, friends who stream. Benjamin, welcome on in. You said you're going to try the battle mode after you complete this. I would love to, mate. Yeah, we could definitely schedule that in sometime. Definitely up for that. All right, at least got ourselves a nice little uh, shortcut. There we go. Well, yeah, I thought, I thought Amazon was, you know, probably like the, the best place to get Spider-Man 2 from. And uh, obviously, especially so I can get it tomorrow. So I'm uh, real impatient. I should have got it sooner, you know. But um, yeah, I'm really glad I can get it. Um, chose the by 1 p.m. tomorrow uh, time. So I'll just have a nice Please little uh, chill stream. Any metallic items you have in the security oh, box. so we can. Um... 
Hang on. Can we take that with us and then we can put the hawk emblem in it? I'm sure we do that. See, look at our ammo now. It's crazy. It's absolutely insane. Oh, bollocks. You're kidding. Is that still not... No need to do... Oh, my bad. Sorry, it's the uh, thing in it. There we go. <laughs> the lighter. I can't do one playthrough this fucking game without setting these bollocks off. <laughs> Bruh. Lee, there's no, um, no problem at all, my mate. Lee said, you'll have to excuse me as I often fall asleep watching the streams uh, with being on morning slot. Mate, no worries at all. Completely understand. So push the switch. Lee said, am I going to be streaming RE6 at some point? Um, I'm, you know what? I'm pretty itching to stream RE5. So um, I think probably after we've finished this one, like it'll probably take me a few streams, this guy, because it is a pretty long game, especially if you don't know it, kind of like the back of your hand sort of thing, you know? So I think we... Do we put the Hawk emblem in first? That's the material you want scanned, isn't it? So place that and then we'll put the material in. Um, so yeah, I, I will stream RE5 and then we'll go on to RE6. I do plan on revisiting both those games. <laughs> it really did feel like such a, an upgrade on the graphics, didn't it, Man Cave? So I remember seeing the trailer for this on the Dreamcast. So I was blown away by the upgraded graphics. Those times felt so radical. Bro, I, I love that word as well, you know. Freaking radical. What a word. Yeah, I remember... Um, and I, I obviously discovered the magazines later on. So if you know, it was featured in um, in uh, in like the gaming magazines and stuff. It's insane. Awesome. It's got that. So we'll take that. Oh bollocks! We have to go back through, don't we? Now I think. So that's it for now. We're not going to have to leave them. Oh, shit. Oh, no, I haven't got anything, have I? We definitely need to go this way, don't we? To, the, to that gate to use it. Is it definitely this way? So I think through there it's just that office, isn't it? Of course it is. I think so. Thank you, Nat, for sharing the life. Appreciate that. Oh, man. Yeah, thank you, guys. The, the likes and shares, they help the stream a ton. Thank you. There's no easy way to get around that. Yeah, we'll take that. At least it has that little reminder. Yeah, we don't even need that. I'll leave that as it is, I think. don't think we even need it. Actually, Benjamin, I didn't realise that. So if you trigger the shutters before getting the fake emblem, you can stop the zombies breaking in. Oh man, I never knew that. I'm sure it's back this way anyway. Yeah, I've actually not completed it on the Dreamcast, uh, Gareth. Literally jumped to 2019 to finally complete it on the PS4. Yeah, I've, I've completed it on this. On the this is actually the the 360 port from the arcade. <laughs> Yeah, sorry guys, it's, it's really not going to be uh, the smoothest playthrough. I'm not the best on this. It's not through there, is it? I can't remember. It's got to find that uh, the gate that needs it. What's going on, Void? It's this one in it. There we go. Void said, uh, started replaying RE4 original earlier today. Should defo stream at some point. Thank you for dropping all those diamonds as well. Thank you, Void. Um, yeah, I've actually streamed it. Um, just before RE4 Remake released. And we played a little bit of it, a little hype stream as well. What's going on, Top Boy? Thanks for the follow, man. So this takes me back to my childhood. It was great, man. It really was. I never got into this until uh, pretty later on. Yeah, I only played a little bit of this um, when my uncle got this um, for the PS2 back in the day, but 
I eventually picked it up on PS2. It wasn't until like years later, and I was uh, I was real happy to see a, a more a more HD version of it. You know, on the on the 360. So the, yeah, this is what this version is basically. I believe it's been released on uh, PS5, but I don't know how I don't know how HD it is. But um, I'll definitely make a purchase of that at some point. We'll do a, a playthrough of that in future. And you know, hopefully, I've uh, I've got good at the game a little bit <laughs> after we've done this playthrough. But yeah, it's definitely a challenging RE, this says. Yeah, I'm with Xanth as well. I would I would absolutely love a Made in Heaven jacket. Claire's Made in Heaven jacket is iconic. I want that and then I want uh, Luis's jacket from Ari 4 Remake. Still think, I think... Luis's jacket in the RE4 remake is the the thing that's had the most glow up of the whole remake. <laughs> I'm in love with that jacket. So damn good. I don't know which way to go first, so I'm just going to go uh, head through here. In that random worm boss, like, around here. Oh, bro. Doggos are going to have to take this ammo. You know what, guys? I was just thinking, you don't really see much of uh, Dobermans nowadays, do you? Don't you think? I'd love a Doberman, though. I think they're great. My mate, he's a... He's a, a retro gaming, like, content creator over on uh, YouTube. He's called Retro Reclaimer. And, um... I think it's probably his latest pickup video. I mean, it was a little while ago, but, um... Yeah, he's got his puppy in it. He's got his uh, Doberman puppy running around like while he's showing the pickups. It was so damn wholesome, you know. Seems to have stopped on a lower floor. Can't use the elevator. But yeah, I would have a dog tomorrow if I could. Oh shit! Bro, I was taking a nap. That is the noise I make when I've been awoken from a nap. To that damn iPhone alarm. I hate that alarm. <laughs> yeah, they are iconic jackets, Kingzilla. Both uh, Claire's Made in Heaven and Luis's uh, jacket in the remake. Because it doesn't like look that impressive on the OG, but man, what they have done to it on the remake. But yeah, one day, guys, when I can finally have a dog, I, I will absolutely... Um, I'll have my dog on stream. I'll definitely have my doggo, like, chilling. Can we go back for those items, by the way? This place blows up, I think, doesn't it? Um, I've just thought there's, there's some more items in that security box, wasn't there? I'm, like, wondering about them, like, what's going on. You know what I mean? You know the rounds we got? We got them rounds. We got another couple of things. Can we get those back? I can't if we get in one. If we can get in one of the doors later on and get them back or something like that, I'm sure we can claim them back. Claire, stop with a little little hand on hip sass. I've got to consult the stream, okay? Because I'm shy at this game. Dad, tell us, welcome on him. Card reader. Where's the thingy? We, we need that as well. We, we proper need the bow gun. It's a good way to save the handgun ammo. There we go. You changed it to what, Sam? She said, uh, I changed my alarm for an emergency alarm, so I tend to run to my vault for safety. What, as if you're in a, um, as if you're in Fallout, running, to, running underground to the vault? No, I'm done. Welcome on in. Said this needs a remake. It absolutely does, man. Desperately. Harry fans are screaming out for it. Good evening, Danny. Including me, man. You know? Uh, Valentino Rossa, that says on there. And it that looks just like the Juggernaut machine on uh, Call of Duty Zombies. I want to stream some Call of Duty Zombies uh, in future, by the way, guys. So just FYI, it will be incoming. Oh, nice. If you time it right, you can, like, knock it down. And then you pretty much should be all good from there. Oh, no. Maybe not. You fucker. Oh, I can't. 
I ain't got the right angle. Oh, nice. Go on. Oh, bro's on roids, man. Things I do to try and conserve ammo. Hopefully we'll get the bow gun soon. Oh shit, he's got back up. Fuck. Bollocks. Shit. Sorry, it's a little turbulent, guys. A lot of switching from the, the handgun to the knife. <laughs> What's going on, Tyler Robbins? Welcome on in. I said, nice, I caught you live again. You caught me, bro. I know, I know, I know a lot of you guys, you, you try to catch me live. Bless you. It's, it's great to see you coming. Thank you uh, for keeping an eye out and, you know, for, for dropping in when we live. Always an absolute pleasure to uh, chill with you guys. Um, Lee Gamer also says on the Ari thing today, I watched the new uh, Resident Evil Death Island uh, CG movie. Man, it's so good. I love Death Island. I actually really enjoyed it. It's probably, um, probably like my favourite, really. I'll probably have to like watch the other ones like just to compare. Because uh, I've not seen them in a while. The most recent one I did watch. I did watch Vendetta before I watched De Death Island. Oh, oh, bollocks. Naked bastard taking a sauna. Bruh, it's my sauna. Fuck. Oh, man. We're gonna... Fight, careful. Oh. A lot of hot air inside. Oh, bollocks. I thought there was something in here. That's why I uh, took bro out. Can we keep that guy running about? Let's have a look at that. Shut the bell. See what it does. Leon West. Good evening, man. And same to you, Brittany. Welcome on in. Thank you, guys. I do appreciate you, Nat, and everyone uh, taking the time to come into the stream and uh, and chill with us. Always appreciate you, guys. Let's see what this bling is. Key with the tag. Device seems to control the water current. It's broken. It really is, Tyler. It really is like the, the knife is the most, uh, seems to be the most uh, effective weapon for sure in this. You just need to, like, say, get the right angle, don't you, to get a good swipe in with the knife. It's good when you uh, when you do. It's real satisfying, actually. Never used it so much, you know, than this playthrough. And um, like I say, I'm not the best with it, because, like I say, I've got us down to caution a few times. I've been on caution a few times, and I'm quite aware we're dying. <laughs> Brittany, thank you for sharing the live. Appreciate that. And Oryx as well. Thanks for coming in with the share. Thank you, guys. It helps the stream a ton, all the likes and shares. So thank you. Oh, yeah. We'll print out the map. I mean, why the hell not? I wish I'd have gone to see Blink, to be honest, live. Uh, but I remember looking at the tickets and there was like over 100 quid. I'm sure there's like between 100 and 150 or something. So I was looking for me and my best mates, but jeez, man. I, I could not justify it, you know? I could not justify that. What is the most, any of you guys, if you go to gigs and concerts, what is the, um, what is the most expensive gig ticket you've paid for? If you don't mind me asking, anyway. Like, if you don't mind, it's fine. But have you ever had to pay, have you ever felt like you've had to pay over the odds for a gig ticket? Let me know. I'm just curious, you know. I think the most I've ever paid to see someone is probably... It's probably like 50 quid. I'm off to see the streets uh, next week. And I think they were like 50 odd quid. I was a bit like... It's a bit steep, bro. I thought th maybe 35 would have been alright, but... Oh, jeez, Zav, you must love her. You know what? I, I did actually have... Um, I had a meet and greet for Ozzy Osbourne. And uh, that was about... I'm sure it was about 600 or 650. It was about 650, I think. But, um, 
obviously he, he, he cancelled it a few times because obviously covid happened and then he had a fall and um like injured his like shoulder he had on metal bolts put in his shoulder things like that he had surgery and then um it was delayed again and then um he got diagnosed with a form of parkinson's and then it was completely um cancelled then and then i did get my refund of like six fiddy uh, it, it was actually earlier this year then that, that it, it properly got cancelled and i got the refund It sucks, man, because, like, um, yeah. Honestly, I, I had no uh, hesitation of paying that to meet Ozzy Osbourne, because that is an absolute bucket list thing, right? Yeah, I was, I was devastated, man. G feels going down well tonight. I've got the, um... I've got the village G feel tonight, Ari Village. It's called uh, Maiden's Blood. It's like a fruit punch flavour. It's lovely. What's that again? Stationery and related supplies. Nothing useful here. Fucking nerds. You all fucking nerds. <laughs> oh, that's amazing, Stephen. Absolute GG. Said I met Ozzy Osbourne in Dublin, book signing back in 2009. That's amazing. I would love to meet him at some point, man. Tom Cox, welcome on in, Tom. Glad to see you're appreciating uh, Code Veronica. Memo on the pass number. The emergency door lock system in the biology experiment room can be released with the four digit pass number. I hope you haven't forgotten about that already. I've just received an order from the system administrator requesting us to change the pass number periodically. What bothers me is that you often lose important memos, pass numbers or even chemicals. So in an attempt to solve that problem, I came up with an idea. You know the red human skeleton picture at the back of the biology experiment room? I've decided to use the number signed on the picture as the pass number. If you happen to lose the memo, just look at the picture. Well, I don't think you would ever need to use the emergency pass number. Do you, you fucking think so? But just in case, now you know. Take it easy, Mr. Careless. First of all, I'm not a mister. You should address me as Miss Careless. Abnormally, I can't enter the pass number. Got his head grabbed and splatted. There appears to be no one around. A red picture is hanging in the back. I can't see the number from here. Why can't you just fucking squint or something, Claire? You're about twelve. Come on. I have to. Uh, I have to get out. I think. Should I find it uh, somewhere else? Hazard contamination detected. Uh oh. Level three. It's gonna blow. Shatter. Will close. All personnel evacuate immediately. <sighs> that was close. Let's see if we can get back in, can we? <laughs> Lock can be released when ventilation is complete. Let's have a look. Anything else we can do? So, silver card reader. We ain't got anything on us, have we? Um, oh, we have got the bow gun. We just remembered about that. I'm glad we found that. Combine them all. There we go. I can't remember if there's anything we can do in here or we need to get something from uh, another area. We'll go have a little look. I don't think there's anything. I don't, uh... No, I've played this before, Tyler. I played it years ago. Um, me and the, one of my best mates, we, we completed this a couple of times. But yeah, I've actually not done a, a full-on playthrough in ages. Where's that? Oh, you got the train facility map. Oh, obviously, I clicked print and didn't collect the fucker. Typical me thing to do. There we go. <laughs> Oh, nice, Carl. You got this on release date. Hell yeah, man. Yeah, it took me a while to actually um, discover this and get into it, you know. No, 
don't think there's anything else for us to get. Just uh, making sure, you know. There's nothing there, was there? Just double check. Um, this one. <laughs> What's going on, Andy? Welcome on in, man. Said, miss you, missed you, Lucy Spraggan. <laughs> I wish. I wish I looked like a fraction like her. She's a, uh, she's a beaut. She's awesome. Um, oh bless you. Said had no phone. Been broke for around a month, uh, and it's been horrible. Oh bless you. I, I feel you on that, man. Honestly, I, uh, I have moments where uh, <laughs> the funds do dip at times, and it like, life is freaking expensive, man. I'm always just hanging in there, you know. I'm always doing cool stuff. Like, um, yeah, that, that's the thing with me. Like, I'm always skin. You know, I get money, I spend it, um, but. I'm still doing cool stuff, you know? You, you've got to just try and treat yourself, book cool things to do, you know? Where possible. Just got to enjoy yourself, you know? I'm just leaving this for now, I think. I'm not sure. That's it, Carl. I know we're a little older now. Like, I'm 30 now. But, um... I think that other one was locked, wasn't it? But yeah, it's just cool to um, have actually, yeah, got these games like, on release date and stuff. And, you know, for me, it was it was cool to get these, um, you know, when I was real younger. I think it is as well, Tyler. Yeah, Tyler said this is sadly criminally underrated. I, I definitely um, agree with you on that, man. Definitely. Let's use the... Uh, yeah, we've got that. Let's see if we can... Fucking hell, how many do you want? Bro. I always find the um, the bogan is so unreliable. I mean that, that must be why they give you a lot of ammo. Oh my god, as if you could load all that in there. That's crazy. Let's get a load of bolts into it. Just spam it like that. Nice. I think he gone, I think he gone. Nice. Yeah, I've completed this years ago, Becca, but um, I heavily relied on one of my best mates, Charlotte. She was uh, right. Oh, shit. Bruh. Yeah, she was a right goat at this. She knew this more than me. I do feel guilty, man. Why have they got to be... Uh... Why have they got to be doggos? I want to kill the Dobermans. I like Dobermans, they're cute. Oh shit! Jesus! That mid-air shot was pretty cool just then. It's taking the navy proof, cool. I don't know if that's for... Um, that navy proof, do you... no, actually, I don't think it's that one. Is it like the indigo proof or something we, we use on that guillotine? There's a little slot back at the guillotine. Oh, we have dirty caution. I'll, I'll take that in a minute. Oh, I don't think I go there yet. Is there anything out here? Yeah, there's a little herb. I thought I saw something. Yeah, it is Tyler. I, I think the uh, the bow gun it is. Yeah, he said it's hilariously weak but still cool. I think it's okay just to spam it because you get a lot of bullets for it. It just helps. What I like, I, I just really appreciate for what it is because it just saves like handgun ammo because like we've literally got one bullet in the handgun right now, so it just helps with that. I don't think the Tony's arms in this are they? They're like American Wolf or something. They are. They are indeed. A little husky on there. A little American Wolf. Hey, Alvin. Thank you for the follow. Appreciate you. Let's log on the freaking Windows 95. Enter an employee ID to activate the unlocking device. 
I've not got an ID number. Up to uh, get that in a bit. Nothing useful. I think before we explore, I think we'll, uh, we'll head up uh, to this save room, I think, first. Then we'll see what what's uh, unlocked for us and stuff. I know, uh, Becca, I'm really hoping I can hang in on this uh, play for. I really hope I can see this all the way through. Because we, we've been saying, um, you know, earlier in the stream, um, there, there can be, like, little difficulty spikes in this game. You know, things can get a bit tough. And then, obviously, I think if you get too damaged or your resources are too depleted, I think it can just you'll be like screwed like you know for the rest of the playthrough and that's what happened when i got to the the tyrant boss fight up on the the aircraft um yeah it was it was like a year or two ago when i had a game play this on the go now, yeah it, it totally messed it up for me so i couldn't com continue with it so yeah hopefully we can see it all the way through I'll, I'll be so glad to get through the game if we can secretary's note four years have passed since i began serving sir alfred he doesn't trust anyone even though i am his attendant i'm still strictly prohibited from entering his private house what is his problem anyway they say he lives with his twin sister alexia in his private house on the hill occasionally i've seen someone standing by the window of the house it might have been alexia whose extreme beauty is often talked about i once asked sir alfred about this but it only enraged him even though i am his attendant he will not show me any lenience if i ask about her again i could put my life at risk after all, it is a mystery why he so desperately tries to keep his private life with Alexia a secret. Robert Dawson. Freaking Bobby getting in on the gossip. Alright, we will take that because we are on date caution. I don't want to mess around. What do we even use the, the powder with? I don't get what we actually use that with, you know. Whoa. Oh, nice. What is that? Gunpowder arrow. Oh, they're like explosive ones or something. What the hell? Make a little save in a sec. So you need the gold lugas for that, don't you? Guys, have you seen the prices of the gold lugas, by the way? We push it, push it this way. We'll get them in just a sec. We are full uh, inventory space. I want to have a look actually, see how much they are nowadays. They're like insane. But I, I would love some, man. They're, they're like hundreds of pounds. Let me have a quick look. I'm a search on eBay. I'll show you. that. That's that meme I shared. Finally caved and put the heating on. And then I captioned it. I shared it on the, my socials. I put, I'm sorry, Martin Lewis. I can't freeze my tits off any longer. <laughs> I have failed. You'd be fuming, man. Can we just search the uh, the gold lugers. Code, Veronica. Gold luger. Bro, was that a firework? Who's setting off fireworks now, man? So they seem to be international. These are. Um, oh man, there's quite a few. There's some that are like f about four hundred pounds, but some of them might not be um, complete fully. This one's about seven hundred pounds, and it's got the BB bullets in. So that'll uh, that'll probably be about the real deal. So whatever it is, this is from the US, and it, it is the equivalent to uh, seven hundred pounds. It's crazy. Look at those though; they look amazing. Them freaking gold lugers. I hate that it's got Steve on the box though. Just can't have Claire on it, can it? The gold lugers are mine. I said I was sorry. <laughs> Fuck you, Steve. <laughs> Welcome on in, Jack George. Hope you're well. Said good evening. Uh, late on, been out for a meal. Oh, hell yeah. What did you have at your meal, Jack? Hope you had an awesome one. I had a cheeky Indian tonight. I had my uh, usual um, vanilla ice chicken korma. Hell yeah. Oh, we need that, don't we? I'll deposit them. Um, let me move that slot up. That'll go there. I don't know if we need that yet. I'm sure we don't need the navy proof yet. I'm just going to leave it there for now. I'll keep that on us just in case we get injured. And then I do kind of need the rest of them. You know. I want to. I want that next to there. I think we'll roll with that. We'll uh, make a little save in a sec. Uh, we have got round uh, finally Jack to code Veronica. I was like, you know what? I've got to schedule that in over the weekend. I was like, bro, we're going to do that. Yes, actually, I am on Instagram. If you head over 
Guys, if you head over to YouTube, put in Holster TV over on YouTube, if you go on my stream and look down below in the description, uh, they are, um, the, the, I've got like links and everything to my socials down there. So my, uh, my Insta, Facebook, uh, Twitter, everything's on there. So feel free to uh, drop us a follow and that's where I update you guys. What's going on and everything? Dr. Mandeville, what's going on? And Jan, welcome on in. I'm doing good, thank you. How are you? Hope you're all good. Do a little space between them. There we go. Right. I'll try not to set the piss with the saves, but I might just make a little one here. Because we have been playing for like an hour. Just need to play it cautious, you know? Start like down here. Lucky seven. Oh, hell yeah, Jack. I'll have to have a look at that after stream. Said so the fillet steak, king prawns and garlic butter. Hell yeah, 10 out of 10. That's awesome. I don't normally have like a lot of seafood and stuff, but I, I love steak though. Yeah, I like my steak medium rare. What about you guys? Let me know how you have your steaks. But yeah, I have my little... Uh... Oh, thank you. Thank you, Becca. Oh, bollocks. I haven't got the lighter, have I? Oh, I did take it. Thank you. Ooh, I thought I'd left it in that damn metal security box bollocks thing. It, it is a bit of a dark game, Tyler. I do feel like you have to be, like, a bit more, um, a bit more, uh, observant, don't you, I think, for some pickups. Said, God, you saw the hair. Um, said, pro tip holster, the bowgun is the best weapon for the tyrant fight. Oh, yeah, yeah. Just use the bow gas rounds with the grenade launcher and they bomb arrows. You'll drop in about 17 to 20 on bomb arrows. What have we, um, what was those we've got in the, you know that, um, I didn't know what the hell I was doing. You know that uh, bowgun powder? I've combined it with a bowgun. Then uh, we've got ten, and it said like, um, so it's, it's in red as well. Like, what what kind of rounds are they, man? Are they just like, like normal explosive rounds or something? If you don't mind letting me know, uh, anyone who knows. What's going on in uh, Gareth? An underrated classic, indeed it is, man. I will have to check that, won't I? Let's have a quick check what this ID number is. Nice. I used to have uh, my steak well done, Tyler. And then I, 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 uh, I actually, um, I tried it medium rare, right? And I, I had to kind of be polite in doing so. It's when I went to America. I just landed. Um, I just landed uh, there, and I had to stay over at one of my uh, assistant coaches' houses. It was a real late flight and stuff. And a fella was up, and because um, she was like, um, you know what? I believe she, she was, she was actually all right, but she. You know when some people really intimidate you just because they've got that demeanour about them? I was kind of like that. I was real on edge about her. And then a fucking a fellow was like an absolute... He was like real nice and everything. He sorted food for me. Then he said, oh, I've got some steak. He's like, it's, it's medium rare. Is that all right? And I was I just proper said yes to be polite. And I had it and I've never turned back since. I was like, oh, you know what? That's actually sick. Thank you, my dude. NTC 0394. N T C zero three nine four. Do we have to put the N T C in? I think so. Did we do it? Nice. ID verification has been confirmed. Holster, you are a twat. That's me. Let's go. Thank you guys for uh, yeah verifying that's uh, that's the the explosive rounds. Thank you, Riley. Thank you for the follow. Yes, that, I'm the exact same, Jack. Thank God you don't have to just be a medic to appreciate a medium rare steak to have the blood to dip the chips into. It's not just a medic thing. I'm not just obsessed with blood. Hell yeah. You know what, guys? Someone actually... Um, you know, it was before I left... Um, it, I think it was just before I finished uh, one night last week. One of the girls called me into the crew room on the station, right? Because I was waiting to finish. I was literally ticking down the minutes. I was like, we're almost finished shift. But anyway, I heard Holly from the crew room, and I was like, what's someone shouting me for? I was like, what, why would... I don't get why they'd need me. So I went in really, like, I was like, why, why would you call me, you know? And then, yeah, they tried to jump scare me, man. She had uh, a skeleton mask on, went, like, proper in my face. I, I kind of semi-jumped, and I was like, you know what? I'm real proud of myself, you know? 
I was like, I turned, I, 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 at first I jumped, and then I kind of did the little hand on hip sass, and I was like, you, you know I'm a horror streamer, right? I was like, you know my horror streams uh, come in handy with this, right? <laughs> I tried to play it off cool. You picked the wrong bish. <laughs> I try and be fearless, guys. I try. Come on. Yes, come on. Nice fucking boss. If you can get the right... Um... I'm not interested in the pot. Give me the bullets. I'm not going to the antiques fucking roadshow, bro. Unreal. I'm not going to show it to David Dickinson, that pot, am I? Bruh. <laughs> bro. He was hungry. Yeah, you know, I was actually okay. I, I just, I semi-jumped. And then, yeah, I, I played it cool. And I was like, you, you picked the wrong streamer, bish. <laughs> oh, Sam, if you can't help me like that, I'm going to ban you from the chat indefinitely. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> Said your horror stream a bit ago proves you wrong, Hop. Bro, we all jumped at that. Just because I shat my Calvins. Don't out me like that. <laughs> Nat, thank you for sharing the live. I do appreciate that. Um, and Mike Bradford, thank you for the follow. Um, Jack George said, is there any Code Veronica mods? Well, just earlier into the stream, a couple of people asked if we'd had the infinite ammo or infinite um, herb mods. And I was like, like, we haven't we're not done that. So that's, I'm going to ban you for from using that um from using that emoji of me I, I, that's that's a real vulnerable emoji to to be spamming you know <laughs> it's the one where i'm like this is a little custom emoji so if you subscribe you get some custom emojis my little uh, reward and there's one with me like that and uh xanthi's proper out in me man you know what <laughs> screw you guys i'm just gonna stream lego harry piss pot from now how's that I'm going to be a friendly streamer now. No more horror streams. <laughs> I think we need to do something with these, don't we? Do we have to do something with insects or something? <laughs> Let's go on a UK gamers club. Welcome on in. Got to freaking love the bands. you got to love it. Oh, James pushes the steak and he has it rare. So what's that? That's like an ant. Oh yeah, is there only just the one? And if it's later on, there's like some order of something. We'll push that. Yeah, I'd have to go medium rare, man. Never looked back from that though. I'll tell you something in a minute after this. I was about to say after this little blonde bastard. Oh wait. <laughs> Bro's had a, a weird childhood. If, if that was me, I, I would never be, like, suited and booted there. I, I would literally be slobbed out having a Cartoon Network binge, you know? <laughs> I would not be like that, bro. That was definitely not my childhood. <laughs> the gold lugas, we have them for all of two seconds. I can't freaking wait. Ali Mac, thank you for sending us those roses. Let's freaking go. Let's have it. Walked into the room and saw the gold lugas. I was like, oh. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, no, if we can get him just yet, can we actually? Fuck. The self destruct sequence has been activated. Bollocks. Sorry, Claire, I thought we could take him. We can't just yet, can we? I freaking love those gold lugas. I, I can't currently afford hundreds for, for a replica set though. I think at the minute, I think we should all go to the Sunday market. We'll get a couple of BB guns, we'll paint them gold. And then we'll just 
all run around just pretend we we have lugas yeah what what do you guys think what do you guys reckon uh, right okay so i have to leave that for now so i think fucking <laughs> dickhead steve picks up done it you were dar dar oh shit what's going on i hear we sorry whoa bollocks we need to back up quick oh Bro. Is he dumb? Bro's dumb, bro's dumb. Nat, thank you for spamming those roses for us, uh, my friend. Appreciate you massively. Hell yeah. Oh, man, Cartoon Network, man. It was the absolute peak. Yeah, I do try Kingzilla. I do drop the, uh, the rose jam. And the sound effects, I, I do where, where possible. I do where possible. I can't always on Steam games because it takes over the screen. I can't exit out of it. But when we're doing a game on console, I can, I can pretty easily kind of get to my little sound effects. I am going to invest very soon uh, into like a, a little Elgato kind of sound thingy. So I can just hit, hit a button and then the sound will come on. Oh, yeah, I forgot about those uh, uh, gamers. Yeah, yeah, I'd rather have the twin oozes, Steve, as later. Hell yeah. Yeah, I think you said this, Becca. I think you said um, they, they leave us alone, don't they? If we have the lighter equipped. Forgot about that. Uh, Becca said, where we are. Okay, so we've tried to take the gold Lugas. We can't just yet. I think we have to wait for dopey Steve to get them. What's in the door looming case? Can't even remember. I think do we stick our shit in here? Then we can get past the metal box or something. Oh, could I if I had a lockpick? Bro, how do you not already have a lockpick on you? I thought we'd find moaning metal in there, but oh no. We've got uh 15 bullets. Let's freaking go. think um is there any other doors up here take a look ah silver crest got it i, sh I think uh, as we try and exit the actual like uh mansion slash palace itself i think steve tries to take the lugas <laughs> yeah yeah, <laughs> me. yeah hey, steve is it this one? Oh, was it? No, it was the back room, wasn't it? My bad. Other one. It's fine. We ain't in a rush. I'm gonna shake my G fuel up as well. Oh, bollocks, which, um, that one, I think, you know, does he actually Becca? Your man at the beginning has the lockpick, really? He swaps you for your light if you give him medicine. Have I got a way of getting the, the lockpick right now? Or like anytime soon? It's a message on the control panel. When two pairs complete, my anger will subside. Operator, there are switches. Switches be cray. Two pairs, is that, um, C and E? The guns? And then A and F. Oh, hang on. It's, it says two pairs, doesn't it? So they're both. Oh, bollocks. Here we go. Steve is suffering. Well, I'm not exactly uh, too bothered by that. Is it just uh, A and uh, C and E, I think? There we go. That was too close. But I found something, thanks to you. Looks cool, huh? What? Oh, I need those. Yeah, Shit, did you feel? You gotta be kidding. I found it and I'm keeping it. Fine. Let's make a deal. I'll trade you for something fully automatic. See you around, Claire. Adios. Hey, wait, Steve!
The bros just made off with the loose and we're just studying with the light alike. Sal, mate. <laughs> I'll have to take a look, um, Becker. I've not come across any medicine just yet. You know what? I don't think I would give up any cowpole for a, uh, a lockpick. What about you guys? I would keep the cowpole. Million percent. <laughs> right, I don't think there's anything else we can do um, as of now. Need the lockpick for that. Um, we use that in an underground thing, don't we? Um... These need crests and stuff. Um, I think we good. I know Fox's bow. It's it's so like. Why would he dabble like that? Point the gun that closes his fingers on the trigger. Proper show off. Rigby, how dare you interfere with my operation? What are you talking about? You let yourself be captured so you can lead your people to this base. I have no idea what you're babbling about. You don't fool me. I am Alfred Ashford, commander of this base. Oh? You must be one of Umbrella's lower level officers if you're in command of a backwater base like this one. How dare you! The Ashford family is among the world's first and finest. My grandfather is one of the original founders of Umbrella Inn. Now tell me, why have you attacked this installation? Attacked? Shortly after you arrived, my base was attacked. You must have informed your people of its location. I still don't follow you. I really don't know anything about that. Unacceptable. How can you deny it? My base has been destroyed. And thanks to you, the experimental T-virus was released, creating countless zombies and monsters. Tell me, who do you work for? Who sent you? <laughs> Bro, you can't just shoot mid-sentence. You're just a rat in a cage anyway. I'll be sure to keep you entertained before I dispose of you. <laughs> this little bish. <laughs> That's called cool, Tyson. I forgot I was doing a replay myself. Uh, gonna boot up the game uh, myself again. A sick man. Yeah, enjoy it. Actually, I don't think we need to go back through here. Let's go see if that door's unlocked up there. He looks like freaking Malfoy, doesn't he? I'm looking for Potter. <laughs> LM, thank you for dropping the roses and diamonds. Appreciate you. Let's freaking go. Thank you to all you guys for being in tonight. Yeah, Kingzilla, clearly got the moves, man. She's just real, like, slim to be able to dodge pretty quickly, right? Yeah, you still need that silver crest. Got it. Right, I don't think I'm, um, missing anything. Oh, actually, it's just popped to the, um... <coughs> it's popped to the save room set just to deposit a few things. Um, and then, actually, we, we can head right out of the, um, the courtyard. Um, and we've not, um... We've not been down there. Yeah, I don't know if that goes down to the boat, I think, Becca. I don't know whether to keep the, the proof on me or not. I can't remember if we need the proof. Um, and, that, and that wheel. I can't remember. I might keep them both on me. We'll put, put them back. Um, yeah. Keep the proof in the wheel. We'll keep the door a looming case on us in case uh, we can get the that lock pick to unlock it. Let's go see what's going on. I'm glad you guys know what to do. <laughs> Have you completed this many times then, Becca? I, I know there's uh, there's Becca and Tyler. There's uh, I know Mr. Tibbs as well was in earlier giving us uh, advice on it. I know some of you guys uh, know uh, what the deal is with this game. 
I'm slow rusty at that song. Welcome on in, Sean. This is Code Veronica. Awesome palace map. Nothing there, nothing else. Pretty good. What's going on, Fred? Thank you for being here, man. I said, uh, hey, Hulsa, I'm absolutely loving the stream, dude. I'm really glad you're enjoying it. Thank you so much for being here, mate. Massively appreciate your guys' support. And I'm really glad you're enjoying the stream. Me too. I'm, I'm uh, enjoying it, attempting to get good at it, you know? Nice. Turn the steering wheel. Awesome. No, no worries at all, so unfortunately got to go. Appreciate you all uh, and you, Hull. Uh, live tomorrow, though. Hell yeah. And uh, hopefully dropping your lives again. Yeah, you're more than welcome now. Anytime. Thanks so much for dropping those uh, diamonds and roses in tonight. We really appreciate your support, as always. And uh, yeah, likewise with yourself. Uh, I'll, I'll look out for you tomorrow and uh, try and drop in your stream as well. Uh, thank you, as always, for your support. And uh, take care of yourself. Have an awesome rest of your weekend and a wicked stream tomorrow. Nat over in the chat, in, on, in the TikTok chat started streaming so please go and show Nat some support see if there's anything there to collect on this oh nice little side pack hell yeah got some more room in the booty bearded dad thank you for the follow thank you Nat much love to you as well my sweet thank you we appreciate you you guys are all legends No, I love it. Like, there's there's quite a few of you guys um, who have popped in the chat saying, you know, I'm going to stream. Like, I've, I've started streaming. I'm going to stream soon. You know, I'm all for it. I, I proper love, like, that you guys are taking up streaming and creating videos as well. Are you any close to streaming, by the way, Zamf? Because I'm sure you've got your PC set up, right? <laughs> Bless you, Zamf. So, you're so lovely to everyone. It's so cute. Well, yeah. Obviously, you know, why, why would I not be, you know, nice to feel? I always um, love... Uh, I always, always love uh, supporting you guys. You, you support me all the time. What I find so special about streaming is that, and it, this isn't like a, from a bragging point of view whatsoever, it's like I could go live at any time and I can guarantee I would always have at least one person watching. You, you guys, well, I, I'm sure I'd have more than one person, but I can guarantee I'd have at least one person watching. Like, you guys are always here, always turn up, always have my back and support me. So like, you, you know, I, I think that's amazing about streaming. I say that to my friends, like, you know, I could just stream whenever and you, you guys always turn up. Nice. Oh, bless you, Zamp. said, yes, but I'm scared. Don't be scared, you will be fine. You'll be fine, Zamp. I, I cannot, like, stress enough, like, how awesome streaming is. What well, once you're, like, just... Once you get started with the game, you just get chatting away, like, it... The, it flies by. It's insane. I've wanted to stream since 2016. Since I first started my YouTube channel. And I only had... I've only just got the means to be able to stream. I've been streaming for about 18 months, I think, now. But I, I would have been streaming since 2016 if I could. I just didn't have a good enough internet or PC. It sucked, man. I was so upset. I, I went live, right? I, I think I was trying to go live with one of the Resident Evils. And I was probably like, what's going on, guys? That, that, there was this... And my hand was like that across the screen. It was all pixelated. And I was like, what, what's going on, guys? It was like, that is awful. <laughs> and I was I was proper. I remember staring at the screen. And I was like, oh, no. And I said to my friend, I'm like, what's going on? Why can't I go live? Like, and he just said, it's just not uh, a... <laughs> your PC and internet just ain't, ain't enough, unfortunately. But yeah, we're finally on. And it is it genuinely is a freaking game changer being able to live stream. Thank you, James. I appreciate that. James Leon Morris said, you deserve the best you always deliver. Thank you, guys. I, I always try my best, you know. Always put everything into the streams. I try. <laughs> yeah, I'm not the absolute best gamer out there, but I just love chilling and vibing with you guys. Just so good. Talking life and everything and just not taking games too seriously. 
Frankly Gaming, what's going on? Good evening. No, I love that. Like, we play, right? Scary games, horror games. We play some of the most horrific games. Even, like, the mortuary system. We are solo doing a night shift in a mortuary, right? You cannot get any more grim than that. Like, and we still make entertainment of that. We're still laughing. We're still being scared and laughing throughout. And I love that. Like, I'm always, um... I've always been like that. Like, I love horror, but I just... I don't even, like, go out of my way to do it. I just kind of naturally pick apart the horror and just... I always see, like, the, f the fun in, in it, like, all the time. Always making jokes and having fun with it. I think it's hilarious. All right, who's getting arcade vibes? I have not won on one of these machines in ages. You know the grabber machines with the little toys? I could not even impress my XGF with one either. I was trying to win her a Spyro so bad and I was proper like, I was coming across all the confidence, I was doing the little hand on hip sass and leaning on the machine. I was like, give me another 20p baby, I'm gonna win this Spyro and I was like, did I bollocks? I kept going, uh, this time, this time, I've got it, this time. Did I bollocks? <laughs> You know what? It, it is. It is a bit scary, um, Xanth, jumping into. Well, not even scary. Like, it's a bit of a risk and it can be a bit like. You know, when you're jumping into games blind, when you don't know what's going on, you don't know what the difficulty is going to be like. Especially me with this. I'm not very good at this, but I did. Um, I did, like, uh, you know, give you guys a heads up. This will not be a smooth play for. I'm not the best at this, but it's, it's fine. It is what it is, you know? Like. You know, you have not got to be the best gamer. Just chill and vibe with everyone. The people who vibe with you, they will stay. They'll stand by you. You know. Oh, did we drop that? Oh bollocks! I thought we only got. I thought we could only do two directions. Then that was it. Freaking half a job. What's going on, Tom? Good evening, man. Uh, kind of winning. Oh, there's no need to operate. Oh, have we done it? There's nothing else to do in here, is there? I don't think. So that needs a lever. Right, so we're definitely finished on that, aren't we? Got it. Yeah, what was you saying, Becca? Sorry, I think you said... Uh... That's why I love this stream. We can make a shit situation funny. Oh, oh, honestly, always. We can play those horrific games, but just laugh all the way through. Um... Oh, I'm glad you love the vibes, uh, Becca. Said, I have to say, the first guy I came across on TikTok loving the vibe being here. And Zant said, uh, you have good chill vibes. It's perfect for streaming. Thank you, guys. I do appreciate it. Thank you. The mic's on the key. Oh, right. So you need a key hole for that, don't we? You say a lot of zombies come up, Becca. Damn. Running alone. Thank you. Over on the... Uh... Over on uh, Twitch, thank you very much. I don't know why I've just come back up here. Uh, we've got a raid over on Twitch, guys. Thank you, running alone, for raiding us, man. Welcome on in, raiders. We are uh, playing the classic Resident Evil Code Veronica. Thank you, man. I always, uh, honestly, I'm, I'm always happy being here on stream. So that's why we, we've always got the decent vibes. There we go. Right, let's go. Oh, yeah, there is shitloads of zombies, isn't there? Oh, damn it. Becca did warn us. <laughs> Thank you, Tyler. I, th I think we're killing it so far. Considering I don't really know the game like the back of my hand, I think we're doing pretty well. Nice. Give us, give us the shit. Give us the stuff. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Biohazard card. Oh, man. I don't know how this is going to go. Oh, nice. Even he didn't bite our Doc Martens. We was all right with that. I think we need to go back in that facility, don't we? That's that silver key card we need, isn't it? Yeah. Can you use this at the military training facility? Thank you very much. That's wicked, Tyler. You know what? I actually visited LA when I was um, when I was doing my um, soccer scholarship. Um, visited there for spring break. Didn't party it up. I was literally being like a proper tourist and... Um, yeah, loved it there, man. It, like, some parts, right, when we drove through it, it was like, um... It was like, uh... 
being in GTA San Andreas. You're going in and out of some proper ghetto areas, Tyler. I'd love to live in LA, man. But yeah, thank you for catching us live, mate. I know there's, there's people from all over the world who uh, catch us live, so it's, it's absolutely wicked. I can't if there's anything through here. We'll have a look. Yeah, we did pretty good with that. We did pretty good getting out of that situation, guys. That is always us getting out of a, a minging situation. Can we, can we use that to deter the things? Yes. Yeah. Hell yeah. I think we can put one of the, uh, yeah, one of the proofs there. Awesome. Well, thank you, guys. We, we did a little, uh, I think we did good with a little dodge in there, didn't we? Freaking put on the side pack for the extra booty room. We still manoeuvred our booty around there. Hell yeah. All right. Need a couple more of them proofs. Oh, Zamf, it's the worst. Fred, thank you for dropping that diamond, mate. Tech issues are the absolute worst. I still have them now. Freaking hate tech issues. Yeah, it's good, Tyler. It's, it's good getting uh, multiple zombie hits with that knife. This has got to be the, the only, re like, the Resident Evil where the knife is, like, inflicts the most damage, right? It's got to be. It's got to be this one. Um, I don't think there's anything else to do. Obviously, we'll go um, go back. Need two more proofs to progress from here. Um, we'll go back and use the... Um, go back and use that silver card. We all lived on the Cape Veronica submarine. <laughs> this is a load of bollocks. This is a load of bollocks. Yeah. <laughs> you could fucking jump across there. You've got to be so dramatic and use the wheel like a fucking pirate Redfield. Yar! <laughs> fucking pirate Claire. <laughs> oh, man. You're not speaking of ghetto, Tyler. I, um... The facility's, like, over here, isn't it? Um, I, w I do actually want to stream San Andreas. Do I do want to do another um, GTA stream. We did stream GTA Vice City. We did, like, a mega long stream on that. Um, but unfortunately, it got removed, even on YouTube. And I think it's just because of the sheer amount of copyrighted music. I, I think it's probably just had a, a proper meltdown on it. Um, oh, bollocks. Everyone's going for the Doc Martens, bruh. Oh, you arsehole. Put us on caution as well. But yeah, I think I think we can do another GTA stream, but unfortunately I think we're just going to have to switch all the radio stations off and I'll just have to sing instead. <laughs> Team Daddy and Boo, thank you for the follow. Oh no, not this. Guys, is this best to kill or leave? Because I usually just try run past it. Is it best to kill or leave? Please let me know. It's similar to the Grave Digger, isn't it, on RE3? Yeah, Becca says wrong. Oh. oh, I thought they put us on a dirty caution. Oh, yeah, UK Gamer said leave it as well. Yeah, it seems like a waste of ammo, right? Alright, see if we can use this card. So we can use it on this. Oh, we need to do the ventilation. Got it. So go over here. Not making bad progress, I'm pretty, I'm pretty proud of us tonight. Hell yeah. Oh really, does Chrissy take care of it? Freaking love Chrissy Redfield. You know, I've actually got a couple of miniature figures. When I get up, like in a bit or something, I'll, um, I'll show you guys. They're very rare. My mate, he was selling off his resi collection a few years ago. And um, gave me first dibs. Very rare. I've got Claire and Chris uh, figures. They're so sick. Oh shit! Yeah, we need to leg it the other way, don't we? Let's just take cover. Right, let's go. Oh, don't snipe us. She's a boss. Did she literally just take two steps at a time? She's an absolute little boss. Indigo blue plate. Yeah, we need that back at the guillotine as well, don't we? Oh 
a little heartbeat in my ear. I thought it was my little ear drum or something. <laughs> it's a little heartbeat on the game. Oh, it sounds great, man. Team Daddy and Boo have headed over to Twitch. Uh, first time chat. Thanks for dropping in on there, man. Uh, he said, hope you're all good. Love Resi Games. Currently playing Ari 4 Remake. Hope you're enjoying that, man. For me, I think... Um, well, the, the best remake, I think, is RE1 Remake. I love the classic style of it. But I think um, in terms of like more current remake, RE4 absolutely blows it out of the park. It's incredible. I uh, know which way first. Try that one. I know, right? I know, right, Zab. She said, why is um, Alfred Ashford, why is he dressed like a British Royal Palace guy? He looks like a shit beef eater, doesn't he? He looks like... Uh, oh, I was about to say Queen Liz had just ordered a... a Beef eater from Wish, but it's big lugs in it. It's it's bro. Oh, I, I just said Queen Liz. Man, I've just got myself in the feels. Freaking R.I.P. Liz. Bell, thank you for the follow and for dropping that diamond. Really appreciate. It. Thank you for your support. Hell yeah, we'll take that. That's the amoxicillin. Got it, Becca. So w do we need to backtrack all the way back and give that to bro? We gotta drop Bro's roids off. Please let me know if we have to go back there. So we'll take all them, take them. Oh no, wait. I'll, I'll just deposit them for now, just because we've got to. Um, can we do something then? Go back to the lab and then use that card or something, can't we? We'll use that. Um, we'll keep them together for now. I think we'll do a little um, take that. This is an iconic um, uh, save room theme, uh, Run Alone. It is up there with the best ones, definitely. So we'll do another save. And, and someone did ask me, I think it was over on YouTube, it was on a comment. Someone said, why do you save on different slots? It's just in case I proper mess up, then I can just go back to another one. Yeah, I found that real useful. I, I kind of discovered that off my uncle um, like when I was growing up, you know, watching him play. He'd, he'd always make multiple saves and, it, you know, it's real useful. Yeah, thank you, Tyler. We're not doing too bad, man. We're doing all right. Oh. Oh, hell no. Consider the area you are in a special playground I have prepared just for you. Please try and keep me amused, and do not disappoint me by dying too soon. I so want to enjoy this. What kind of laugh is that? He sounds like a broken parrot. He sounds like a parrot that's glitched. What's going on? Yeah, that, that is a good point, uh, Run Alone. He said you never want a corrupted save. Hell no, sir. Okay. Um, and yeah, if I played Dino Crisis, I, I did do a stream on Dino Crisis. It was a little while back, but I'd love to pick it up again and then go, go on to Dino Crisis 2 and 3. Yeah, we could definitely do that for sure. <laughs> it's not actually a box of sun. I, I know, I, I know, Becca, I know it's bros roids. <laughs> if it was a mock sun or calpol, I would be stacking that shit for myself. What was in there again? Uh oh. Why is it why is it giving us a heartbeat? And Bell said, only REI completed banging game. It really is, it's wicked once you get into this. Just need to get good at it. Oh, is this the one we couldn't get in at first? Oh, hell yeah. We'll take those. There is ammo for the submachine gun. Oh, bro, that's bait. You can't do that, bro. That's bait. Oh, no. I can't even remember how to defeat these. Do we even defeat them or do we leave them? Isn't this like... Oh, fuck. Isn't it like invincible, this? Or it just needs shitloads of ammo? I think you're best off um, ignoring, right? Are you? Oh, no. Oh, no. Do we... Oh, shit. Do we have to take this guy out? Shit. 
Oh shit, get off my head, get off my head! You're gonna mess her hair up, she's gonna be pissed! Ow! She's an asshole, man. Oh shit. Fucking how many shots! Jeez, bro! Oh, man. That's minging. Does that actually tie the knife kills it the fastest? Bruh, I'm not I'm not that courageous to go up close like that. Bruh, he's put us on We'll go in there first, then we'll check out that um oh actually was I seeing stuff? I thought there was like two rooms. Um Bro's put us on dirty caution. Oh no You're kidding Come on, Steve to the rescue, it's gotta be. Yes! Go freaking Lucas, let's go! Come on, Steve. Put you back in there, just a little more. The freaking go, Lucas, baby. Don't hate the Lucas, hate Steve, baby. <laughs> oh yeah, that felt good. Don't worry, Claire. Your knight in shining armor is here. You wish, but thanks for the help. See? This is why you need me. I got your back. Whatever. Here, take these. Machine guns? For me? You know the deal, in exchange for your Lugers. <laughs> okay, okay. Got the Lugers. <laughs> this thing is too cool. Yes! Now this is my kind of weapon. All right. Huh? <laughs> Fuck all in it, Steve. Hey. Dickhead. Look at this one guy. Steve-o! Steve-o! Plenty of them <laughs> just for you. Way up there? Give me a boost and I'll get it for you. All right, all right. Oh, man. Ow! My back. They're heavier than you look. Here we are. Cheeky bastard. You have said that to a lady. Now, w what now that your knight has made his uh -oh. appearance, he can join you in your descent into death. I was about to say, we're like descending into the pits of hell, it's all just gone pitch black. I got this shit down here. Okay, let's do it. Wait here, Claire. Time to test out my new toy. <laughs> That's how you'd be at the Sunday market, wouldn't it? You know, you get a pair of BB guns. Telling me to test out my new toy. Right, what's he got? Okay, he's got those. We'll see how, how long we can go without uh, oh, actually, no. I'm having too much fun. Oh, shit! <laughs> Alright. This fucking Bob the Builder. This construction hat. Let's go. Alright. I said I was sorry. It's gonna be using a submachine gun. <clears throat> yeah, that's it, Becca. I think we could just go nuts. We could just live it up a Steve. So, an indigo blue key card we need for that. Yeah, thank you, uh, Mr. Tibbs. They, they really are those band of snatches. Literally a budget tyrant. <laughs> Void, thank you for the follow. Welcome on in. Great to still see you here, Scott Harrison and Captain Jack Swaz. What's go going on, man? Said so the Dark Souls of the Resident Evil. So it is solid, right, man? Whoa, 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 whoa. A little bit of acid on us there. It is a bit solid, mate. But, uh, we be here. We're gonna be slaying it tonight, babe. We're not doing too bad. Yeah, definitely, Tyler. I will take advantage of that. Hopefully, it'll ease things as when, when we're clear, right? Tyler said kill everyone. Remember, it's Steve. It's free ammo. You mean to tell me this ammo is free? Hey, thank you, Run Alone. Uh, appreciate uh, the raid as well. Um, so good luck with the rest of the stream. Much love. Thank you very much for stopping in tonight. Appreciate your support. Take care of yourself, man. It was dirty work, but this area is now clean. 
See? You can depend on me. You see? This thing is a lot more reliable than any person. Than people? Steve. What were you doing here? Who brought you here and where is your family? Shut up! I don't want to talk about it! It's a little touchy subject for Steve. Don't waste the good ammo, dude! We've got shitloads of the game left yet! Steve. You fucker. <laughs> Never mind. Let's get going! I love that Steve line, uh, Gamers Club. Father! <laughs> so good, man. Frankly, the, yeah, there's no need for that from Steve. It's freaking rude. Damn Steve mag dumping. Bro's acting like we've literally got uh, so much freaking ammo. I'm always scarce in the game, man. You gotta, you gotta freaking chill. Oh, man, I forgot we on that like, dirty caution, aren't we? So that needs the indigo key, key card as well, doesn't it? Let's go through here. Jeez, that made me jump. <laughs> Freaking boot is weighing uh, too much on these planks, man. I love his, uh, love his sound effects. Claire, <laughs> are you okay? Steve, behind you. It's behind you. No. Fala. Fucking ear piercing screech. What's wrong, Steve? Shoot him! Wait! I. I can't! No! Steve! Come on, Steve, I'll throw this G fuel at him. Father, father, father. It's a freaking moment for Steve. He did take the piss and use all the ammo, though. Dad. Shitloads on it. Tried to steal information, intending to sell it off to the highest bidder. He was caught. Mom was killed. And we were sent here. Oh, st so stupid. Just rest. Just leave Steve chilling. Thank you for the reminder of this ammo, Becca. I did see you drop your, your comment in just there. Yeah, I appreciate you guys looking out for me because I know some of you guys are saying, look out for this, look out for this herb, look out for this ammo. Because, yeah, you've got to really observe things on this game because it's a pretty uh, dark kind of colour palette, right? Fred, thank you for sending the rose. We'll, we'll have a cheeky rose jam for Fred dropping the rose and also for Steve's father. Drop a freaking little rose for Steve's father. <laughs> and thank you, Belle, for coming in with that rose as well. Thank you very much, guys. Do appreciate you all. There's loads of you guys in. Thank you very much. Hell yeah. Avatar rang at 360 coming in. Father! <laughs> We're getting a few fathers in the chat right now. Father! 
Alrighty, um, I don't know which door to go in first. Did we come in that one? Or did we come in... Yeah, I think we did actually. Is there anything on that? Or nah? Large size relief. The imagery appears to be telling a legend. I don't see me on there. I don't see a legend. <laughs> I think we'll probably go for like, double doors, I think. Oh shit! Oh shit, bro, bro. Stop. Keep, oh shit, you have to keep like moving closer to him to. Shit, oh no, we're on like, oh we're on danger, oh dear, oh dear. I'm in danger. Oh dear. Oh, we're gonna be really careful. Nice. I'm thankful uh, it glitched just that. Nice, nice, nice. Oh no. You know, I never swan around on danger on Resident Evils, but this is definitely an exception. Frankly, thank you for uh, dropping that uh, custom emoji over on the Twitch. How did you do that, by the way? You, you've edited an emoji of me, I believe. There's, a, there's a, an emoji of me with my, um, my little beret on. I've got a pair of cool shades on. Thank you for that, my dude. Let me just see where this leads. Oh no, the, the fucking... Uh, that grave digger's there, isn't it? Hell nah. Hell nah. Anything there? Oh, the door's been welded. Can we go another way? Deli, welcome on in. Good evening. Hope you're well. How's everything going? Oh, I can't go through there. Is there anywhere else we can go? We're on freaking danger. You've unlocked the door. Okay. Oh, yeah. Tom said that he used to have an RE game. It was on a, a big ship. Can't remember what it was. Um, it'll be... Um, RE Revelations. I do want to play um, Revelations 1 and 2. Yes, we've got the ammo in the other room. I'm not going to start risking it in here because we are on danger. I'm going to be really careful. We can heal up at a box. Just got to get to one. Right, so that's been unlocked. We'll see what's through here. Oh, God, it is horrible. <laughs> it's territory that we're not used to being in there. So we're not used to limping around on danger on our way. Oh, is there a box? Oh, bollocks. It's not a trap or anything, is it? I'll make a little save. Yeah, when you said that, Becca, when you said you was running around the game on, on danger, I was like, I thought, no, you, you will not be the only one that will be us tonight. <laughs> it happens, it happens, you know. Uh, so we'll put it on put it on that one. We'll keep making saves in different slots and stuff. Um, oh, sounds good, Deli. Said, uh, good, thanks. I've had football and rugby on at the same time. Did, did England win, by the way? Because I think it's the rugby, is it World Cup going on? I'm not into rugby. I'm into the uh, the football, obviously, but I know there were some matches on tonight. Right, so we've got that. Nothing else we can do. Seems to be a picture of this room. Oh, okay, so I think um, we're going to look for like another portrait. Yeah, there was evidence that picture was hung here. Okay, we'll look out for that. Oh, no, did England not win tonight? It's a shame. Yeah, even though I don't really follow the rugby, obviously I, I was root for England in everything, you know. That's a shame. What are you guys say? Which one first? Second? I don't want to go to an eerie basement just yet. <laughs> We're not doing too bad tonight. A couple of hours into the game. Not too bad. Right, is that in a lot chat? It's definitely a, a key card, isn't it? We need for that. Card reader. Um, That'll lead back into the Steve room, won't it? Let me just double check that's the Steve room. Right. 
Right, so can't do anything here, can we? Because obviously all the things fell through. I've just got to tread real carefully, guys. That's all. <laughs> oh, basement. Okay, yeah, we'll, we'll go there. Like I said, there's nothing up here for us. Got to do a, a little basement, jacks. Where's your head at? Where's your head at? Captain Jack Swartz, thank you for the follow, my friend. But guys, how has your weekend been so far? And what are you up to for the rest of your weekend? Do let me know. If I can, I will get on for a few hours tomorrow. I am up at the crack of dawn uh, on Monday morning. Because I am back on at work on some overtimes Monday and Tuesday. I've inflicted that upon us. I don't think we've been here yet, have we? What is that? Can we... Oh, can we not go there? Is it like broken or something? It's not letting me up there. Let's go back through here. Um, but yeah, Tom, I would like to stream Revel uh, RE Revelations 1 and 2. I've not actually played the second one. It's one of the only ones I've not yet played. There was nothing there, was there? Was, it, was that just a chained gate over it? Let me just have a quick look. just want to double check what... Oh, yeah, obviously... Need that indigo card key. Gotcha. But yeah, I'll try and make it on tomorrow evening, guys. Um, I am going to have just a little chill one because I need to um, I need to chill and unwind tomorrow. But I'll try and make it on for a few hours tomorrow night. We'll most likely um, continue some Code Veronica, I reckon. Either that or some classic Resident Evil. But um, I think probably we'll crack on with this. Can't remember where to go. I'll look in there. If it's this one or the other door. Oh, bless you, Dak, Aftermath. I just had an 11, 11 and a hour half shift. Exhausted. Bless you, man. You uh, put your feet up and chill out, my dude. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Don't do this to us, guy. Don't do this. Can't you see? We're dying. Freaking tense times. Oh, shit. Oh, we got him. We got him. We'll have to come back for these, I think. I think we've, uh... Oh. You're telling me you can't smash that with a knife? Bruh. Chemical use for gun maintenance. Have we not got anything? that Because that's like a luminous, like, green. It looks real uh, appealing. Oh, bro. Not in there. Is there not in there? Bruh. Okay. But yeah, we have got to work our way back. I'm just thinking of the most, uh, the path of least resistance. I don't know if it might have to be the, um, oh god. I don't have to run past that worm because I think we're going to have to, uh, you know, the gravedigger worm thing. Oh, I don't know if we have to go back there. We're on danger, man. Oh no. Oh no. Bro is in here, isn't he? I think, to be honest, Jack, Code Veronica it is a mainline game. It's set three months, I believe, three months after Resident Evil 2. That's what it told us at the beginning. All right, Tyler, I'll give it a go. We do need to go there. I think, uh, yeah, we're going to have to do some backtracking. So if we go, go back, we need to go to that elevator, don't we? Uh, go back to one of the floors. I can't remember which one it is. So this is the basement. We need to get out of here. So we need to use the, the indigo slab. We need to go give Bro his uh, cow pole. And he'll give us that, the lock pick. Is it that one? I can't remember. Oh, Jodin. You can't get me in the fields like that. You do, do you not realise I'm from Grimsby? Bruh. Said, we're so happy that Stockport beat Grimsby today. We're currently top of the league. Bruh. You've hit me in the feels, my dude. <laughs> my stepdad was actually... The, uh, my mum and stepdad are in Manchester at the moment. He was actually at the game today. Bruh, I'm Grimsby through and through. But, man, I'm happy for you. We're, we're sucking at the minute. It sucks, man. I actually used to play for Grimsby women's. Football team that is, guys, for anyone who doesn't know. 
Yeah, I used to play for Grimsby Women's. I, I was actually um, debating whether to sign up for this season. I, I might still play while I still can, you know? It's just the only thing, like, it's, it's my streaming, you know? I want to still stream as much as possible. It's, it's hard. It's hard to balance everything, you know? It's out here. <laughs> it's fine, Joan, and it's fine. I'm, I've got tough skin, man. It's fine. No, I can always take football banter. Thank you, Fred. Glad you're loving the stream. Fred and Jack, thank you for dropping those roses, my friends. Thanks very much. It'd be so sick. It really would a, a remake of this game, Jack. Ari fans are crying for a remake. They're going to keep us waiting. What about the double ones? I've, I've totally forgot where we are, guys. Sorry. I need to go out where the um, that worm boss thing is and backtrack, I think. Oh, hang on. Where are we now? Oh, yeah. It's there, in it? Bollocks. Can't get out there, can we? I don't know, man. I don't know if we're going to take some damage. There's definitely no herbs, is there? Proper wishful thinking right now. Please just be a herb within the darkness. <laughs> oh, no. Right, we need we need to leg it, man. We, we should be all right. Everyone's gonna say, "Run!" Please. Oh shit! We made it. We made it. Hell yeah! Oh, is there a thing in here? Oh bollocks! We're still not done yet. That yet, have we? I don't know if there's a save in here, is there? Let's have a quick look at the map, see if there's a... Not a save room with a box or anything. I oh, know. Hmm, okay. Right, so we'll use the key card. Please be nice. Please. I need a box so bad. Oh, please. Good doggos. Good doggos. Shit. Oh, shit. Oh, God. Oh, bro, give me something. Nothing around, is there? Where does... I don't know where that leads. Oh, I'm not brave enough to dodge. I wish I was, Becca. I'm not brave enough. Where does that um, ladder go to? Yeah, we've got them stairs. God, it's horrible. I would not even dare run past the doggos. I usually always take them out in, in any RE game. <laughs> oh, is it in... Is there something in one of these? Oh, is it there? Is that a box in that? It goes down some stairs, go to the box. Hmm. Do we use this? Um, can we get this back once we've used it? Because there's an indigo blue thing at the thing, isn't there? At the guillotine. Can we still get it back after we've used it? You know? Because I don't want to miss out on using it at the guillotine. I know. I might just search. I don't want to, like, mess it up. And, like, use it and not get it back. Because I, I know there's a thing, isn't there? At the guillotine. Let's have a look. Uh... Let me just have a quick look, guys. I'm going to have to have a quick check on this. Uh... Oh, you can do either first. In 
video plate. The eagle. What to do with them? Uh, the one at the conference room is used at the guillotine. The one at the northern must be combined with this. Oh, the one at the model exhibition room, it's that one. It's used at the assembly plaza to get the emblem card. So it must be this one, I think. Sweet. So that's the indigo card, that's good. Progress, baby. All right. Thank you, Belle, for sending that diamond. Oh, is Ian Beale? I've got nothing left. So we can't take that back, but there, there are other ones to collect. Let me just go this way, because there's a little, um, I think there's a room with a save and a box there. Oh, bollocks. Of course, it's locked from the other side. <laughs> For fuck's sake. I can't remember what's through here. I'm just going to go have a quick look. Box in this door. Oh, please. Please be nice. Oh, so that's the one that locked. Oh, it's this one in it. Is this one? Or is it that one? It's one of these. Well, it was fucking one of yours. <laughs> yes! We survived, guys. We survived. Come on. Put your back in there. Just a little more. Right. I'm going to put the gold lugas back just to give us some space because um, obviously the, the uh, safe room where we use the gold lugas, there's obviously a box in there. So we can just take that out. Um, is this the right time to run back and give him the hemostatic bollocks? Because if so, I think I may run back for it now. We'll make a save and we'll leg it. Does that sound good with you guys? All right. Beautiful. Oh, it feels nice to be fine again. Can we put that in the drawer? Loop? No, we can't. Right. Use the ink ribbon. Yeah, could you guys let me know? What, should we run back? Yeah, Tyler said now is a good time. Thank you, man. We'll run back and give him that. I don't think I've ever done that before. I didn't realise like he needed that hemostatic. I think whenever I've collected it, I've just left it and just presumed I've needed it later on. Right, we've saved it. We're on fine now. We'll take it easy, and we'll uh, we'll backtrack. This is going to take a little while, so apologies in advance. Miss Dan rest is chief, yo. Hell yeah! I've been on the um, Resident Evil Village chief, yo. Maiden's blood. So good because it looks like blood. It looks like I've been drinking blood. Come on! Hell yeah! <laughs> All right. I have no idea what each area is. No idea whatsoever. I'm gonna have to keep checking the map. Oh no, it's that worm dude and the hunter things on the way back to the mansion. What are them bander snatches? Nah, bruh. They'd be horrible. I'm so glad we made it back, guys. Hell yeah. No, we're doing alright. Um, I'm just going to go see what's down here, because I, I cannot remember. Not been down yet. I don't want to miss anything. If you go into your man with the medicine, there'll be zombies you need to run past and dodge. Oh, oh hell yeah. We'll, um, we'll do that one. I can't remember where we need to go, we'll just go have a look. Oh, it's the basement. Yeah, we're in the basement, aren't we? We'll have a look. Go down, use the blue car. Thank you, you guys, I do appreciate it. Um, nothing there. Let's have a look at these rooms a sec. Oh, really? Do you have to go do that, Tyler? He said, I forgot to, and now have to do extra backtracking as Chris. Man, that's brutal. That is rough, man. Right, can't do anything in there. 
Well, thank you guys for still being in tonight. Yeah, man, it is a grind. Um, do you have a card for that gate? Which gate? Which gate do you mean? Is it? Oh, is it that one? Let me just have a quick look. So you need a lot pit to get in that, don't we? Even though you can just twat the glass and be in there, but okay. Claire's got to complicate it. Oh, it's that one, isn't it? Thank you. I've literally only just seen. There we go. Awesome. I didn't realise, I thought it was like proper blocked off. Again, I, I didn't see the little panel on the wall. Hell yeah! Grenade launcher. Thank you. Oh, bollocks. Oh, oh, shit. Oh, God. <laughs> I don't know where to go. Let's have a little look. Um, right, okay, I think we need to be in there. Oh, shit. Go away. I don't think there was anything in that room we needed, was there? I didn't see anything at a glance. It appears to have been destroyed violently. It's possible that the T-virus leaked from here. The automatic door is locked. I can't enter. Oh, bollocks, man. Oh, no, Becca. This is, this, this is not good to hear. She said this is where I gave up. Oh, shit. There's no power. Oh, there's a, there's a thing there, though. Shit. Oh, bollocks. Can I get in that? Get get off the crate. Hang on. Should we try and take him out? Oh, I don't really want to cut into them. Are we, are we safe up here? Ow, oh, bollocks, no. Bollocks. Shit. I'm trying to get in that room. Ow, ow, get off my head. Bro! Ow! You fuckers. Nothing we can do. Shit, get out of the way, get out of the way. Get out of the way. Oh, the, yeah, I think these crates are... Shit. I think these crates are, like, in the way, aren't they? I can't... I can't get in that door. Oh, it must just be that another locked one. So no, there, nothing you can do there. Shit, just have a quick look at this. If we have to restart, we can restart, it's not a problem. It, it is what it is. Oh, that's awful. I don't know where to, um... Oh, I don't know where to restart where we, uh... I'm not very happy, guys. I feel like uh, I want to restart where we thingy. Oh, I can't even... Yeah. Sorry, guys, I put us on dirty course. I'm just not very happy with it. So uh, let's just... We, we literally evil. saved it just a few minutes ago. So I'd rather just do that. I, d I don't want to mess about. There was nothing we could do there, was there? So we'll go load that one. Right. Let's put that back. So put that back. Um, let's go do what we were doing. Yeah, I noticed that, to be honest, Belle. I uh, noticed that on the map. Uh, it looks like some room we've been in before. So did we go... We went back out here, didn't we? Yeah, go to your mum first. Cool. It's got to find the right way. So we went downstairs, down the ladder, used the card key. So go do that. That's pretty much all we did. I got our ass kicked. <laughs> all right, we got this. It is cool, man. It is such a, an, uh, a challenging game, for sure. What up here, was it? It's not like there, is it? Hey, what's going on, Craig? Welcome on in, Scottish Sheriff. He said, amazing, you're playing Veronica at last. Bro, we finally here. Finally. Hmm. Yeah, I'm the same, Joe. I love Code Veronica, but yeah, this backtracking is, is real. I don't know if we... 
Let's try go up a floor or something. Um, but yeah, finally here, Craig. I have long been waiting to um, stream Code Veronica. It's not the smoothest playthrough because, like I say, I, I definitely need to get good at the game. But um, yeah, I'm enjoying it though with you guys for sure. Um, yeah, they are. Um, they absolutely are, um, Craig. Uh, the Residents of Evil. They're currently playing. Uh, well, I think it was, it was last night, wasn't it? Playing um, Resident Evil Outbreak with uh, Nicole Tompkins, the uh, the original voice actress for um, for uh, Jill in RE3 remake. She a freaking legend. So that's where the box was, I think. Back this way. I I have no idea where to go. Um, let me just see what's on that second floor. So yeah, we've basically got to go way back to the first guy that we saw in the cells. I just can't remember. I'm, I'm not seeing a clue as to where to go back. I just can't remember. It, it really is a solid game, Craig. I, I'm sure it's fine once you, you, you... Like, I've got friends who stream the game. that They blitz through it in a few hours. Like, for example, Matt RPD over on Twitch. For example, there's quite a few people, they, they know it like the back of their hands, that they've just played it that many times, you know. So I'm sure it, it gets way easier once you keep playing it, but um, there's a lot to get used to and stuff. Right, so we've unlocked this anyway. Um, just have a little look. Oh, nice. What, what's it being so nice for? What's it giving us all these herbs and stuff for? Oh, nice. I, I feel like I, I don't really want to mess around just yet. Need to work our way back, you know? Yeah, I think actually... We'll come back to this. So yeah, I think we need to go to the first floor. Yeah. Got it. So back where Steve killed his dad. In that area. And then it's out one of the doors, I think. And then we can begin to backtrack. I think that's what it is. Yeah. It, it just gets a little tricky. Yeah, definitely, Tyler. I reckon so. It does get easier. I found that when I when I play the RE games. Um, when you just play them over and over, it does get a lot easier. Steve still be there chilling. Yeah, this one I think. Oh, he's, he's gone, isn't he? He's gone, man. Quinzing, great to see you in. So I'd love this game. I've never completed it, though. I think there's a lot of people who... Uh, yeah, I love the game, but have, have yet to complete it. It's, it's a hell of a long game. It really is. Like I said, once you get more, like, um, you know, familiar with the game, you know exactly what to do, you're usually all good with it. And if we can get in there just yet. You needed, we needed some power for those shutters, didn't we? I'll check them maybe on the way back or something. Let's go. So that's the palace. So we need to go all the way back here. So now it's finally clicking. I just needed to get to that area where it was familiar. We good now. Good evening to you too, Froggy. Great to see you in. Thank you very much for stopping in. Uh, Quinzing said, hoping for a remake of RE5. Love the multiplayer pack. Me too, man. It really is. It's only um, more recently I've, I've uh, appreciated it on, on the multiplayer. It's definitely, I think, the played uh, best multiplayer. Definitely. But yeah, that, honestly, man, that has been the topic of the night. It really needs a remake, this does, man. abso freaking lootly Desperately needs a remake. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. So there are... <laughs> there are a few zombies to get through. I'm trying to think where we can... Oh no, we didn't die, Becca. We just uh, I got I got us on dirty caution because I ran into those bandersnatches. snatches, and I was like, you know what? I'd rather just we we'd literally saved a few minutes earlier. I was like, we're in a bad position. I'd rather just just leave it, you know, just uh, start afresh. So we're we're fine. We we didn't actually die. We're good. All right. Mm, actually, I don't know if we. Let me just try one of the other doors in here, I think. Yeah, so it's round here. I think 
think it's this one. Past the uh, the graveyard. Yeah, Adam, I need to get a lot more playing time on this under my belt, for sure. Uh, Adam JB Games said, played this so many times, deserved a remake so much more than 4. I, I definitely, I, I believe the, yeah, I don't think 4 was absolutely in desperate need of a remake. I think this could have come before, but I, I think um, this definitely needs to be next. It really needs to be, but I don't think we're going to get it. I think uh, RE5 is going to be next. They're going to, literally, they're going to proper make us wait out for this. Oh, he's dead, he's dead, dead. Whoa, 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 whoa. I almost killed him. Oh shit, I thought I heard another one. Oh. This is one of the uh, definitely one of the more challenging RE games, Froggy. Everyone said how um tricky this one is. It's definitely a challenge. I do quite welcome the challenge, but yeah, so at some points it's a bit oh you've really got to watch your back on this. And hence why like I've I restarted that uh from that previous save. When I got us on Dirty Kosh, I was like, I, I don't want to put us in a bad position and use up a load of health unnecessarily, you know. If, if I have enough space on the way back, I'll pick that up, because we're going to be making a lot of saves, you know. Yeah, uh, I, I do agree. It is, I think this definitely could be classed within the Dark Souls like difficulty of RE, for sure. Bro, we got your roids. What are you doing here? Bro, I'll be flexing. Hemostatic medicine. How kind of you. Thanks. Got a sweet cow pop. Here, let me help you with that. Thanks, but I can take care of myself. Just go. Keep it. It was a gift from my brother, but... Thanks. Here, let me give you this in return. You might need it later on. Now go. Don't worry about me. Bro, we are now the masters of unlocking. Hell yeah, you guys. Oh, hell yeah, we got a little achievement pop up. 50 G Duty and Humanity. I told you guys I hadn't delivered the Calpod to him before. There we go, we got a cheeky 50 G thanks to you guys. Thank you. Hell yeah. Nice. Bowgun powder. Can we do anything with this, guys? Or is it literally just going to be explosive rounds? Oh, I think they are, aren't they? I don't think we can make them into acid rounds or anything, can we? Oh, no, that's for the... Um, there's just explosives, aren't there? And then, obviously, you get acids for the... You can't get acids and stuff for the crossbow, can you? It's just the grenade launcher, I, I guess. Alrighty. There's, a, there's another couple of things where we could... Uh, there was like a drawer in one of the rooms, I think, where we could use the, the lockpick. I'll take this. What's going on there, Kiefer Chow? Said, use plays as a kid and find it so real, crazy how things have moved on in time. Yeah. Like I said, the graphics are a bit outdated, but they still definitely have a charm for them, you know? Uh, Stephen Code Black, what's going on, man? Uh, he said, how's it going? A nice job getting the lockpick. Thank you, man. We, we earned that lockpick. We, we did some mad uh, backtracking for that. Yeah, I did actually get some other um, uh, crossbow like gunpowder earlier on. It made some explosives. So at least we got some more under our belts. That's good. Oh, man. I don't have to take one of these out. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Nice, I think that's him done. Whoa, 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 whoa. Um, is there any way we can use this? I know in one of the... Um, oh, it was in one of the things we can use that. I can't think where it is, though. Cabinet in a room needs a lockpick. Um, I know that there's a cabinet further on um, with some acid rounds in, but th there's also one in, like, an office. I can't remember where it is, though. So we come from the cells. Um... <laughs> Try that for a sec. Yeah, I'll definitely do that. Thank you, guys. Combine that makes some uh, little explosive ones. We'll do that in a bit. 
Um, let's have a look for where it was sat. The one that has a lot of lab and metal detectors. Yeah, there is an office next to that, isn't there? I think it's a fucking hell. Bruh. Could do with some more bowgun ammo as well. Nice. Yeah, so here at the guillotine, there is another. Uh, it does need a little play. But I think, like I say, we, we will pick up another one at some point. So we'll take a look at that. Oh, bollocks. Can't even. Can we get him through this? Oh, nice. Oh, get off, get off, get off, get off, get off, get off, get off. Please deposit no. any metallic. Piss off. In the security box. Piss off. Oh shit. Let's try to clear these out. Oh. Freaking. Can't dodge them, guys. I just want to take them out. I don't want to take them. Oh shit! Don't want to take more damage than I have. Oh guys, it is a mission to finish this game. It really is. Uh, frankly, said I'm. I'm. I too am a part of the haven't finished the game club. I mean, I mean, a lot of people are, man. But yeah, we will get there. What? Can we not? I thought we could. I swear we did that. That's weird. It's not like the same. There's only one in there. That's a bit stingy, isn't it? At least we're still fine. Let's take up, see if there's any. Oh, that's fine. Oh, I can hear some. But if there's going to be any more. We're going to have to get rid of that, though, aren't we, as well? Oh, this fucking blows, man. <laughs> These cards ain't metal, okay. These cards ain't metal. Yeah, yeah. That's gonna set it off, innit? That lockpick. Oh, the bow arrows got you, Bell. My bad. Andy, thank you for sharing the live, my mate. Yeah, that lockpick needs to go in then, doesn't it? Let's just reset it. I, I was only trying just on the off chance. I thought it'd be metal, obviously. Alright. Oh, do you have to set the fire extinguisher with us? We'll do that, man. Thank you. So, yeah, we had some things in here, didn't we? Yeah, it was in like a... Oh, I didn't see these. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. I don't get how we're, we're meant to get these items out and take them with us. I don't get how we're meant to. Yeah, it was in here, wasn't it? I think. Sure it was in here. It's in one of the offices somewhere. Or a drawer somewhere. Hmm. Oh. Now, can we um? Do we eventually unlock this and can we come back? I'm sure we can, can't we? I'm sure we can like get back in. Email to Leon has already been sent. Zoe, thank you for the follow. Appreciate you. That's what I mean, guys. That's why I need to get good at the game. <laughs> It ain't easy. We'll be fine, though. Hmm. Yeah, it's got to, like, leave these here chilling. So nothing round here. Yeah, I really thought it was, uh... Ah, the block door couldn't be unlocked after you get past the guillotine. Thank Please you for, uh, for playing that up, Stephen. Thank you. you have in the security box. Sick of hearing this bitch's voice, man. <laughs> 
put these away. Uh, obviously, we can keep the cards. They're good. You stay out there. Jay Connolly, thank you for the follow, mate. Right, let's take all these back. We'll take all them with us, we'll deposit them in a box. Alright. Oh, yeah, we need to find the other thing, don't we, for the guillotine? I think it said... Um, Hang on a sec. Matt, thank you for the follow, mate. Appreciate that. Oh, bollocks, you already had it digging. I keep, I'm getting nervous, that's why. <laughs> getting nervous with all these zombies around. Come on, let's, uh, let's get some stabby stabs in. Nice. It is real satisfying, actually, using the uh, knife. It's sick. Seems like there's some fresh blood on it. Yeah, indigo plates. We'll do that, um... So I think it said, um, cause I, I did have to look this up, I had to have a little uh, look at this. Um, so the, we, we did do them right, we've done them in the right order. It said the one gotten at the model exhibition room, the one with the portraits in, is used at the assembly plaza to get the emblem card, uh, which we've done. The one gotten at the conference room is used at the guillotine square to open a door. So we've got to look out for one at the conference room and then there's one in a northern sewer. Uh, to be combined with a clement mixture to create the whole bird. So, so there's another one at the conference room for that. You know what, Becca? I, I usually can't use the knife very well, but we're, we're not doing too bad. I've, I've accumulated like, a little bit of damage throughout, but doing okay. Yeah, thank you. It's thanks to you guys pushing the use of the knife. <laughs> yeah, appreciate you guys. Um, right, okay, so now we need to find our way back. <laughs> um through there oh yeah back to the mansion obviously yeah yeah to put the guns in the door thank you oh is this anything i can't remember i forgot we had the gold lugas in there uh yeah that leads to the mansion doesn't it the palace I don't know what to do first, actually. Steve said, go back to the training facility. Try and work on the stuff in that area. Should we use up the key cards? Yeah, th there was still some pickups in there. So that's the palace in it. So go back to the training facility. Um, there was, yeah, there, there was some pickups we uh, need to do. Shit, is that... Um Oh yeah, I just wanted to double check that. There's nothing we could do with it. Let's go back. Right, so we still can't do that actually, can we? The yeah, the ventilation isn't complete. So we'll leave that for now. Um I think we used that, didn't we? And then there's some stuff in here, isn't there? There's all that Windows 95 bollocks, I think. <laughs> oh, thank you guys, uh, you freaking saviours, thank you. Was it this bit? We unlocked something. What if we do them banda slatches? Um Oh, I don't know about here. Oh, was it through there past the ladder? Just double check to see if there's anything in there. It's like... God, this gets so... It's so uncomfortable on my head. <laughs> Is that 
there's the water, I think, in there. Yeah, that's where there's the water. Yeah, yeah. Cool, cold. Right, let's backtrack the way we're going. Freaking holster serious face. All stream. <laughs> What's going on, Harvey? It is a throwback and a half, Code Veronica is. So good, man. Thank you guys for dropping all of the likes and shares on the stream. I really appreciate it. I see you across the platforms. Thanks so much. If you are enjoying Code Veronica, if you don't mind dropping some cheeky likes, guys, it helps a ton. Thank you. Helps the stream a ton. Thank you, guys. And Harvey, thank you for the follow. Okay, the ledge too. First time chat over on Twitch. Welcome on in. Said this game is ace. It really is good. Once you get your head around it, it is decent. Is it in here? Oh, I can't remember where we went to, guys. Is it in... I don't want to go that way. That was where them banders snatched. Well, I don't know if it was up here. Because then Banda Snatchers, it was on that bridge, but I, I, um, sorry, like on like an elevator and stuff, but I, I couldn't do anything with it. Oh, bollocks, that's gone to an elevator. Um... Um... Oh, God, it's absolutely frying my brain, this is, man. Um... Can't think where to um can't we found something at that room i can't if we saw it on the the second floor yeah we've got the grenade launcher mate it was that that's what we unlocked so went in there Let's just have a little look about here Let's just leave that just for a sec. Oh, guys, thank you. My apologies. I didn't activate the, the little like thing as... Sorry, just, just bear with me a sec. Sorry, I should have done it. I do apologise, I didn't set the freaking like counter tonight. This <laughs> one of my one of my very few 360 mates. Hang on a sec. There we go. Thank you guys for smashing those like goals. You see, it's like uh, gone crazy right now. There we go. All right. Yeah. Um, yeah. Okay. This is like the the three sixty part of the game. Oh, piss off! I'm not a, I've run out of room on my desk. Um. Got these, got these. Let's just have a look up here a sec, then we'll go in that room, see what's in there. The albinoid description. A creature which is created by injecting the T-virus into the genes of a salamander. Oh, God. Characteristics. Oh, it's a freaking thing, in it? Similar to a normal amphibian, an albinoid's body will change as it grows with age. When young, an albinoid is small in size, but it can grow it to over seven feet in a very short time frame. 10 plus hours they possess high mobility and are able to discharge electricity these characteristics are most notable when they are underwater in their adult form but yeah i'm playing this on my xbox series x but this is this is the um like a, a hd remaster on the 360 this is so yeah you do get achievements on this part uh benjamin for sure yeah that that guy um said it is online um I used to actually work with him at game. I've known him since I was like 15. I did my work experience at game. Can we uh, wipe these out? Oh, I don't have kits thingy in. Who's that? We got... Sadmash Ghost. Thank you. Uh, first time chat over on, uh, over on Twitch. Thanks for stopping in. Right, so that's unlocked there. We've used that. So we can go through there. Can we get through that one? Oh yeah, of course, sorry. Let me just go get that other proof. Totally forgot about that. Yeah. 
you'll have to pop back to these herbs as well. Um, and yeah, I think like you say, we have to um, pop to the first floor, I think, to use the lock pick, I think. It was this one, I think. It was fucking one of yes. Right. So after all that backtracking, guys, let me just, uh, that's it, stitch these for the minute. Keep that with us. Um, put them away for now. Keep them. Um, put the proof back for now. I'm just going to go get them uh, green herbs and then we'll make a little save here because, yeah, that backtracking, that was a lot, man. Uh, Captain Jack, thank you for showing the live, mate. Appreciate that. Thank you for the likes and shares, guys. It helps the stream a ton. Thank you. Oh, the save music's amazing, Kay. It's so good. It's got to be one of the best save rooms, for sure. Right, let's go get these. <laughs> it's ridiculous, Craig. It really is. It's parts of this, you have to find doorknobs and everything. It gets very hard. They didn't half ramp up all the all the puzzles and finding everything. I think they proper ramped it up for Code Veronica, didn't they? I think this is... I mean, I know obviously you went from PS1 to PS2 and obviously this was out for Dreamcast as well, but it is such a jump, like... Just in the sheer volume of stuff in the game. They didn't have freaking pack some stuff in this game. And up the difficulty, for sure. But my mates, like, I, I know some uh, streamers, like, they, they make this game look easy. Um... Like, obviously, you know, like, people like Bork Basoup, um, Matt RPD over on Twitch. He's a real good friend of mine. Um, I literally shout him out all day, every day. He's, he's amazing, Matt RPD. Love him to bits, man. Um, but yeah, he, he always does Ari um, speedruns. Literally, the original trilogy and this one as well. Uh, a lot. He, he does them literally weekly. And he, he makes it look so easy. <laughs> Whizzes through them in no time. Uh, we'll do another save here. Um, so yeah, I think we have to like use up these key cards for now, um, and then we'll go use the, the gold lugas. We do need to go to the palace, uh, but we'll probably um, do that after we're done in this uh, military training facility. So I've made a save. We'll go head out there to see what we need to um, what we need to do. Um, I'm trying to think. I think we have to go to the first floor. I think. Oh my god, really, Kay? Did you pull that off? So I did the speedrun challenge on this once, never again. I think it was five hours for the rocket launch. That's insane. I know Mr. Tibbs over on YouTube, he said uh, it was like um, four hours uh, to get an A rank. Four hours or less. That's insane. <laughs> insane, bro. Um, I think I'll pop down here. Cause it takes us to the elevator, doesn't it? not this one is it oh, I can't I have no idea where we're going man what's that red door can we unlock that let's go have a look that's insane sad Mashko said uh, beat some one hour 52 I can't believe it like some people oh yeah my bad I thought we um oh fucking hell just give me a sec. Let me just get back to the saver. I forgot to set the cards with us. My bad. I did take the grenade launcher on a on a previous one, but th there was a point where I got us on dirty caution. I, I reloaded a save from like a few minutes prior. So let me just reload that. My bad. My apologies. So we do actually need to re-unlock that to, to get the rocket launcher back. So, my bad. Um, well, grenade launcher. Rocket launcher. Sorry, grenade launcher. Right. Yeah, thank you, um, UBCS. Appreciate that. Um, the military training facility is biggest of 
all areas, so you might as well... Yeah, you're likely to go back and forth, so you might as well get the bigger area finished first. Yeah, it makes sense, man. Uh, Dave Priest, what's going on, man? I can't remember where we went. Did we go down here? Uh, yeah. I think we went down here. I think. Oh, thank you, Tito. I've just uh, seen your comment. Thank you very much, Mama Tito. Said to her, my mum says she loves your energy. She might pop on if her phone switches on. Well, welcome on in, Mama Tito. Thank you very much. <laughs> I appreciate it, guys. Still positive vibes in, just a very concentrated face right now. There's, there's so much spinning around my head. Like, I'm trying to... Right, so we're done with that. That's good. So that's cleared that up. Belle, thank you for sending the GG. Appreciate you. So we've still got to use that. Obviously, we've got to uh, shut off that ventilation bollocks, haven't we? <laughs> right. Let's see what's in there. I think so, Craig. They wanted more realistic problems on. Yeah, screw all the... Oh, shit. Screw all the ornaments and stuff. It'll just be uh, all the... Uh, things like finding the doorknobs and stuff. Is there something in there? Oh, shit. Oh, bollocks. I thought there was a door. Can we not get to it? Oh, it's round there, innit? Hang on. Oh, shit. Get off, get off, get off. Shit. Oh, it was a door as well. Oh, shit. We still can't do anything, though, can we? It's still locked. I can't enter. How do we stop this damn leak? <laughs> I cannot remember. I'm actually not sure, Jack. I'm not sure why um, this game wasn't called Resident Evil 4. Oh, nice. Welcome on in there, Dave Priest. Said, uh, not a lot, not to a lot. Just chilling watching you play this awesome classic. Been years since I played this, and I hope you are. Doing very well, thank you. Yeah, doing all good, thank you, mate. Um, shall we go around there? Is there anything in there? Is that where there's a lockpick thingy? We'll go have a quick look. Um, but yeah, I have completed this years ago, but I did heavily rely on one of my best mates. We, we both like played for it together. But yeah, it's been years since I've uh, last played this, mate. And like I said, I did have a gameplay um, on the go a few years ago, but um, proper glitched myself out at the uh, the Tyrant uh, boss fight on board the aircraft. I just could not get past it at all. Could not get past it, so I kind of glitched that play for out. Can't see any other pickups or anything. I think we should be uh, should be good. Um, but yeah, done that. Let me just double check in there to see if there was any in there. Any, uh, bow gun ammo. Just double check. It's a very dark game, guys. You've got to proper have a look. Can't see anything else. I think it's what's going on. Oh, mate, I'm, I'm not looking forward to the tyrant on the plane. Bruh. <laughs> I thought the movie Snakes on a Plane was freaky. Y'all, I ain't seen Tyrant on a Plane. <laughs> the amount of times I've exhaled into this and not known what on earth I'm doing. So true, Kay. It's my plane, bish. I ain't looking forward to it at all, man. Um, just bear with me. I'm just seeing where we can use the... Um, there's a couple of locked areas on the... Oh, yeah, it's like, this is still on the first floor, isn't it? Um, oh, man, I can't make any sense of this. Got 
there. Uh, Mr. Space Kate, thank you for the follow. Said, okay, Code Veronica is a win. Absolutely, bro. Absolutely. Thank you, Steve. Appreciate uh, you letting us know. Thank you, man. Um, let's have a look. Oh, the elevator one there. Is it, is it on, on here? I keep losing where the freaking elevator is. I haven't seen it in a while. through there. That's that office in there. It's not in this office is the way. There's a lockpick thingy. I'm just going to double check that. And then we'll try to get up to that second floor again. It's not in here, was it? It was here. There we go. Awesome. Nice. Muchly appreciated. If there's anything else to do in here, though. All right. I love how um, Claire's ponytail it proper hovers. <laughs> it's literally fucking horizontal. It's so good when she runs. Look at it when she runs. It's like horizontal. I think it gives her more momentum when she's like running forward. It's so sick. Uh, here's a lot of paint in the room with the paintings after. Trying to think where the um what's the elevator at? Bruh, where's the elevator? Not remember at all. Welcome back in, Becca. Um, so we've not used the Gol of Lugas yet. We've used the Indigo um, card. We've just got to finish using that Bowers card. We need to like switch off like the ventilation thingy so we can get back in that in that room. South Chills dropping in with all those roses. Thank you very much, man. Appreciation to you. Thank you. Awesome vibes in here tonight, man. Just a hell of a lot of concentration. Uh, tonight Kay, thank you for stopping in tonight appreciate you dropping in over on twitch so i'm knackered gonna go to bed uh, but good stuff tonight hashtag justice for code veronica hopefully it will be um a remake coming to us very soon i can i can see resident evil 5 overtaken in the order of remakes but i think they're gonna uh, make us wait out uh, but i think it will be uh back at some point we will get um a remake eventually thank you for being in Kay. appreciate your support as always and take care of yourself thank you Uh, right. I'm just trying to find this elevator, guys. I'm just trying to get to... Oh, is this the second floor? This is. Is Let's just pop in. Thank you again, South Charles, for the support. Appreciate that. Through here. Sorry, I have to keep referring to the map because I'm sure there's like an area we can kind of... Oh, it's not that door. My bad. It's another door. Bollocks. It's the other one across the way. Sorry. One day, guys. Honestly, one day. Um, we, we'll be able to play this a, a lot smoothly. Th this is just our rough patch on this, okay? <laughs> it's just a, a little bit of a rough patch, this is. Because uh, I've got to still get good at the game. Oh, it's not that one, is it? That's there. I keep ending up at the same damn place, man. Keep ending up at like, the same place. In this door blocked, is it? It's locked, I can't... I think that's where the bandersnatches are. That's the save room. 
just deposit um I'm not gonna use that grenade launcher anytime soon. I mean at least I don't want to. Just wanna be saving that up. Can we combine them or can you only have six? Let's have a little look. See what we can do. Oh we can. Beautiful. Um just take a little green herb, get us up to fine again. Yes, we've got to finish using this uh, silver key card. But yeah, we need to switch off the ventilation in that lab. And I cannot remember how to. Oh, thank you, South Chills. I'd love your gameplay of Resident Evil 3. Um, yeah, I, I absolutely adore... Um, absolutely adore Resident Evil... Uh, the original um i do actually appreciate the remake i appreciate what we got but it, it was absolutely done dirty you know it deserved so much more but i do appreciate like the the gameplay we did get but i think it's so insulting man it took me longer to complete oh my bad just a thing on the enemy um it took me actually took me longer to complete the re4 dlc separate ways than, than it did to complete re3 remake it's insane so yeah we got the uh, proof from here, didn't we? We've got one of the proofs. Oh, I didn't see we could interact with that. Bro, we can go do that now. Zoom in. Oh, hell yeah. 1126. I don't know if the game will remember it for us, but we've got it. Oh, my bad, guys. I'm sorry. I didn't realise we could... Uh... I just took the proof off the desk and then left. Um, so one one two six, got it. So I write that. I've just written that down. Awesome. Right, so that's finally finished. So we need to. Oh fuck! Make our way, <laughs> way back there. Um, do we need to be? Not there. Not there. So back out this room. Um, make it back down to like the first floor or something, I think. Oh, three got done dirty on another level. I, I do think Harry 2 Remake got done dirty as well. I don't think that's excluded. I think that, that was done dirty. I think so. A lot of people defend it. I, I've had a lot of shots thrown at me for calling that out, but I don't think I should get away with it. RE2 Remake was done dirty, and then RE4, like I said, I'll always be slightly bitter towards RE4 Remake because it was that good. I adore it, and it, it's the it's Capcom's favourite child, in my opinion. It is the favourite child. Can we go into that room, and then that's a lot? Yeah, it's this one, I think. Capcom's favourite child got the absolute best treatment. It's like, it's good, but you, you should have done this with RE2 and 3. You're crazy, bro, you know? They're insane what they've done. The Resident Evil series is incredibly turbulent, I think. It really is. It's the best series ever, but it's just the most turbulent. <laughs> Needs to be handled with such care, you know? Alrighty. Uh, so we're back up here. Can't remember which one it is. Let's just have a little look what we what we're dealing with. So we've got that in here. Can we unlock that? Oh, the doorknob's missing, okay. <laughs> Alrighty. We're getting on alright now, Danny. We went for a little bit of a gl uh, blip where I was, like, backtracking. I got a little lost and everything, but we're, we're good now, man. We're getting there. Enter the pass number. One. One. Two. We're making progress now, man. It's kind of... Things are... You know when you um, run around for ages and then it, it just clicks? It, we're, we're, we're all right now. We're getting there. Bright Wolf, welcome on in, Benny. Said, hey, Holster, how's it going? We, we're doing good, thank you, man. It's good tonight. It's been real challenging, but so good. It, it's such a brilliant game to play through. And uh, Lee JW, thank you for the follow. And Bell, thank you for dropping that code in there. Do appreciate when you guys uh, keep... Uh, Keep the codes and good information handy and stuff. Thank you. It's cracked. Maybe something escaped through the crack. It 
it has literally been it has literally been the topic of conversation all stream guys about uh remaking this game as cool as it is it would really benefit i think from an over the shoulder remake all right we can go put that in the oh fucking hell go put that in the portrait room look at this little shit <laughs> oh i maybe jump that <laughs> of course there was going to be a consequence oh bro i've not even got the grenade launcher oh shit what are you on about oh no what 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 oh we just got to get out got it oh Go, 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 go. We just gotta get out of the actual facility, I think. Fuck, fuck, run, run, run. Come on, Claire. I think Claire's ponytail's fucking touching Jupiter right now. <laughs> go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. I think, yeah, I'm, I'm sure this like blows up, doesn't it, right? Go, 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 go. There we go. Is that it? Right, now we need to work out where to use this. I could not remember. <sighs> Do any of you guys remember? First floor. Um, the diorama room. <laughs> I cannot remember. I'm gonna have to take a little guess, guys. I'll do a little bit of guesswork. <laughs> the saga of Claire's ponytail. It's insane! Look at it! Like freaking horizontal. She like streamlined. That's how she's like so fast. But thank you guys for still being here. Uh, I don't know if it was like through actually. Was it through there? Or was it one of these rooms? I'm, I'm having to like scan all the rooms, guys, because I can absolutely could not remember. Go to the elevator, take to the first floor. The room's in the hallway outside the first floor. No thanks, bro. <laughs> yeah, thank you, Benny. Um, yeah, so this hoodie, it's... Um, by my friend Corey. He's uh, got his own Etsy store. It's called Nova 3. If you guys head over on YouTube, I'm Holster TV over on YouTube, TikTok, Holster TV mate over on Twitch. Um, but yeah, if you head over onto YouTube, you look in the description of the stream, um, Nova 3, his um, Etsy store is called. Real reasonable and decent quality items. Yeah, so I'm, I'm a huge supporter of his uh, stuff. I love how this says, it's a um, RPD hoodie. It says recruit and it, it proper looks like... Um, I, I just love it because it, it like proper looks like a something like you know a recruit would wear. It's just so cool that it says recruit. I really like it. Is the elevator like round here or something? I am aiming for the elevator. I just can't remember where it is. I'm sure it was like around this area somewhere. Is it that? Let's have a look through here. It might be this way. Yeah, appreciate all you guys for still being here. We are past midnight here in the UK. Don't you know I'm still standing. Here we go. They were ridiculous, Dave. Um, the, uh, the scenarios A and B. You can't even call them that <laughs> on RE2 Remake. Like, what even were they, you know? They were awful, man. Yeah, they absolutely did it dirty. Um, is it this one? Oh, man. I love how they've got the classic zombie Ari sounds on this. Right, we'll just spam what we can. Oh, shit. Oh, bollocks. As if that's put us down to caution. I've hardly had any bites or anything on this. How's it got us down to caution so easy? He's doing us dirty, bro. Get off. What's going on, Joe Chavez? Welcome on in, man. Twat. Freaking language tonight. This game be testing me. <laughs> What's going on, Clay? Welcome on in. And Defez. What's going on? Here we go. 
don't know what this is going to do. Oh, nice. Oh, beautiful. Gold key. Okay. Memorial plate. There is some writing on it. Dedicate to the training facility's completion. December 8th, Alfred Ashford. That looks sick. It's a diorama modelled after this facility. It's a hole to put something in. It's not that, is it? What do you put in that? Oh, hell yeah. Oh, nice. We'll gladly welcome that into the inventory. Nice. Okay, so gold key. Um... I can't remember what areas need a gold key. Is that in the um, palace? I'm sure there are gold and silver keys in the palace, right? Oh yeah, that's a save in it. Um, right. Let's just take a little look. Um, I think we'll probably have to go back to the elevator. Um, Oh yeah, I think so actually. Is it this one? Sorry, let me just check. This is the door. Now, so we go out of here, the door on the left, and then we're heading towards the palace, I think. I think we're good. No worries at all, Becca. Thank you so much for being here. Appreciate your support as always. Um, so I'll catch up on YouTube, um, but the wee one ain't said. Oh, bless. Hope, uh, hope the little one uh, gets to sleep okay very soon. Take care, Becca, and uh, catch up with you in another stream. Take care of yourself. Have an awesome rest of your weekend. Yeah, so through here. Nice. We, we, we're we doing good, guys. We're we, uh, making some progress. And no worries, Belle. I know Belle's dipping out right now. Thank you very much for being here. And thank you for, um, yeah, dropping with the follow tonight. Welcome on into it to our crazy gang. Welcome to the party, pal. <laughs> now, thank you very much. We appreciate you. BZ, thank you for coming in with those diamonds. Massively appreciate you. Paul Brown said, uh, oh, bollocks. He didn't say that. He said, I got a swear box next to me. Oh, you probably did say that then <laughs> when I'm playing games. <laughs> Bro, I could not even afford a swear box. <laughs> Yeah, we good. Let's go. Thank you, Benny, for sharing the live. Welcome on in, Alfie. Ooh, who invited you guys to come swarming around? Bruh. We'll make a little save. Oh, piss off. Oh shit. Go on, go on. Nice. Should we do the Lugas yet? Or I think I'll I'll wait I'll hold off on the Lugas. We'll just like use that gold key first, I think. We'll do that. Oh like Dave, it's so good. Uh, for anyone who's not played uh, RE4 remake, uh, the, the separate ways DLC is incredible. Please do play it. You will love it. It's an unreal DLC, it really is. Benny, thank you uh, for dropping in on Twitch. Appreciate you. Combine that up. Deposit them for now. Yeah, we'll hold off on the Lugas for a sec. Um, there is an army proof, but don't need it just yet. Um, pop that away. Yeah, you don't get much, man. You really don't get much on this game to play with, you know. What a proper... Oh, you're kidding! It did us dirty! Used a freaking green home and it didn't even take us off caution. You can't do us dirty like that. Freaking rude. Alright, I fell out with the game now. Hate this game. <laughs> Bruh. Nice. 
We've done good. We've done good tonight. Been uh, streaming for just over three hours right now. We'll, we'll be on for a while longer. Probably be on for another hour or two, something like that, guys. We'll do a proper long stream. <laughs> My mate's gone back online again. What's going on, Mark? <laughs> I need to. I literally thought the um, notifications were um, like disabled. And then we've still been getting the achievements and everything. <laughs> yeah, he's, he's my um, ex-colleague. I actually used to work at Game here in the UK. Well, I, I worked as a Christmas temp. I've actually known the guy since I was like 15 because I uh, I did my um, work experience there uh, when I was 15. And then um, once I turned 80, because I was like begging for a job there, I wanted to work there so bad. Um, Oh shit. I wanted to work there so bad. Oh. Yeah, I didn't have any like contracts with full time hours. So I had to go work in a factory once I turned 18. But I, I was there for quite a few Christmases. I was a Christmas temp. So I used to work my factory job and then work at game part time. I absolutely loved it. Okay, that's a silver one. Be gold key, I think, downstairs or something. I think so, Benny. They, they are a little quicker, these zombies. Yeah, I've got to be pretty fast with them. I do try and leave some if we can go round them, but um, for the most part, I like taking them out. I hate leaving them roaming. Nice, he's done. Oh, it's in one of these. I think in comparison to the zombies, Jack, yeah, I think Claire does, does move slow in comparison to the zombies, for sure. I hope there's anything in here. I'll just, I'll just take a quick look. I don't know if I'm going to get my ass kicked, actually. I've not got the lighter. Shit. Yeah. Fuck. Get off. Yeah. Oh, shit. Get off. Hopefully they didn't damage us too much. Oh, it's unreal, isn't it? It's, it's crazy, day. Um, I actually... I was going to hold out on getting Spider-Man 2 until there was, like, a price decrease, but... I've Amazon Primed it and it's coming by 1pm tomorrow. <laughs> I'm having a nice chill day on Spider-Man too. Um, but yeah, I'm hoping to make it on uh, for a little bit tomorrow night, guys. I'll most likely uh, be able to come on for a, a few hours. That's a silver crest. Can we unlock this other one? I think it's this one with the gold. Awesome. Single-use key. Oh, there's a little puzzle here, isn't there, I think? I can't remember what this one is. Message to the new family master. Sir Alfred, congratulations on your succession as master of the Ashford family, you absolute bum. I hereby present you with an earthenware vase according to the Ashford family tradition, so don't go sell it to the Antiques Roadshow, you twat. As you may know, this tradition first began when a butler presented a golden teacup as a commemorative to Veronica. As founder of the Ashford family, her intelligence and beauty are legendary. The second and third master, Stanley and his son Thomas, were also presented with similar teacups. It was their hope to achieve glory as Veronica did before them. The position of family master then shifted from Sir Thomas to his twin brother, Sir Arthur, where, then went to Sir Edward, your grandfather. That was when the Ashford family enjoyed its golden age. It was also Sir Edward's achievement that established the large chemical enterprise Umbrella. However, when Sir Edward passed away and your father, Sir Alexander, succeeded the position, the glorious Ashford family gradually began to sink. I sincerely hope that the Ashford family regains its glory with your guidance, just as this vase continues to shine eternally. Scott Harmon, butler, Ashford family. I wonder if he actually got, um, I wonder if he used to get locked in the, the freezer. <laughs> uh, Captain Jack, thank you for being in tonight, man. But, uh, have a good stream and take care. You, you too, man. Thank you for being here. Let me... Old Ashford Succession. Oh, bro. I forgot to read that thing again. It's a proper mouthful that was. Hey, what's going on? Jordan Roscoe, welcome on in. Hope everything's good for you, man. Mm. All right.
trace the Ashford legacy, reveal the true master. There's a book with... Oh, no, I'm not going to do that shit. So, Veronica and Stanley. Are they the little twins? Can we see that thing again? Remember to do master. So we've got Veronica. Let me write this down. I've got the little uh, RPD notebook right there. I'll let you guys know if I get stuck. So let's have a look. So we've got Veronica. So let, look, let's look out for that bitch. Thank you, Joe. Having an awesome weekend so far, man. Yeah, I'm going to play, uh, have a chill one playing Spider-Man 2 tomorrow and then hopefully um, come on for a few hours. We'll pro most likely uh, continue this for a bit. Stanley and Son Thomas. Thomas. So they're the second and third. What are you saying, Hayden? You said... What is your favourite Resident Evil that you could play over and over again? It's the original Resident Evil 2, easily. It's my favourite video game of all time. Uh, RE3 original, that is just under as well. That is uh, incredible. Twin brother, Sir Arthur. So fourth is Sir Arthur. Twin bros, bros before hoes, then Sir Edward, and I think that's it, then Sir Alexander, sixth is Sir Alexander, right, cool. Yeah, I mean, I love all the, I, I pretty much love all the Ari um, soundtracks, but yeah, I love the second one uh, the best. It's my favourite save room, favourite um, self-destruct alarm sequence sound at the end. Everything, I, I just absolutely adore it. Um, it comes above everything, but I do appreciate the other Resident Evils, obviously. I'm a massive old school Resi fan. I'm, I'm all about the uh, originals. I love the original trilogy. I do obviously play the ones after that, though. I do like it. Uh, thank you for being here, Joe. Do appreciate you. And uh, yeah, hope to see you on the next stream, man. We should be online tomorrow night for a few hours. Thank you for being here, as always, man. Right, we need to find out who's who. That's him at the end, isn't it? Are you meant to know who's who? <laughs> What's going on, Timmy Shrew up the GY? Right, I assume that's Veronica, so we'll do that one first. Then there's Stanley and Thomas. They're the twin bros. So I think I might go to... We'll go to them. Then Sir Arthur. How do you know who that is? Have a quick look. Oh, bollocks, I done it the wrong one. Thomas and Arthur. Stanley. It said Stanley and Sir Thomas, didn't it? I don't know if the first one was Veronica or not. Butler with a golden teacup. Stanley the son Thomas. I don't know how you meant to know who's who. 
look at this. You go, who's this ginger bastard? <laughs> I don't freaking know. You all look like you're all about to cash in on the Antiques Roadshow. I don't, I don't know who's who. <laughs> Bruh. Uh, yes, that's right. Veronica Stanley, Sir Thomas and Sir Arthur. Is that Thomas? Then that's Arthur? Both the ginger ones. Let's see if that works. Thomas and Arthur. It's got to be those two pair of gingers. Sir Ed and then Sir Alexander. So keep the old bloke with the grey hair at the end. So we'll have him. And then we'll go for the... Uh, the old fogey. <laughs> Let's see if that's done it. Did we do it? Oh. I don't like that noise. I don't think that's done it, has it? I don't think that's done it. I've done something in the wrong order, I think. Oh. Something must happen once we get the right order, because that, that doesn't seem right, does it? Yeah, the individual ones are Thomas and Arthur. I must have got maybe the... Um, I think I got the uh, the gingers mixed up. Let's do Veronica. Then Stanley with the twins. I'm sure it's right. Tea set. Do that. Then, then we'll do that one. Then we'll do the other ginge. I don't even know who's who. Let's try that. What's going on, Nathan Lundy? Work on it, man. Right. Come on. Oh. <laughs> it went silent for a minute. I thought we'd done that. Edward and Alexander backwards. Oh, bollocks. Okay. In Alexander the old fogey, though? Oh, my bad. Okay. Right, so let's do that. Does it matter what order the twins are in? Try this ginge first. So do that. Oh, shit. Do the other ginge. Then the silver fox. And then the other one. There we go. Let's try that. Hey, we got it, guys. Hell yeah. GG. We got Veronica. Oh, nice. I wonder if that... um. Portrait of a young woman, a floral pot is also illustrated. I wonder if uh, we take that. Do we put it next to the diorama? Hell yeah. Thank you, guys. GG. They see us rolling. They're hating. I'm trying to think what... Um... So it's on the first floor, isn't it? I assume we put it with, with that, um, oh, hang on, let's have a look at it, actually. Bet there'll be thingy, in there. Is that a self-destruct button? Oh, no, Queen Ant. Contains a red ruby. Could you take it, that out? Not sure where um, that goes. We pressed the pressed switch of an amp, didn't we? In the uh, Luger room. That's the only place I've seen an amp. Oh, are we, are we good for the gold Lugers now? So I think that's the only thing we can like do, innit? So we'll progress with those, I think. 
I think we, I'm sure you run into Steve when you're ready to use the Lucas. I can't remember. Bro, have these respawned? Oh no, it's fine. We just left one, didn't we? Yeah, I'm only messing, uh, Dave, when I say ginger. I know a lot of lovely gingers. And I, I know some viewers are ginger. I love you guys. You guys know I love you, really. I only say that. You know? Doom, 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 doom. Doom, 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 doom. I don't know what's coming up, so I'm just going to make a little save. So I don't know what's going on. Do, do, do. <laughs> Johnny said, run into Steve like you're down the corner shop. Cracked me up. We do, man. We'll be bumping into our Steve. I said I'm sorry. <laughs> Only fucking bumped into Steve. Let's unequip him. There we go. Go and use. There we go. Oh, bro. I want a pair of replica gold Lugas, man. Yeah. Oh, is there a storm going on outside? It's always pissing it down, isn't it, in horrors? It's never nice. Cal Hyatt, thank you for the follow, mate. Appreciate you guys uh, still being in tonight. An antique music box. What we got here? The puzzles in this game are sick. So good. The effects that thunder. Hey, eh? First digit left, right, right. Let me just... Uh... Let me write this down. Left, right. Second digit left. Third digit right. Fourth digit. Fucking hell, it's like being back at school. Right, right, right. <laughs> I like to take it old school, so I like good old pen and paper, you know? You must not reset while manoeuvre. Right, okay, whatever. We'll see. Oh, is that it? Do we not collect that? It's like glowing. I don't know if we needed to. No, I think that's it. Got it. There is no power going to it. Turn the computer on. It's fine, guys. Windows 98 will solve everything. You're weird playing with fucking beetles and ants and bollocks. You're weird. <laughs> I was literally binging Ed, Ed and Eddie, Courage the Cowardly Dog, and uh, Dexter's Lab when I was your age. <laughs> Please enter the password. No, I don't, I don't know. He used to say that, didn't he? But I love chickens, Eddie. <laughs> Alright, so left, right. So that should be the first digit. So we should have one. And then second digit left, nine. Third digit right, seven. And then right three times one 1971 that should be right anyway let's have a look i used to buy so many jawbreakers as well when i was uh when I was young, because so I always wanted to have jawbreakers like Ed, Ed, and Eddie. I never in my life finished a jawbreaker, though. Have any any of you guys finished a jawbreaker? Nice. The puzzles are so sick on this, though, man. Like, it, it is a tricky game, but whoo, you can't fault it, though. Come on, let's go, let's go. Whoa. Let's get past this band of bollocks. I ain't having this. <laughs> D 
The atmosphere is sick on this game, man. See, it, it is alright once you kind of know what you're doing, things click into place, you know. It is alright. Decent progress, guys. William McNeil, McNelly, sorry. Uh, welcome on in, man. Hope you're all good. Been loads of you guys dropping in tonight. Oh, shit. Oh. You fucker. Oh, shit. Oh, don't, don't do that. Why you got to take these cheap shots, man? <laughs> Dave finished a jawbreaker. So I did one, took ages. <laughs> Oh, man, I was not as hardcore as you, man. I'd put them under my bed and think, yeah, yeah, I'll work on it tomorrow, you know. You literally have to work at them, you know. And then, yeah, I'd, I'd come back and it'd just have, like, a load of dust on it. I was like, oh, I'll start again. I'll get another jawbreaker. You never see them around nowadays. I think you've got to go to a proper, like, specialist sweet shop, haven't you, to see them nowadays. Oh, bro, I don't like that we haven't got the uh, lighter. Because all the bats are all over us. Literally batshit crazy. Get off. It's all cray cray in here. But yeah, the, the vibe is awesome in here, innit? There is a proper, um, there's like a proper, um, what is it? Um, Alexia and thingy Ashford. There's a, a room in the way you put them beetle ants, I think, something like that. I remember they've got like their own room, haven't they? I think there's like, oh shit. Guys, I think I don't know if I'm gonna have to. Um, I think we'll, we'll have to try get a distance and oh, come on, Claire, fucking hell, man. Shit. I'm trying to like keep a distance and get some shots on it. I'm having to listen real closely because I'm blind firing. Shit. Nice, we got it, we got it. <sighs> Get it eventually, it's just not as easy, is it, right? <sighs> it is indeed uh, William, it is Code Veronica. I haven't seen them in ages. I'll have to use some uh, bow gun powder on that, make some uh, fingers. Oh, are you kidding? It was all this for like an ink ribbon and a few bows. Fucking hell, Sam. There's a plentiful supply of firewood here. Do, do we get something to ignite this? Do we pick up another lighter? Because it's made a comment on it. I just wonder why it acknowledges that, you know, we might need it. So we've been playing the game almost about four hours now, uh, William. About three hours forty. Oh, you're kidding. You have to use the lighter here before you trade it. Fucking hell. So if you kept the lighter and did that, like, and, and then go back, like, man, you wouldn't have to backtrack loads, right? That's insane. That's insane, bro. That would have took ages, bruh. Oh, it doesn't do anything. Just lights up the room brighter. Don't give any extra item. Bro, I'd be fuming. Thank you for letting us know, uh, man. Our enemy is only a little girl. They're here, let's Why go. Is taking so long? My apologies, Alexia, but I have been doing my best. The revival of the Ashford family depends on your success, brother. I am aware of that, Alexia. I will revive the family name myself and make you the master of the glorious Ashford family. Do not worry, brother. I will handle them both myself. Who is there? Is someone at the corridor? What is it, Alexia? N nothing. I believe I must have been imagining things. Let us go, brother. Yeah, they're a proper pair of weirdos, them two are. A large sized doll, probably custom made. That's scary as hell. I remember, like, in our old house, um, when I lived with my mum, um, It's like, yeah, I grew up in a house for a bit. Then it was when I was 15, we moved to another house. But yeah, that previous house. So, man, there was the freaking 
she had like a doll collection that was just all over the place, all over the land and everything. It was so scary. We only had one toilet, so if you woke up in the for the night, um, in the night for the toilet, you were fucked. You would have to take a long walk downstairs and go through, past all those dolls. Scariest thing ever. That's why I'm so desensitized to horror. <laughs> Fucking scary, man. <laughs> What's going on, Dribs? Yeah, it's mad, isn't it? The voice actors for these two, for these freaking pair. Oh, Red Queen and Blue King return, the path opens. Stop the music box? Do you have to stop it to um, insert it? Oh, there we go. Cool, cool. So we'll... Uh... Oh, quick like that. Oh, thanking you. Hell yeah. Oh, shit. Jeez, man. So can we put the red ant in this one then, I guess? And then we'll uh, find a, a blue one. Oh, I've got a fair stake. So we are on dirty caution right now. Take the plate. Can we? Oh, it's, let's do it. It's not close that up. That's cool. Um, yeah, we'll do that. We're going to have to like backtrack into the palace, aren't we, at some point then to use that silver key? Well, I, I think we kind of are in the palace, aren't we? But we've got a little... Uh... Oh, the whole of the scene's been sealed. Yeah, we've got to backtrack and use that silver key. I've not yet, Joe. I've not played uh, Resident Evil Dead Aim yet. I almost got it at CX. Like, I'm talking months ago. Um, it was like... Um, it was like uh, 15 quid. Uh, but it had no Manuel, sadly, so I left it. I want, I want a complete copy, you know, but I, I will try out um, Resident Evil Dead Aim at some point for sure. I do want to make sure I've played uh, all of them. You best save soon as well. Tyrant soon, I think. Oh, you're kidding, Dave. You're fucking joking me, Dave. You're having a fucking babble. <laughs> no, thank you for letting us know. I appreciate it, guys. Hey, what's going on, David? <laughs> Right, so we do need, we need the blue ant then, don't we? Message card. My dear brother, I firmly believe that the glory of the Ashford family will be revived through your courage and strength as an honoured soldier. Yours faithfully, Alexia Ashford. Yeah, you know what, I've actually, I've heard the, um, even though I've not um, played Dead Aim, I've heard the um, save room theme in that, it's great, man. So good. Can we use the plate in here? Oh. Right, so let's put the blue one in there first then so we can open that up and use the plate. Okay. We're coming this one. All right, we're gonna. Oh bollocks! Get off! Get off! Oh, it's so hard to. Can you can you shoot these? Oh, can you... I don't know if it's worth shooting a few, just to at least fucking lessen the blow. Cause it's... This is ridiculous. Oh, they're doing my head in. Do they respawn? UBCS said it's a waste of ammo. Do, do they respawn, man? Yeah, I'd rather kill them. Um, let's just have a quick look in. So that was a little puzzly room, I think, wasn't it? Let's just head out a sec. So, yeah, obviously, um, I think we'll probably have to go use that silver key because we can't progress uh, anymore. What's going on, G? This is Code Veronica, man. Welcome on in. I hope you're well. Oh, shit! Fucking hell, I forgot about these. Oh, jeez, these hurt. Oh. Shit. Oh, bollocks, I can't see. Fucking hell, man. 
it's proper test of my patience, man. It's because it um, it's because it uh, changed the camera angles. I've got all disorientated. Like, where where are we? Oh, we don't do fucking hell, man. <laughs> fucking banner statues suck. They they made me all disorientated. I've gone the wrong way. Ah. Oh. I fucking hate these guys. I literally never get mad on the stream as well. Fucking arseholes, man. <laughs> Can't deal with this. There's a red head at the top of the stairs. Oh, man. You know what? We'll go, we'll go up for that. Thank you. Um, thanks, Ubisoft. Yes. Oh, yeah. I can only just see that. I can hardly even see it. Thank you. We'll need that because he's going to... I'll see if I can push it and then I'm trying to use it like the last second. So if we stay on their, their left-hand side, then you can thingy, can't you? Go on, go on. Nice. That's it. Fucking hell. <laughs> He's so mad, man. No, you know what, G? I've been absolutely fine up until that point. You walked in at the wrong time, bro. I've actually been really cool. <laughs> I've been fine tonight, bro. <laughs> I promise you, man. I hope you're well, though, G. Joe, thank you for the follow. They're just a pain in the ass. I hate them. I forgot how like, annoying they were. Oh, fucking hell. Right, we're, we're on dirty caution. Oof. Yeah, you've just got to very tactically dodge them. Right. Like a little save. If we've got a first day, I think we'll have to use this green and uh, red. Wait, we've got a... Oh, we have got one, actually. Use that. Put them back in. Um, I don't think we'll... We'll pick that up on the way back. There's no point in taking up space, you know? And I'll use the... Uh, first day once we get desperate like if we do get on uh, danger you know I, I always try and push it till like we really need the help you know try not to use them lightly uh, South Chills thank you for uh, dropping in with those diamonds thank you man we're doing good making uh, alright progress it's been a little turbulent so far but we, we've been doing okay okay-ish I'm literally the world's most okayist gamer <laughs> okay Nice. Silver key. Oh, it's fine. That's, there are footsteps. I wonder what was going on. Is this like a gambling room? Bro, I love a good bandit. Could never win on him, though. Love a good little cheeky gamble. Come on. Hell yeah, cheeky casino. Right, chill here and just play the Moonlight Sonata for the rest of the evening, guys. I'm a little chill. It's designed so it reads out data. Must be something to slot in there, maybe. Oh, nice. Some cheeky herbs as well. Hell yeah. Like you say, the, the proper camouflaged on there, guys. It's a very dark game, so you've got to be really um, observant. Chrissy Legs, welcome on in. Said my absolute favourite RE. Bro, it, it, this is probably... Um, like, from what I've played, because I can't really remember the rest of it. It's probably, like, one of my favourites, to be honest. It really is, uh... They, they really did, uh... Take some fine, like, care with this and, like, detail. Like, it's, it's unreal. One of them is... Oh, can we, can we chill on it, bro? Come on. So, I think there's obviously there's somewhere else we could use the silver key as well. So, we'll go and take a look for that. Uh, we'll put the herbs back as well. Just so to, you know, to free up some space and stuff. We'll do that. Oh, yeah, I used that spray, didn't I? I think I just did it to save some uh, space. And, I, yeah, I should have probably waited till we, we was on, like, danger or something. I hate going round injured. Like, you, you know, she's holding herself. Like, it just, it, it gets me in the feels, you know. It starts upsetting me. <laughs> I start getting upset, you see. 
because, uh, yeah, I don't like seeing her in rough shape, you know. Right, we'll go put them explosives back with the other ones. I kind of subconsciously used that. I didn't even mean to use that. I was just sorting the inventory out. Uh, right, let's go. Oh, nice day. So this is the first game I ever got on Dreamcast, day one. This and Soul Calibur. Mate, Soul Calibur was a great beat of up. Do you remember Soul Blade on the PS1? I think that was... Well, not like the... Um, like... That is in, like, the Soul Calibur series, right? Soul Blade was great. I really enjoyed that one. I've, I've got that in my collection. I think it might be that one. <laughs> yeah, that's right, Jane. So it's probably the medic in you. Yeah, I, I hate all injuries and stuff. You know, so heal it up. Heal it up, bro. There we go. Look at a ponytail. Even the ponytail wants to get in. It's like... Whole horizontal, ready to barge the door in. <laughs> Insane. Oh! Fucking hell, man. Oh. Let's try and just get this room done. <laughs> Ow! Fucking suck, man. Oh my god! He can't do anything! Hunk's report. Freaking Hunk. Attention of Mr. Alfred Ashford, head of the facility. Today at 1632. I arrived successfully from the Umbrella Transport Base with the large-scale BOW capsule. Extreme care was taken during transport and all 108 checkpoints were confirmed condition green in accordance with standard procedures. It is currently being stored in a freezer. There's one thing that I don't understand. We are normally assigned to special missions. Why, why were we ordered to transport a frozen capsule this time? I understand that this may be classified as top secret, but without knowledge of the contents, our safety could be at risk during the transport. This is especially important if the contents are potentially harmful. We would like to ask you to provide us with more information should we be assigned similar missions in the future. I still remember the good old days that I spent here in the military training centre. Do you remember the days in the military centre? <laughs> Nothing has changed since then. Never was a cloud day. We will gear up for the next mission today at 2300. Un Umbrella Special Forces Unit. Freaking steroid injected hunk. That was entertaining. This isn't though. Oh, fuck off. Get off my, get off my head. Fucking basement jacks. Where's your head at? Where's your head at? Get off, get off, get off, get off. I haven't, G. Whoa, 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 whoa. No, I haven't uh, played out last on stream before. Um, I might do, to be honest. As much as I hate being chased and it terrifies me, I, I might do. We've got to go back and use it on that guillotine, haven't we? So that was the conference room, wasn't it? We'll go back. But yeah, I think I might do, because people, um, I, I think a lot of viewers would enjoy some Outlast. DC23, welcome on in, my dude. Great to see you in. Uh, it's going all right, man. It's, it's a bit turbulent, because like I say, I am absolutely not the best at this. I, I am literally in the process of trying to get good at the game. But yeah, with your guys, uh, your guys' help and support, we're doing all right. Oh, you know what, uh, Dave? I, I wouldn't mind uh, streaming Shemu at some point. I would like to. I think that'd be a sick little stream, that. You know, if we fancied something else that, um, you know, it's a bit more of a chill one. Yes. I'm glad it didn't do us dirty that time. Sometimes it does you dirty. You're on yellow caution. You, um, you use a green head. Sometimes it doesn't even... Uh, it doesn't even heal you to find. Sometimes it does you dirty and you remain on caution. <laughs> but yeah, guys, thank you for the suggestions. I do appreciate it. Yeah, I'd definitely consider some Shemu. I do really uh, like that. And I, I, I can't believe it took me so long to even play them, you know. I felt a bit disappointed in myself, you know. I was like, jeez, you know. But I don't know. I didn't really pick up a game. Uh, sorry. Uh, oh, fucking hell. We'll, we'll just ditch it. We'll ditch it. Oh, back onto caution again. These things, man. Be the fucking death of me, literally. There's the only thing um, that's pissed me off tonight. <laughs> it's the only thing that's genuinely pissed me off, them bandersnatches. They're so unfair. 
And I can't even be out shooting him because it takes all night. It takes like an hour to kill one. <laughs> nah, I'm fine, guys. I'm not mad mad. It's fine. <laughs> I only have a little rage, um, you know. Yeah, back through here. Um, back to that alleyway. Are you kidding me? I, th I feel like these have respawned. You fuckers. As if. Uh, let's try this one. Is it? Can't remember. Oh, you know, I, I hate how sleazy some of the RE people are. So, yeah, Steve's like, he's real sleazy over Claire, he's real creepy. And you know what, I, I've i never heard it mentioned, but I um, I, don't, I hate Resident Evil remake Carlos. I, th I think he means well, but he comes across as such a sleaze. Um, I, I know the uh, original Resident Evil 3 Carlos, I know he's very controversial in what he says and things like that, they're a bit questionable. I get that, but like, I would rather take what he says, you know, oh, the foxy ladies love me and all that lot. But I hate how sleazy RE3 remake Carlos is, and I don't think it's talked about. Um, it's just, I'd, I'd say talked about enough, but it's literally never talked about ever. And um, yeah, I'm probably gonna make, a I'll, I'll make like a tweet about it and all that. I'll put it on the socials. Like, I, just, I think it's crazy. Um, you know, I was just like super carp, and she proper brushes him off. Like, he should know like where he stands, but he still continues it. I just think he's way too much, you know? I think it is way too much, Harry 3 Remake Cal. She, she makes it so clear, she ain't interested, like. And he, he just has to continue it. I hate it. I love the OG Carlos, I, I think he's hilarious. I think he's freaking funny, man. What is that? Something on there. Why can't I get back to that? There's an item there, isn't there, guys? Yeah, that, you know, I think... Uh, RE3 originally, it's fine because it's just cheesy. And they just... You accept it, it just said anything about that. But, yeah, it's like... I, I just think it's weird in the remakes. Like, stop fucking sleezing over her. She's already said. She already brushed you off. Like, I'm all right, I'm good. You know, she even shows her a bit of sass. She says, I know, I know what a radio is. And all that, you know? It's just like... Can stop like with all super carp and blah, 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 you know is there something in that can you can you guys let me know if i've missed something in that guillotine because it, it looks like something shiny i've tried clicking on it it's not doing anything oh shit nice beautiful uh, uh, do you hear that uh, uh. Uh, uh. <laughs> Fucking love the classic Ari zombie sounds. Nice. We're doing good. Thank you for sticking by me tonight, guys. We'll be on for a little while longer. Where's them bullets? <laughs> there we go. Before you go in here, I'd go back and unlock that blocked door. Oh. Is it is it that other door in this area? <laughs> it's my favourite zombie sound kings are like, oh, oh. Is it this one or another one? Oh, this one. Got ya. Got ya. Oh. Uh, yeah, I like them ones. That one we've just heard where the hover is. Like, ooh. I quite like the... Um... Yeah, me too, baby. I love it. I love making the zombie noises. I do it whenever... If I'm on stream or, like, even if I'm just playing it on my own, you know. I like... Uh... I like the Resident Evil 1 lab zombies. They go like... Rrr, rrr. <laughs> oh, nice. This is the room you can go back in and get anything else from the metal detector area. Gotcha. 
thanking you, man. I, I, I vaguely remember this now. Right, we'll go finish up in that room, then we can go back here then, can't we? That's the best one, though. Oh, oh. <laughs> I can't do a female zombie. I can't wail like they do. He's like, Ugh. that 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 one too bad actually. It needs to be a bit more higher pitched and a bit more desperate sounding. I think. Ooh, she's like that. She does. She has a deeper one like that. Deeper uh, zombie noise. Yeah, she's like, Ooh. fucking. <laughs> no shit, he's not breathing, Bruh! Bro could not be any more, like dead. Come on. <laughs> Can't stop doing them now. Oh, bro. Oh, yeah, you need another eye for that, don't you? Anatomist's note. There is a demon in my mind. I can't control the fierce impulses that the demon sometimes drives me to act upon. It is a brutal ceremony with the demon next to me. I enjoy watching people agonise in pain, screaming and convulsing repeatedly as they die. But Sir Alfred was kind enough to acknowledge me and has given me the facilities, chemicals and equipment necessary to study everything. I must never betray Sir Alfred's kindness. It is especially critical that no one discovers the sacred place that only he and I know about. I swear, the basement of this medical building will be kept secret. Of course, I keep the key to the sacred place with me at all times. Even if an outsider sees it, they will never be able to tell that it's the key. I must remember that my life ends when I lose Sir Alfred's trust. I got the key, I got the secret. I'd save here first because of what's coming up. Bro, is there even a save? Oh. I, I, does one of these become alive and then you've got to get its eye out of it or something? Yeah, let's... Uh, can we try and escape? Right, let's try and get out of here. You have to teach, so I have to I have to look all weird to be able to do the voice. My face has to drop. Oh. <laughs> no, you've just told me UBCS. Because <laughs> you've just said I'd save here because of what's coming up. I've just seen. I played through this before years ago. Not completed it in years. Oh, it's in there, isn't it? Oh, my bad. Sorry. Right. So, let's pop back out to the box. Get an ink ribbon. So useful to have this here. Jeez. Mega useful. Right. So, make a little save. Um... You've always got to do a cheeky save, man. It's scary when you don't know what's coming up. Be scary. So I, d I do appreciate the heads up, guys, when you say to me, you know, drop a save and whatever. I'd, I'd rather, you know. I do definitely save more often if if I forget what's coming up and things like that. Um, so not finished in that room yet. So we'll go, go back there first. Did you actually, Dave? That's wicked, man. Got a thousand G. On the 360 version. That's sick. I don't know how many G I've got on this. We, we did get a cheeky... Um, we did get a cheeky 50 uh, G earlier. Um, oh, yeah. Thinking about it. That's what I wanted to do. Just bear with me. Um, yeah, because I think that should lead back to the metal detector, right? So we can get them items claiming back. have a little look i can't wait to get good at this game i think it'll be even um more enjoyable you know once you you really know what you're doing on it sort of thing you know what Tito? i've been all right tonight um i've had the heating on for a, a couple of hours uh before stream and it, it's really warmed the house Please up well deposit any metallic items on. you have in the security box
Hell yeah! I feel way better reclaiming all our shit back. Let's go. <laughs> Hell yeah. Yeah, we'll probably be online for like up to like another hour or something, guys. We'll see how we go. We'll see what, um, you know, when's good to kind of cap the game off. Um, but yeah, it's just a, just past 1am here in the UK. I hope uh, you guys are all well wherever you're tuning in from. Thank you for being here. Let's just use that up. Actually, I don't have to keep, um... I have to keep them on us, really. Yeah, keep them on us. I'll keep them on us anyway, but yeah, I think, uh, especially type BOW gas, yeah, I think we've got some of them. Um, and yeah, like I said, I've not even touched the um, grenade launch, so that'll be good. Uh, we've got that for the tyrant, and I'll be mindful of how many of these I'm using, because are these good? The gunpowder uh, thing is, are the like explosive ones, are these good for the tyrant? Um, the, the tyrant fight on the aircraft? So I'll, I'll be careful how many I use of these. Oh, hell yeah, Benny. The UK's good, man. There's some good places in it. Um, said I want to visit the UK one day. It's 8.06 Eastern time here in the USA. Oh, yeah, of course. Yeah, it's like 8 p.m., right? I ain't seen another Dur Duralumin case around, man. Right, so obviously that's the one with the that model in. Oh, man. Is it this that comes alive? A body bag has been left here. Oh, bro, I don't trust that at all. What's going on, Sam? Thank you for the follow. Oh, man. I knew it! Did I just walk into the door? Bruh. Oh, shit. Fuck. Let's use a few of them. Nice. Oh shit. Yeah, they, they just scare me. Like every time I come up to a zombie, I'm always like, oh shit. I just know how fast they are. We, we've commented on that. Um, you know, earlier in the stream, if, if you guys have pointed that out. Oh, it's minging. Yeah, it's minging, Sam. <laughs> Proper keeps me on my toes this game. I, I'm, I don't know about you guys. Yeah, guys, thank you very much to all you night owls here in the UK for being in tonight. And uh, yes, everyone from around the world, thank you very much. Nice. Don't forget to ch chuck your stuff in the box before it changes to Chris. Oh, no. First time I had nothing to for him not to restart the game. Oh, God, when do I need to dump the stuff? Is it pretty soon or... Oh man, that, that was so difficult to see, man. Thanks for pointing that out. Yeah, I'll keep making regular saves and stuff. And obviously, I, I make, I've make i been making loads of saves on all different slots. So if we do mess up, we can easily um, just load that. That's got up. That's totally got up. Right, so we're reloaded there, so we'll use that. Saw that. Oh, nice. Hell yeah. An enhancement part. What does that do exactly? Does it make it like semi auto or something? Um, oh, nice. Custom handgun. Let's have a little look. 
burst. Equipped with a stock. Can be adjusted to fire three bullets in succession. That's sick. Yeah, so it is equipped and stuff. That's cool. We go need that. Bro be feasting. I mean, I don't blame him. I don't think you can really order a Domino's over to Rockfort Island, right? And it, then again, it'll literally just pick up the phone and be like, oh, oh, oh. They'll be like, excuse me, sir. I don't know. I don't can't understand what topping you'd like on your pizza. Oh, oh, oh. Man, he's crazy. Nice. Give me that eye. Pretty green. Oh, I can't say it, can I? It's like pretty green eyes. Isn't this a blue eye? Pretty green eyes. <laughs> yeah, he is fast, man. What did that just do anyway? I don't get what that's done. Oh, it's there. I just ran off. <laughs> Placed the eye and I got scared and ran off. Now we're doing good, hell yeah. Fuck off, fucking bats. You know we got a burst hang on now, fuckers. I'm not messing around with them. Like I say, I always say this with the Resident Evil, it's always like the little enemies that are freaking um, the most damaging, literally. So, thank you for subscribing over on the tubes. Appreciate you. The merchant welcomes you in, man. Thank you. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Come on. Oh, I can't help it, man. It's like Tourette's. Yeah. I, th I think anything like flying, anything, you know, small enemies, they're annoying. Uh, the dogs, I never hesitate to kill them. Uh, some people say, you know, just run around, just dodge them. Uh, I will always um, take out the dogs. Can't, can't be doing with them. Can't be doing with messing with them, David, for sure. I wonder what this weird device was used for. Bro, it looks like a saw trap. There's been old watermelon. It looks like a... One old jigsaw's trap from from the saw. Well, we're going back up here, you can. So we came in there, didn't we? Oh, yeah, we'll have to go down there, aren't we? Anything going on there? Strange device on display. He's a. He's a what? A v, v act. A V act zombie is basically like a crimson, but without claws or red skin. Really? He's like a mutated zombie. That's mad. Oh, I don't know which. Uh, I don't know which one to push that on. It's like that. Uh, it's like that meme. You know where it's. Uh, which one is it? Is it Simon off the in-betweeners? You know, with the, his hair down and it's flicked at the end. Is it the in-betweeners guy? It's a UK TV show. It's like that little uh, Greg's meme, innit? You know, when you ask for a Greg's sausage roll and they're like, uh, they're like, oh, they're not warm. Is that all right? And it, there's him with his hair flicked up. I don't know. I think that's a bit dodgy, mate. <laughs> that's what the, this puzzle uh, is. Uh, this is the vibes it's giving. Cause I don't know which one to, uh, to uh, move this on. I don't know. I think it's a bit dodgy, mate. Oh no. Let's see what it's saying. Just give me a sec. I don't have taking that yet. Holding a helmet. Holding some armour. 
So helmet armor and it what Oh, does it, does it go here? Holding a shield. Oh, it's there. Is that, is that a little lever thing? Oh, I don't know how to push this. Maybe we'll have to just take it and see what happens. Bollocks. Oh, there we go. Oh, no. Shit. I don't want to... Kill us, please. Oh, we just got to keep going. Oh, there we go. Put your back in there just a little more. There we go. I didn't, I didn't know how fast to turn it, but yeah. Facing that. Cool, cool. Now we're putting the sword back in there. <laughs> I had no idea I was coming out. Bruh. <laughs> oh, yeah, he's got the. Bro, you've got a sword in your chest. You've been cheating. Bruh. <laughs> Minging. <laughs> Right, so we've got to get back into um, that little shit's bedroom where the uh, the Moonlight Sonata piano was. <gasps> He's actually started uh, coming up the stairs. Hell yeah. Let's go. Bro, he's literally just let himself up. That's like, uh, it's like an RE1 remake, right? Don't, don't the guy let himself into the kitchen or something? Or he lets himself... Yeah. Don't a zombie let himself into the kitchen or something like that down the stairs? It kind of reminded me of that. Right, so we came in this way. I, th I think this is the way to backtrack anyway. <laughs> I told you that room was dodgy. I don't know. I think that's a bit dodgy, mate. Right, so that's done, that's done. Let's backtrack this way. It's an absolute shit show, this, isn't it? Drama everywhere. It's good, though. I I've been loving this. So good. I think Bro's dead. She, she covers quite a... That's it. She covers quite an area. So you can do pretty well with the, the leg sweep thing. Nice. That's perfect, man. If you get the, some clean hits on it, that's so good. Yeah, been doing real good with that. Right, so we need to go. Um, I just went through there. That goes back to the security box thingy, doesn't it? So we'll go back here. Um, back to the palace. Yeah, we'll do another. Back there. Um. It went that way. I'm slowly starting to get a bit more um, familiar with it. A little bit. It's about this way. Um, I think so. Absolute fries my brain, man. <laughs> trying to remember. Um, trying to remember where to go. Um, I don't think it's here, is it? Oh, shit. Oh, bollocks. No. Fucking hell. It's over here, I think. I'm sure it's over here. Across that bridge and that, innit? Yeah. I think we're good. Thank you, guys. I do appreciate the continued support. Yeah, across here. Yeah, I, I, a lot, lot lying. I, I think I shit me Calvin's when uh, we was in that room and the gas came out. I was like, oh, shit. Because obviously I didn't want to just turn it the, the maximum amount or if we needed to a certain point i was a bit like oh okay now at least it, yeah you could just keep spamming it just turn it as long as possible it is man like a, a lot of people that um throughout the stream especially at the start there was like use the knife use the knife 
I totally get why. Ow, 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 ow. Yeah, I don't normally use the knife much. I'm usually very dismissive of it. So massive thank you to you guys for pushing me to use the knife. I do feel like more... Um, I do feel more confident with it now. Definitely. It's definitely... Greetings. It's going to be the most powerful you in Code Veronica. Lovely Claire Redfield. Pesky Wesky in the house. Let's go. Let's just say that I'm a ghost coming back to haunt your dear brother. Fuck yeah. It seems there's not much explaining to do, is there? I was the one who attacked this island. Who'd have thought you'd be hanging about? <laughs> All the better for me. Now that the cat dragged in this nice surprise, your ever so caring brother will definitely show up. I must thank you for being such good bait. I don't know what went on between you two, but you have them all wrong. My brother is not the kind of person you think he is. I despise Chris. What are you gonna do to him? Don't talk about a Chrissy like that. Freaking fan-handling glare like that, bro. Did his evil laugh? <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, can't just twatter with your freaking you rock pot. Some further use to me. I'm going to let you live a little longer. Why? I never did the wanker side at you, pesky wesky. Come on, man. I'm coming up, so you better get this party started. Pesky Wesky starting on a Saturday night. All the stream waiting for him to arrive. Sending out the message to Claire Redfield. He's twatting her with his rock pots and getting her in the fields. Bruh, that's crazy. <laughs> Pesky Wesky freestyle, let's go. <laughs> Yeah, I just love how he was proper like, uh, ha, 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 what? <laughs> Fucking ace. <eight. laughs> yeah, we'll have a little save. I'm not going to use anything just yet. Yeah, fine. I don't know if there's any boss coming up that we need to know of. I have no idea. We'll go into it fairly blindly. We'll see what happens once we put the uh, this role in the... Uh, in the uh, piano. I'll take that just in case we get that blue beetle. We, we're gonna get it at some point, I'm sure. Then obviously we'll put the uh, box plate back in. Cool, cool. Make a little save. Kyle Stay, thanks so much, man, for sending over the diamonds. Appreciate you, mate. <laughs> you like the freestyle Tito? Gotta love little freestyle. He just reminded me of it. It just reminded me of the I'm coming up, so you better get the stream started. <laughs> Back to the casino where there is one bandit powered on that we can't fucking play. Bullshit. <laughs> I think I'll kind of wait till we get a bit more injured, then I will consider the first aid. We'll see how we go. It's, it's fine. I don't mind kind of progressing when we're like, um, our help's compromised because obviously we've just saved. It's fine. Oh! No! No. Stop. Bad Bandersnatch. Oh, those things, man. They've been the worst thing about tonight. <laughs> They've been horrible, man. But yeah, guys, we'll probably be on for like another half hour or something. We'll get to the five hour mark. We've been streaming for four and a half hours. We'll stay for another half an hour. Then I will, uh, I'll have a little bit more of my chicken korma. Vanilla ice chicken korma. Because I miss vanilla ice. Oh. I can't, oh, bollocks. Ow. I can't even do my, oh shit. Piss off. Fucking Ow Oh is this the wrong one? Oh is the is it the palace palace? Oh bollocks, yeah, because it's got the kids room in the rooms in on it. 
Yeah, they... I don't know if it was behind the uh, silver key door. Yeah, thinking about it. There's only a couple of rooms in here, isn't there? Yeah. Right, let's just. I'm just gonna uh, restart from uh, our last save. Because I, I can't be asked. We've, we've um, took a load of thingy from that Bandersnatch, didn't we? We've literally just saved it, so we'll just uh, go back to uh, the save we made like two seconds ago. So it's that one. I know, T. It makes. I feel the pain, man, when we get hit by the Bandersnatches. Even I'm like, ow! <laughs> I proper verbalise it. Right, let's try going out this way. Give banter signs. They're so horrible, man. <laughs> Is it up this one? It might have been here where we used that silver key, I'm guessing. I think so. Nice. Here we go. Give us the freaking moonlight sonata, man. Get brighten our evening up, please. <laughs> no way. How is that wired to a fucking Kingmaker bandit machine? Bro. <laughs> we are indeed Jack Jaws. Thanks so much for stopping in, man. It's great to see you again. We are still going strong. Been streaming for four and a half hours right now. We're going to um, do like another hour and a half. Uh, sorry, another half an hour. Make it up to like five hour stream. Thank you for coming in with the follow, guys. Um, but yeah, we're doing good. Just got the blue ant object. We'll make it back to the, obviously, past the golden luger door thing. Yeah, we made some alright progress, considering like I've not played it in... I've not played this in a little while. Um, I picked up a, a save on this probably the other month. Um, but I, I didn't even get this far. Like, I played like a few hours and I, I just haven't gone back to it because of lack of time. Oh no, you're kidding, Jack. Oh, Jack said he'd, he'd been out uh, for food. Keep coming in now, that food's made me violently sick. Oh, so zero, 10 out of 10. Oh, Jack, I'm so sorry to hear you've got food poisoning from that. That's so weird, like, how it can taste okay and stuff. It didn't even taste bad or anything. Oh, man. Oh, I'm so sorry, Jack. I really, like, feel for you, man. No, because it was the nicest food. That's so weird how it, like, tasted okay, yet it can still make you ill. It's so scary, isn't it, man? Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, Jack. That sucks, man. Piss off, bro. So annoying they are, man. Oh, I can't believe you're, you're ill, Jack, because you was really praising it earlier, and it, like... Oh, he said, guess he was back to being veggie. I it's enough to put anyone off in it, like... Oh, shit! Holy shit! I can't avoid all these. Oh, bruh. Don't have to use the odd little explosive thing to get rid of them. Oh, shit, hang on. I'm gonna have to just use the odd one, I think. Oh, yeah, thinking about it, Jack. You, yeah, it, if you had me earlier in the day, like lunch or something, yeah, it could have been. Potentially. Because, yeah, sometimes it doesn't make you ill straight away. Sometimes it can be from, like, quite earlier on, can't it? Oh, I'm really sorry to hear you're ill, man. Oh, shit. We'll, we'll be on danger now. We'll take that. Oh, shit. That's it. Yeah, I really hope you feel better soon, Jack. I, I feel so awful for you, genuinely. Like, cause I've. Like, I hate being sick. I think it's the worst thing ever. I was, I had like one, just like one episode of being sick. It was, um, you know what? It might have been about a year ago. I, I literally had like a 24 hour, like, uh, sickness bug. And I, I was literally just sick the once, thankfully. But like, I hate being sick, man. Yeah, I really feel for you, man. Like, you know, send you positive vibes. Hope you feel better soon. I've not, uh, Dave, I don't watch that be Beard Meets Food. 
Oh, I wonder where they was. I was going to say, it's a bit quiet around here. Twats. <laughs> he likes ice cream in his food. <laughs> really? Yeah, imagine. Claire actually trained Krauser on the knife fire. Oh, fucking hell. Try to get past him. Fuck off. Oh, you all suck. <laughs> Obviously, I'm on about the zombie, don't worry. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Get off me. For fuck's sake. I didn't need to take them hits. Stop. Shot load of arrows in the bollocks. You suck. Oh, man. They're so annoying. They were so unnecessary, those hits. Hey, let's go, Zan. Said I'm nut and ready to watch the last part of the stream. Well, welcome back in, Zan. Thank you for being here. Oh, I should have been so stingy on the ammo there. Right, I don't know if we have to go... I think it's upstairs to the uh, the creepy bedroom. I think it's up there, in it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah, we've been doing all right. Big ears, I know I felt that. And with every bite on this game, I hate it. It's so damn annoying. I'm, I'm really trying to conserve ammo as well. I'm really trying. <laughs> oh, fucking hell. I think we... Um, Um, what did we do? We did that. Oh, you know what? Um, so what did we do? We only went there and then we went back. Um, right. A apologies for being annoying, guys. I'm just going to restart from the last save because it was literally only a few minutes ago. We could just whisper out. We only, we only went in like one room and then just, just went like in it. No, it's my fault. I'm just going to be a bit more mindful. I'm going to just... Um, I'll use the uh, bullets on, on them. I'm not going to mess around because I, I just don't want to take any unnecessary damage because I'm just mindful we've really not got much health. So yeah, I'm going to wait till obviously I really need to use that first aid. Um, it only takes a sec anyway. So we'll go do that. So we need to go back this way, don't we, to the uh, casino thing. No, I haven't had a look, uh, Jack, on, on the... Um, on the uh, method to beat the tyrant on the plane. I've not had a look. I don't fancy doing that tonight. <laughs> don't fancy that. I'm only going to stay on for about another half hour-ish, so I don't know if, if we get up to it or anything. I will literally leave it till, like, probably tomorrow night or something. I don't fancy going up on it when we're, like, balls deep in the stream, like, five hours. <laughs> don't forget the blue hair. Oh, yeah, is it on the... in that hallway? I don't fancy venturing down there, to be honest, man. Actually, is there just the one zombie? If there's the one zombie, I'll go have a look. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Literally a dedicated stream to the, the tyrant on the plane. Fucking. It's, it, honestly, it's going to need a fresh stream for that. I can't go up against it now. Where is it? Somewhere in a corner. I think there's like a blue herb. Somewhere. Not here. Checkered floor hallway. Oh, is that like... Oh, it's a little while away, man. I think um, I think it'll be all right. Oh, yeah, go through the gold lugers. Got ya. Let's go. Yeah, we've made some decent progress tonight. I'm, I'm real proud of us, you know. I've put off streaming this game for so long. We, we've made all right progress, considering, you know. Oh, shit. Can't see the, the herb. I might have a quick look for it. Have a dead quick look for it. Oh, it's there, isn't it? God, that's so camouflaged, man. Thank you for pointing that out. We do have one and only gold hair for the night. I think that's the first blue hair I found. What the heck is that noise? Oh, that'll be the bandersnatch, won't it? Can I forgot about these? I'm using a few of these. Can't deal with it. Ooh. 
Oh, you guys who've just stopped in, obviously we've had Xanth and Jack return. We have heard bear zombie noises tonight. <laughs> that was my favourite zombie noise, that. So damn good. I love how they're the, like, the OG Resident Evil Trilogy zombie noises. Headphones on now so I can hear everything. <laughs> oh, these are horrible. Isn't that a, a Black Mirror, like, episode or series, Bandersnatch? I've not seen all the Black Mirror. I've, I've seen, like, some of the previous, but... Wasn't there like a series, like an interactive series one, it called Bandersnatch? That's where I've heard it before. Right, we've got to go all out with these. I'm not, I'm not taking damage. Can't be doing with it. Come on, slice him. Nice. Awesome. Sam said, yes, never watched it because I make awful decisions. <laughs> Well, you could just just replay it over and over and over till you, till you get the right decisions. But yeah, I've, I've not actually um, watched or you know played or whatever you'd class it as. I've not actually uh, done that. Is there a save in here? I can't, I can't remember if there is a save room. Not really. We'll, we'll head up. It's there. Come on, slicey slice. Oh, is he dead? Oh, he's dead, dead. Oh, are they? It's not there, is there? It's, the game's hella dark. You've got, probably got to look at everything. Oh, bollocks. Don't grab us, don't grab us. Yeah, me too, Kyle. I, th I think we will have a remake coming. They'll, they'll, they're probably going to make us wait for it, though. I think it's to give more people who are maybe not as familiar with Code Veronica They'll release RE5 remake and then people will be even more vocal about Code Veronica. Make it next, make it next, make it. And then I think what they're doing it psychologically, I think. So people will be like, whoa, 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 what's all this fuss about Code Veronica? Because there's still some people who don't, they might know about the game, but they've not checked it out. They've not had chance to. They've not looked up gameplay, whatever. So it'll get more people on board because they'll see, why, why is everyone raving and raving still about Code Veronica? So it'll get them on board and they'll, they'll do it so they'll get more sales. So they're deliberately keeping us waiting for Code Veronica. It's what they do. But yeah, they'll prioritise RE5, which, which is not what anyone wants. Like, I mean as in order. People in order want uh, Code Veronica, but they're going to make us wait and wait. They're going to really create the suspense so more people jump on it and get curious about it. I think 5 it, it, it'd be a decent remake, but it's not in desperate need. Not in desperate need of a remake. I don't think so, Sam. I think RE5 and 6, I think they are at risk of being bodged, like RE2 and 3 remakes. But I think when it's Code Veronica, again, I think it'll get the Capcom favourite child treatment, like RE4. They'll perfect it, I think. I've got no worries at all with Code Veronica. I think they'll do a, a phenomenal job, just like they did with 4. It's their second favourite child, I think. They know they've got to take it easy with it, you know? That's my opinion on it, you know? Right, so that one's done. That That's sealed, isn't it? That's sealing. So it is the other room. My bad. Yeah, 100% agree with you guys, though. Code Veronica should be the next remake. I definitely think so. It's what I want. Oh. It's fully loaded, Hall, you tit. There we go. Just equip it. There we go. Yeah, I think I'm hoping RE5 and 6 will, like, revive the multiplayer a bit, and then they'll hopefully consider doing a, a modern-day Resident Evil outbreak. I think that'd be great. Hopefully it will, um, do that. Totally blind firing. There we go. See? Oh, how do you not be down, you fucker? Bro, let's put it on dirty caution. I, I ain't doing anything till we're on danger. 
yeah, you know what? I'd, I'd, I'd like to, I won't mind streaming Outbreak, but I'd, I'd definitely need some mates on board for sure, because I, I cannot play it solo. I think it's unplayable. I can All the AI characters, they just hog everything. I, can, I can't use anything, can't find a... Can, I can't find any items because they're, they're um, freaking stockpiling them. Can't use any health because they're using them. I, I absolutely could not win with that game when, when I tried it. But if, if I went back to it, I'm sure I'd be okay. I just need to know what I'm doing on it, you know. Right, we'll pop that one in. But yeah, that'd be good. I think it'll be Resident Evil 5 remade next. Then it'll be Code Veronica, and then I think people will be shouting for um, Outbreak, and they'll keep us waiting again, and they'll go to RE6, which no one wants, and then they'll do Outbreak. So they'll, they'll just keep us waiting, you know? But yeah, I just need to watch some people's streams of... Um, watch the, you know, the big dogs, like Bot the Soup. Uh, he's done some solo streams of it, so I'll have to see what he does, because even he said it's difficult if you don't know what you're doing. You know? Can we go up that? Oh, the overblood seal. This is so cool about the carousel. So damn cool. And uh, currently on the Residents of Evil, they're doing like Outbreak October or something, you know, Outbreak October. So they're playing it every Friday. Keyhole is the mouth part. Okay. So yeah, they're playing it multiplayer. Nothing useful. Managed to love those carousel horses. I wouldn't mind uh, going on that. Possibly seen from a fairy tale. There seems to be nothing strange about her. Yeah, because she looks completely normal. Take the silver dragonfly. D don't they? Aren't they all creepy in, in the video that you see? Don't they, don't they like rip off all its wings and stuff, and they're all weird with it? This telescope is so you can see Steve Burnside's biceps because he has none. Oh, burn! Steve O, Steve O, Steve O. <laughs> Gotta be something with this because we, we ain't got anything else to uh, work with. So its wings can be detached. Detach the wings. That'll probably turn into the key, right? I got the key, I got the secret. Can we use it or do I have to press it? Nice. Where the thing is, there we go. Yeah, I love the carousels, man. This is a cool vibe and I, I love the, the whole uh, carousel vibe on, um, on Silent Hill. So fun, man. I'd love to restream Silent Hill. Uh, we do need to complete Silent Hill 3, though, for sure. Yeah, we'll continue streaming through the Silent Hill series. Joe's Gaming Channel YouTube. Thank you for the follow, man. Appreciate you. I think we've got a fellow streamer in here. Let's go. Yeah, there's loads, Cal, that I've not yet played, man. I, like, I've literally only played the first few. I own the rest in my collection, but I've just not, um... I've not got round to playing them. So, yeah, we'll, we'll pretty much be streaming them in the order. You know, we'll finish Silent Hill 3. We've got four. We've got Shattered Memories, um... Homecoming, Downpour, um... Yeah, there's, there's loads, man. We, we've got quite a few to go through. Origins. Confession Letter. Alexia, my sister, is a genius and possesses unmatched beauty. She is everything to me. I would overcome any obstacle and be willing to risk my life for her. For Alexia, I must revive the glorious Ashford family which fell during the era of my father, Alexander. Together, we will restore our family name. Once that has been achieved, I'll build a palace where only nobles may gather. I cannot allow the unwashed to see my dear Alexia, to whom my life is devoted to. She reigns the world as queen, with I as her servant. That is my dream and how sweet it will be. Those accomplishments will be the proof of my love towards Alexia. It is the purpose of my existence. All other people are meaningless. They shall soon... I, th I thought it said... Uh... Oh, I, th I thought it said she'll soon 
prostate. I was like, well, what's that to do with your prostate bollocks thing? They shall soon prostrate themselves before Alexia and I. I've never heard prostrate before. I've only heard prostate. Devoted to my beloved Alexia, Alfred Ashford. <laughs> I've actually not, Sam. Um, that is a series I need to visit, Alone in the Dark. I do I do own um, Alone in the Dark, New Nightmare. I think I've got that on both PS1 and PS2. Uh, I've not played, like, the more modern one. I've not played that one. Would like to get into them. Is that something down there? Man, you've got to be super observant in this game. I only just saw them flashing there. Right, we'll make a little save, and then we'll see what where the hell this takes us. Um, we can go... Um, I can't for the life me remember where it is. It is ages back. Um, but we need three proofs and we've installed one and now we've got the other two. We've got one in the box. We've just picked up the other one. So we've got to... Um, yeah, I'll try work our way back there and then we'll, uh, we'll see what's going on. I have to make loads of saves, guys, because I, I can't like remember what's coming up and stuff. No, again, I've not p played the Fatal Frame games. Um, I, I do wanna, um, I do wanna play the yeah the Project Zero games for sure. Um, is that? If we go down there, will that bring us in one of the bedrooms? Oh yeah, it brings us into one of the bedrooms. I think, doesn't it? Is there a cutscene coming up in one of these? I assume. I think. Oh yeah, I thought so. I thought we'd get caught in the fucking hell. Fucking bish in the purple dress with you, Uzi. Maybe I must say goodbye so soon. Fucking hell. I am Alexia Ashford. For the pride of the Ashford family, I will kill you. For the pride of the Ashford family. <laughs> she sounded a bit common there. Wait. What's going on? It's Steve. Go on, Steve. <laughs> A secret door. After her. Are you okay? I'm fine. It's just a scratch. Yeah, that wasn't my accent, Joe. That's how she sounded. For the pride of the Ashford family. <laughs> I'm from Grimsby. I'm from Lincolnshire. What's he looking for? Steve seems to be uneasy. I'd better check this room. <laughs> oh, it's actually, is it the same gun for Harry too? Sick, man. This must be... Ooh. Oh, get out! <laughs> he shit himself. What? No! It, it... Oh god, it's like the most terrified face tonight. <laughs> Wait a second. What just happened? But she saw his own face and ran. So there never was an Alexia after all. You mean he thinks he's two people? The wig! Okay, that's it. Let's get out of here. The self-destruct system has uh -oh. that freak. Activated. He's trying to blow us up along All with the entire facility. Evacuate. Come on, we got to get to that airport. Right. Oh, don't fucking leave us behind then. Okay, now. As long as you're right, Steve. No fucking worries, sir. It is indeed, comrade. Thanks for being here, man. It is an absolute classic. We're loving it, man. We're loving it, loving it, loving it. We're loving the Ashfords. Do you really like it? It's Code Veronica Wicked. We're loving it, loving it, loving it. We're loving it on stream. Rockford Island, Rockford Island. Hell yeah. Yeah, that's what. That's how much of a coward Steve is, man. Just leaves us behind. I hope there's nothing else coming up. I, I don't know what to do. Um, I, I kind of need to find that, that boat thing where we put all the... Uh, the proofs. I don't know what to do. We've got another proof. We've got one in a uh, in a box. I don't know where to. It is a pretty cool uh, self-destructor lab. The audio is so good on this. 
the audio. I like the OG, you know, kind of whoa, RE trilogy, um, like sound effects. You know, when you're scrolling the menus, the zombie sounds. Shit. Oh, bollocks. Oh, shit. Ah, fucking hell. These are... Oh, man, they're so bad. This is the only things that have really bothered me all night, man. Yeah, I think... Um... Oh, I can't even... You know what? I can't even remember where it is. Oh, man, we've, like, got to backtrack a bit, but I can't remember how far to backtrack. <laughs> I'm glad you like the karaoke kings. I love bursting out into song on stream. Oh, fuck. Oh, hell yeah. Right, we'll grab the proof. Take that. Oh, can we do our little first Spando Valley gold herb tonight? Let me just take that before I forget. Oh, bro, absolute filth. Here we go, guys. The, the self-destruct alarm's going off, but we all go, oh, always got time for a bit of uh, Spando Bally. Let's freaking go, guys. Because we are gold. Let's go. <laughs> Spando Bally self-destruct alarm remix. You are gold, gold. Alrighty. Another save, yet another save. And then, um, so the next save we do, guys, that'll be the final one of the stream, okay? It's the final save. Doo -doo 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 -doo. So we'll go a little bit longer, because I just want to, um, you know, find the, the the submarine bollocks thing. And then we'll we'll make our way off, and then we'll uh, we'll see where we end up, and uh, hopefully we'll make a safe shortly after that. I'd rather do the backtracking now while I kind of vaguely remember bits and bobs. I don't want to sleep on it because you guys know how I forget what happened, like a few hours ago. <laughs> That'd be a, yeah, a wicked idea, uh, Zamf. That'd be sick. Clear. I'll get back to you in just a sec. Those must be the remaining survivors. We'd better get out of here too. Right. Let's go. There we go. He's legged it again. Yeah, I try not to interrupt the cutscenes. Yeah, I thought it was this way. Um so yeah, uh, Zamp said if you haven't already, which I haven't, uh you should do a YouTube video on your journey with Resi and how you became a fan. Yeah, that would be sick. Do a little uh, holster throwback. That'd be awesome. We gotta get to that airport. Hell yeah. Oh guys, we we made great progress though. Like I thought we'd be stuck with streams, man, on this. Uh, so Sam, I'm probably going to come online for a few hours tomorrow night. Do, do, do. It'll probably be maybe like um, 6 or 7 p.m. It'll be something like that. So I'll try and get another few hours in on it tomorrow night, I think. Because I would like to take advantage tomorrow night, you know, um, to be able to stream while I'm off, you know, because I'm working next week, and so it'd be good to do a nice little Sunday night one, you know, just be for a few hours, because I am up at the crack of dawn on Monday. Uh, unfortunately, I have had to sign up for overtime uh, Monday and Tuesday. And then the next stream will probably be Wednesday evening. So tomorrow evening, Wednesday evening. And then, yeah, I'll keep, keep you uh, posted from there. Sunday evening stream, then midweek stream. Hell yeah. It's so sick, isn't it? So sick, Dave, this music. Yeah, I remember now. So it's around, yeah, here. Can him just stand with his arms folded. Yeah, you're right waiting now, though, aren't you, you prick? I don't have the proof. I see no story. Piss off, Steve. Oh yeah! Look at us guys getting on the airport, come on! 
Standing in the crowded room and I can't see Steve's face. Ooh, 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 ooh. <laughs> Let's go. Oh yeah, there's a lever thing there, isn't there? I think we needed that. Yeah, put the bridge no. on. No! Leave that to me. You stay here and make preparations for takeoff. Guys, the timing doesn't come on this plane, does it? Is it? Would it want a bit further up? Oh, bollocks, sorry, I have to go up here. I hope not. I hope it's not on this plane. Otherwise, I've got I've got shit all. No one, no one said anything, so I don't think it's... Oh, no. Is it actually? Prime's come in, he's just said... Oh, no, not the soft-locking section of the game. Right, okay, we've literally just made a save. So... If anything happens, we've not got far to, to go back to. Uh, I, I agree, Zan, massively. He said, I love how the older Resi games had empowered female characters that aren't uh, damsels, damsels in distress. Yeah, I absolutely agree with you. They're, they're real strong characters, for sure. Definitely. Yeah, there's another little part. I think it's through that other door. Yeah, I've just got a bad feeling. I just didn't know when this, uh, the notorious freaking aircraft tyrant comes. I thought it was maybe a bit later on. Get off. You know, I was actually saying, Zamp, and anyone else who it wasn't in the stream at the time, like, uh, I was on about Carlos. Like, I love, I massively prefer the OG RE3 Carlos. And I know he's a bit controversial, the things he says. I know he's a bit creepy at times. Like, you know, when he's all like, oh, the faxy ladies love cars and whatever. But... I actually, I really hate, and I, I don't think it's, I've never seen it be talked about, I hate the uh, RE3 remake, Carlos, because from the get-go, right, um, Jill literally shrugged him off, like, she literally shrugged him off from the start, and he should, like, take the hint with it, but he's, he's proper all, like, you know, like, oh, super cop, hey, super cop, oh, yeah, she's great, oh, yeah, and it's just all over her, like, it's like, just back off, she... You don't know what this chick's been through. She's already been through a Resident Evil game. She can more. She's more than capable of handling herself. And I just don't think he like gets the hint. He's too sleazy. I think he doesn't mean it, but I just think like he's too sleazy with it. I just re I'm really not a fan of Ari remake, Carlos. Alrighty, I think we're good. Yeah, I love the OG one. I think it's fucking. I think he's ace, man. They were so. They were so much much better than the the original. What, what have we got in here? Oh, is that? Oh, right, airport. Got it. Got it. Got it. Anything around here? Joyals pressure can't go in there. Right, so that that's used on the uh, on that door then. Hey, what's going on, Andy Games? It is a late one tonight, my mate. Mate, honestly, I lose track of time. We've been on since uh, about nine ish, um, and yeah, we are uh, <laughs> we're at two a.m. right now. I did plan on coming off about now, but yeah, next um, next. Uh, like save point will we'll come off and then I'll most likely return to this tomorrow evening for a few hours. Won't be as late though. Hey, what's going on, man? Emery GX. Thanks for uh, stopping over on Twitch. Awesome. You can't beat this music combined with the alarm. I like I like this uh, this music. It's so sick. Uh, do we need to? Oh, well, they're in a box anyway. I was just saying, do we, do we need to, like, uh, do anything? Is there anything we need to stock up on, but there's nothing? Okay. We'll just take all these and uh, get gone, then. Oh, what, what, what? Sam's saying you're not getting sp suspicious about help items comes from what's about to happen. I, I can't determine when this is. I can't even save it because I've not even got a, an ink ribbon on me. We'll just get going. I hope there's another opportunity to save before any kind of boss. We are due one. I just don't know when... Uh, yeah. There was a box in there. 
Let me go have a look, man. I can't see it. Yeah, th there is a, a thingy on the plane, isn't there? I've just, uh, we've not long saved it, so if I've ballsed it up, then I've ballsed it up. And then we'll we'll just continue it tomorrow anyway, it's fine. We, we have hit like five hours on the stream, so I'm ready to kind of come off like, you know. So, what? What? What, what, what? Do I have to move the thing back down? Let's go have a look in there have I got to do the lever again to get back across? I think I have, Anna. I thought we was alright. I thought, I, I thought the whole point was to move it out of the way so the plane could get out. Oh, it's there. I didn't even fucking see it. <laughs> I didn't even see that box at first. My bad. I don't know. I'm, get, I'm getting a little worried. I'm getting a little bit worried. I'm going to bring this just in case. I know. I don't feel very, uh, put them back, I'll bring that with us, I'll just feel a little bit more secure. I don't know, I just don't know if something's about to happen. Um. So this isn't the thingy one. I'll wait then, I'll wait for the, uh, I don't know what's good against Tyrant, I'm, I'm not sure. I'll take them and that that might be alright. Should we get back on the plane? Oh, this... Oh, I don't know what to do. Um, right, I'm going to stock up with them and just, just see what happens, basically. Oh, acid's good. I'll, ta I'll take that, Sam. I'll get it in a sec. Thank you, man. I literally don't know what's good for Tyrant. So we'll take that. We'll... Uh... Or should I use them on the... Oh, I don't want to... I to save them for the plane. I'll just take them. Just, just so we can maybe use them here. It's so hard to know what to do on this, man. It's so hard, man. Yeah, people saying acid. I mean, even if I just use a few to just weaken them a little. Right, my bad. Let me just quickly um, do that lever again so we can get back across. Fruit Ninja, that was. What, just knife only? Can you imagine a knife only? Hell no. <laughs> right, let's do that again. Oh, what? Oh, I wondered how, I even, how I'm even meant to get back. Do I have to take a... Is there an elevator to get back? Oh, okay. My bad. I'll, I'll give it a go, uh, Bearded Dad. I did see that. It, there's like a box in the way, isn't there? Let's have a little look. Oh no, I don't think I can push that. Oh, hang on. Can't even. Now they're stacked, aren't they? Can't, I can't. Uh, can I push that off? No, I can't like do anything with them, can I? Maybe I have to go and, and sort that. Giovanni, thank you for dropping the rose, mate. Appreciate that. Oh, do we have to do something with these boxes then? And into the lip. Push the box down. So that's push. Push it down then into the. Can't I, like get to it. Oh, hang on. Oh, I didn't really see that. We do it like there or something. Push it like to the end. I think that's done it. 
For some reason, I thought the boxes were longer. I don't know why I thought that. Oh, nice. Awesome. Thank you, guys. So that's done. Oh, shit. Until detonation. Oh, I hate timers. I hate this. Oh, bro, this is awful. I know, I, I would have loved to have sit in and watch the uh, zombie voice actors, especially. I'd, I'd love to watch the OG voice actors. Yeah, especially the zombie ones. I'll weaken him with a few acid rounds, then I'll turn to the uh, the explosive rounds. Right, I'm trying to think where to go. I don't know where about to go. Um, back there. I know it sounds stupid, guys, but I don't know where to go. Um, just bear with me. I, I can't. It's proper through me, because I hate when it just throws you about place. I, I'd already backtracked, aren't I? Right, so we need to go... So back this way, in it, Because you go past the palace and then to the submarine. Got it. And where's the time it's going to come up? Oh, bollocks. There's Tyrant of the Night, guys. Let's go. Look at that Tyrant freaking booty. Who's this ugly mug? Right, we'll just use a few, then we'll go on to get the explosives. Let's go. Shit, I'm gonna have to go a bit, a bit close to this. Oh, nice, we got him. Oh, nice, the music's gone. I think we got him. Freaking go, guys! G freaking G! Yeah, it's a tyrant on the aircraft, it which ain't gonna be good. Only first form, babe. Whew. Don't hate the stream, I hate the tyrant, baby. Alright, if I get the opportunity, I'll uh, I'll make a save. And I'll give it a go at the tyrant aircraft. It, it would be a bonus if I can get this done tonight and then we ain't got to worry about it on the next stream. That'd be sick. Is that it? Have we, have we got there? Cheers, Amson. Go on, lass. Yeah, Prime says, uh, nice and clean. It said, um, now on the plane, three BOW ammo and four acid and then fire the box. Thank you, man. I'll give that a go. Yeah, I will for sure. Oh, that poor fish, man. That Can we spare a moment? That poor fish in the tank, just fucking floating around, just swimming around, not knowing what the fuck's going on, man. The poor fish. <laughs> Thank you for the follow, Prime. Appreciate you, man. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to make one more save before the... Uh, the tyrant boss of the air. Took so long. I was starting to get worried. No time to explain. Let's go. Right. We're out of here. Time to say goodbye to this death trap. Let's go. Woo. 
Oh man, I am well happy with tonight's approach. We're freaking smashing it, man. Let's go. We made it! Yahoo! Uh, it's finally over. <laughs> Don't say that. You never say that in a Resi game. You know it's never finally over. Claire, I'm sorry. I know I caused a lot of trouble for you. Yeah, you're an no, asshole, mate. It's okay. It was hard for both of us. Well, I really hope you find your brother. I... I know what it's like to be alone. Oh, Steve. Oh, Steve. And he said I'm sorry. <clears throat> so, where should we go now? I can take you anywhere you want to go, Claire. Take me to Nando's and then leave me there. <laughs> I hear Hawaii leave me the is fuck nice alone. Time of year. You got it. <laughs> <laughs> I could easily go in Nando's with you guys right now. Easy teleport us all to Nando's right now and we can chill with an awesome Nando's after a sick stream. Your oh, fault. Is open. Because oh, you said it it's Thanks. finally over. I've unlocked the cargo room door. It's all your fault, dickhead. <laughs> Saying it's finally over when it clearly is fucking not. Alrighty, these must be good, man. These BOW gas rounds. It's gotta be good. As if you only get three of them. Oh, bottomless cola for days, Zav. I love it. Love having as much drinks as I want. Man, I want some Nando's halloumi right now. And then a bit of lemon and herb chicken, peri salted chips, and then some garlic bread. And then a little, like, cheesecake or something after, you know. Hell yeah. Alright, guys. Uh, oh, I've not got much help. I could have really brought a bit more, but I was feeling optimistic. We'll, we'll see how we go. Nando's halloumi. That's the best halloumi I've tasted. I wasn't even that into halloumi until I tasted Nando's halloumi. Oh man, I'm gonna get absolute flashbacks. I've not, I've not come up against him in like ten years or so, half of my lifespan ago, like fifteen years or something. Fucking hell! Oh guys, this fills me with the fear. I hated being on here. It was horrible. I've lost my absolute shit with this. Right. Right, that's the three used. Ow, 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 ow. Get off, get off, get off. Oh, you man, we're already on the caution. Oh, fucking hell. Oh, man, I'm trying to get round him. I'm fucking... Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. I'll get a few explosives on him and then we'll... Uh... Well, Fox try Oscar and press that switch. Oh, man, we're on dirty caution as well. See if we can make this last a sec. I was hoping to. Fuck. Get up! Oh, I was hoping to stun him, like knock him on his knees by now, but this might work. Yes, he's gone off! Fuck you, Tyrant, fuck you! Come on! 
Let's fucking go! A hundred years the first time I've done this on this fucking part of the game! Yes! Oh man, that's the first time in my life, in my 30 years of existing on this app, I've done this unaided. I've done this once, but it was by the help of one of my best mates, Charlotte. So shout out to you, Charlotte, for back in the day. I'll, I'll show her this clip. But holy shit, is this the first time I've ever done this unaided? Holy shit, she would be proud of me. Thank you guys for the GGs. Appreciate you, we made light work of Tyrant there. Fuck you, Tyrant, fuck you! Hell yeah. And chill. You know what? It's, it's not too bad actually. Once you know what, what to wrong? use, oh, fuck for that. Just a giant cockroach that had to be stepped on. What's happening? Took a I little thought... damage, but the plane just changed direction on its own. That's it, Sam. Just another day at the office. Fucking GG. Yeah, I think it's it could have been a bit I smoother. Um, I, I should have ran around control. a bit more. I was a little more focused on spamming. You escape now. <laughs> Alfred, you cross-dressing freak. Has he got his arms round her? Oh no, I don't think he has, has he? No. He's loving it, isn't he? I just want to take her to Nando's. I'll have a hot chicken as well. I'm not gonna have lemon and herb like that pussy host on TV. I can handle spice. <laughs> Don't you dare. I was gonna say, but I'm literally covering my mouth up right now. Claire be so thankful that like you just turned your head just then. Whoa. <laughs> He's pissed just hitting the window. <laughs> Gotta protect us from those cooties, Sam. I know what Steve Coot is, and neither hey, do you guys. Where are we? Huh? Latitude 82.17 degrees. The Antarctic. We're over the Antarctic. What? Oh, guys, we have jetted off to the Antarctic hey, tonight. Those are the seaplanes that left the island right before us. Let's freaking then go. That must mean this place belongs to Umbrella. Snowball fight, guys. Dibs getting Steve in the bollocks. <laughs> yes, yeah, save first half end data. Fuck yeah. Let's go, guys. We are stopping the stream right here. We are ending on the highest high we could possibly fucking have on this game. Woo! We defeated the airplane tyrant. That's the first time I've done that unaided. Fuck for that, guys. Hell freaking yeah. Oh man. Oh. Hey, wake up, Steve. Oh. Oh. We're still alive. I thought he was going to jump down the actual fucking drop then. <laughs> oh, do we have to? No means no, Steve. I want your cooties. I don't want to smell your fucking... What do you call it? Old Spice. I've got Lady Million on, baby. I reckon he wears this one called Brute as well. I bet he wears Brute or Old Spice or something. Oh, uh, <coughs> the plane's trashed. 
Well, let's split up and find another way off this oversized freezer. Right. Okay, let's do it. I had to cover up uh, just while we was around Steve. Yeah, I, I reckon so, Nath. I reckon uh, Steve's definitely got either Lynx Africa or I reckon he'd push it to have the Lynx chocolate one. I bet he'd be like, bitches love chocolate. If, if I were chocolate, they'd be all over me. <laughs> but Nave, thank you for stopping on in. Man, we're doing great, thank you. And um, also to Becca, thank you for stopping on in. Uh, don't worry about missing so much. Obviously, um, I'm coming off right now, so um, I think the video will go for a little processing... Um, you know, uh, process thing, or what, I don't know what to fucking say. It, it'll go through a bit of processing, and then obviously it'll be available to watch over on my YouTube. So, uh, for you guys who don't know, we are multi-platform streaming. I'm Holster TV over on YouTube and TikTok. Holster TV, mate, over on Twitch. Uh, guys, I didn't get a chance to thank you for all your GGs um, after uh, that boss fight. So, thank you very much. we got Jordan Roscoe, uh, UBCS, David, Tyler Robbins, uh, Dave Priest. Um, thank you so much um, over on the tubes. And then over on TikTok, we still got Sam... Teetle, um we got uh, Zamf, uh, Becca, Paul Brown. Thanks very much, guys, for being in. I do appreciate all the GGs. Uh, everyone who stayed up tonight, because we have done a whopping five and a half hour stream from 9 p.m. until almost 2.30 p.m. So thank you very much, guys, uh, for being in tonight. I'm gonna, I'll am gonna, i return tomorrow evening. We'll do another few hours on this, obviously. It's not going to be as long as tonight, because I am up at the crack of dawn on Monday. Uh, but yeah, thank you. Um, and I agree, Sam. If I just want to say to Sam, yeah, she said Steve's little uh, neck choker gives me the ick. And then uh, I think Sam who said uh, Steve just Steve gives me the ick. And, like no, no shit, man. I definitely, I definitely agree with you guys. But honestly, he looks like uh, Steve looks like he's about to go in Squid Game or something. And he's uh, he's got a little self destruct tag on if he fucks up. <laughs> it's a shame it's not like one of them kind of dog tags where you can give them a little electric shocks, but. I, I definitely did not enjoy the, the sleazy Steve parts just then. Freaking, I'll protect us from the freaking cooties, man. But guys, thank you so much for being in. Um, I actually feel very um, relieved that we've streamed uh, some Code Veronica because I was like, I wasn't like dreading it. I was just a little bit like, oh, how is this going to pan out? Because like, I, I know I won't do the smoothest stream of this. I was a bit like, holy shit, I don't know how well this is going to go. But honestly, I think it's gone as well as it could have done. I'm so relieved to have got the tyrant fights, especially obviously the the aircraft fight um which i've done for the first time uh unassisted in my 30 years so uh yeah thank you uh for being here guys j-rex thank you uh for stopping it said i'm here for the raid thank you guys uh, we're just gonna go and raid out over on um over on uh twitch right now uh we'll go raid lord vash he's actually um i think i mentioned this before um he's the very first youtuber not even live streamer youtube um content creator i ever saw um and it and I, I actually talk to him and stuff now and it, it's crazy i've got to know him i talked to him and it, back in um even before 2016 i found him about nine years ago so almost a decade ago i i wanted to watch some resident evil gameplay on youtube i searched for original resident evil 2 and he came up loved his vibe never even seen him he just does commentary over uh, the gameplays and i was like oh my god i want to be like this guy and he, he was literally the the very first inspiration behind me wanting to make content and stream so it's absolutely trippy literally a decade on we can raid each other we chat to each other across the platforms he sometimes stops in our stream and it's crazy it's crazy how things map out uh, but yeah we'll go and he's, he's actually playing a bit of a party game right now he's not doing a resident evil tonight but he's doing party animals so please go and show vash uh, the love tonight guys and i will be in uh, the stream uh, very soon with you guys so uh, thank you very much uh, people on Twitch for being here, I'll see you tomorrow evening for a few more hours of Code Veronica take care guys on Twitch as always and I'll see you in a bit, take care guys so we've got to raid it out on there guys we'll uh, make sure that raid goes over I'm going to go offline over on the Tiki Talk thank you very much to you all for being in uh, for all for the um, for the uh, what was going to say, the diamonds, the roses you guys have uh, dropped tonight and uh, all the likes and shares and the new followers in and all our uh, usual suspects the usual crowd in tonight i appreciate you all you always turn up um but yeah not a problem guys uh good night to yourself zamf teetle becca said uh, sad i miss most but we'll catch up yeah you guys can always catch up on all my previous streams over on youtube and sam as well see you tomorrow good night to you all on tiktok and uh yeah see you tomorrow evening for a few more hours of code veronica thank you so much for your support as always take care and enjoy the rest of uh this morning or evening wherever you guys are and uh yeah i'll catch you tomorrow love you guys good night all right guys i'll get us over to our chill and chat screen right now
Alexa, open my side. There we go. Guys, that, that has gone as freaking smoothly as possible tonight. Fuck. What a freaking stream. Thank you very much, guys, for your support over on YouTube. Um, for Code Veronica, this has been a very well-requested Resident Evil um, to stream, and I've been really cautious about this one. I've been like, oh, my God, I don't know how smooth the gameplay is going to be. Um, yeah, thanks to your guys as well. You, like, you guys across the platform, you, you have given me advice throughout, um, which has been hugely beneficial. So, yeah, uh, massive thank you all again. Uh, new subscribers, if you haven't already, uh, if you don't mind uh, dropping a cheeky like on the stream, guys, it helps us a ton in that algorithm. Uh, yeah, we are literally, we're, we're gradually growing, like, with every stream, so I can't be more grateful for your guys' continued support. Uh, but, yeah, uh, good night to uh, yourselves. Uh, Dave uh, said, awesome stream. Oh, thank you. Uh, Tyler Robbins as well. Uh, so good night, Holster. Hope to catch you tomorrow as I do work Sunday night to Monday morning. If I can't catch you live, uh, good luck and have a blast. Thank you for being here, mate. Uh, take care. So I hope you have a good shift. And like you say, feel free to drop in at any time uh, if you get a chance. Uh, David said, Cheers, Hall. Thanks for sharing and hopefully catch you tomorrow. And Jane G says, Good night, Holly. See you later. Thank you, guys. You absolute freaking legends. Um, but yeah, thanks for still being here so late at night. But yeah, thanks so much again for your continued support. And I'll see you tomorrow night. Take care of yourselves, guys. Have a good sleep. Enjoy the rest of your morning and rest of your day tomorrow. And I will join you uh, very shortly over on, not even Rockford Island. Uh, I'll see you in Antarctica tomorrow. Hell freaking yeah. Good night, guys. Love you all. Holster TV out from Antarctica.